Hey, Pete. I'm working on a college application, and it says I gotta tell them about myself. More like sell yourself. It's the worst. You got any advice? Well, take me. Hi, I'm Peter Parker. I'm 25 years old, I have a bachelor's degree in biophysics, and I'm in love with the greatest woman ever. <laughs> Humble brag. Who is the best journalist in this city. Word. Go, MJ. I try to live up to the example set by the other greatest woman ever, my Aunt May. Humble brag again. Damn. And a while back, I was bitten by a radioactive spider and got superpowers. I, I can't put that in my essay. Hey, I'm laying the track as I drive the train. <clears throat> I've used my powers to help the city and stop a lot of people who wanted to hurt it. Like my mentor, Dr. Otto Octavius. His lab got shut down by an old colleague, Norman Osborne. Otto retaliated by releasing a bioweapon. In the end, I managed to stop Otto. But not without great cost. That was pretty good. But I'm no Peter Parker. Exactly. You're Miles Morales. You're 17 years old and a student at Brooklyn Visions Academy. What else? I guess I <clears throat> help out with my mom's work in Harlem every now and then. She's Councilwoman Rio Morales. And there is a girl I like who's spectacular and inspiring. And I think is one of the best artists in the city. And I also got bitten by a radioactive spider that gave me superpowers. I learned how to be a Spider-Man from the OG. But I learned how to be a hero from my dad. He was killed by Martin Lee in the City Hall bombing. The good I try to do every day is the good my dad planted in me. But it's been hard. Even with superpowers, sometimes we can't save the people we love, no matter how hard we try. A hero is someone who doesn't give up, though. And I don't plan to. I don't know, man. I can't talk about me without talking about Spider-Man. Sure you can. You just have to... Uh... Yeah, why don't you just start another draft? Be ready. Are you good? Promise me something. Anything. If this doesn't work, take me out. It'll work. I don't have a lot of time left. I want a chance to say goodbye. I'm not going to lose you. I will never let you go. Have a bell for a reason? Take your seats. I'm here! Good morning, class. We have a new teacher joining us today. Hi. My name's Pete. My, 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 my Mr. Mr. Parker, uh, and we are all very lucky today because this is physics class and physics is awesome. <clears throat> Ever wonder how some insects and uh, birds, reptiles can just run right across a pond? Two words, 
surface tension. Bathroom? Okay. Now, surface tension is all about cohesion. Hmm? Okay. Now, in equation form, surface tension, gamma, can be calculated as the force exerted parallel to the surface of a liquid. F divided by the length, L, of the line over which the force acts. Can anybody? Uh, I, I, I need your help. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Mr. Morales, is it? Uh, are you sure this isn't something you can handle yourself? I'm sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay, class. Uh, read chapter four or five or whatever. Miles, I need this job. If the principal comes back and sees I'm gone, I'm gonna get fired. I know, but you gotta see this. Day. I'm so getting fired. Principal Evans already hates me for being late this morning. Bro, I told you to be on time. It's fine. I'll be back before we know it. Good, because I have my college application review with the school counselor. Oh, you finished your essay? I haven't started. Oh, well, let's get to the city and take care of Marco quick then. Hey, MJ. Hey, guys, you might want to get downtown fast. Swing it through Brooklyn. Jameson had you on the ground for the bugle? Still can't believe old Triple J is your new boss. <laughs> really loving the new regime. You'll whip him into shape in no time. So, what's up with Marco? It's been years since our last showdown. According to witnesses, he was running down Broadway yelling nonsense. They say he seemed angry and, and paranoid, delusional. He just exploded. Man, hopefully we can calm him down. I've seen people lose control like this. Be careful. Good thing there too, Spider-Man now. Good luck. Thanks, MJ. Might need the new tech we've been cooking up too. No way. They're untested. Barely prototypes. But you brought them, right? No comment. Not 
before he broke the max suit. He's not the only one. Sandman just puked out some new friends. What the? He can do that? Apparently. Need you now. Mr. Parker? I'm sorry, who's this? Principal Evans. Of course, Principal Evans. All students have evacuated their classrooms. Where are you? Uh... Mr. Parker! I just... Forgot! Something in my car! What was that? Nothing! I'm just... I mean, uh, I'm just running back right now. Get back here and supervise your students, or else. That does not sound good. Otto's old research really came through for these arms. Almost there. How you holding up? Uh, Miles? Principal Evans called. Man, am I getting expelled? Hey, you're just cutting class. I abandoned students during a citywide emergency. Yeah, you're through. Zen Man. I always hated that name. I know you're angry at me. This has nothing to do with you. Leave me alone! I want to help you. But it's gonna hurt first. Think we got him right where we want him? I 
Even I may have spoken too soon. And he's definitely getting bigger. Keep climbing. We're so close. The water tank. Spider-Man? I just wanted to live normal, like everyone else. This isn't the way, Marco. For a guy like me, there is no other way. I just wanted a regular life. You can still have one! It's too late now. Oh man! Marco just makes sand castles instead. Ma, everything okay? I'm a chief. I know. You're on every channel. I'm heading downtown to help coordinate resources and supplies. Is Genki covering for you at school? He is. But I got this meeting with my counselor later, and the principal thinks Listen, that I'm. I can talk to your principal. But New York needs you right now. Coolest mom ever. And please be careful. Like Ma said, can't let New York down. My essay. I get into any college I wanted. Or Spider-Man would. Right. Brainstorm later, Mouse. Focus. Wings? They're flying! 
But we're not out of this yet. Marco's in Pier 4 Beach. What happens if he gets all that sand? Pinky just did! Gonna need you ASAP, Miles! Yeah, I see him all right. I'm right behind you. I'm... Miles? Miles! What did I just get myself into? You gotta calm down, Marco! Innocent people are in danger! You care about them, but not me. They wouldn't listen to Marco, but they can't ignore Sandman. It's gonna be okay. I haven't been okay for a long time. If you need help, all you have to do is ask. You're the ones who are gonna need help when they come for you.
are slow in your old age, Sergei. A fate you will not share. I've been in your shadow for hours, but you sense nothing. Light the fires. The great hunt begins. Seeing this? Hold on a sec, Miles. I got it. You're gonna be safe. Yeah, same here. Hey, Genki? I know, I know. The whole city's telecom network is down. What's happening to the requests that are coming in? They'll all get queued, but... Wait. Uh, I'm gonna try a workaround. Work fast. <laughs> right before the app went down, I saw a request for help at Liberty and Broadway. Headed there now. What a mess! Marco, what got into you? There they are. I've got you. Hold on. You okay? I am now. Thank you. Spider-Man, Chief needs your help. Spider-Man, got a minute? Got a call with the precinct up ahead and the line cut out. We gotta get through to set up triage. On it, Chief. That did it. Uh, Mr. Parker, I need your help to get the app back online. What do you need? Get to the roof of the building on Worth and Lafayette. What's the plan? It's gonna be hours before the telecom network's back up, so... We're gonna create our own network. That's a big job. How long have you been planning this? Well, dreaming about it since seventh grade, but planning, uh, for the last two minutes or so. There should be a launcher around there. What is all this stuff? Environmental study by a new startup. The launchers for high altitude weather sensors. And this startup gave us permission? Yes. I checked with the head guy. Super nice. Seemed excited about helping out Spider-Man. Okay, tell me what to do. You've still got that 3D printer built into your web shooters, right? I need you to build something real quick. Just sent you the blueprints. Got him. This looks like a drone. We don't spy on people, Genki. Oh, no, no, no. It's all opt-in. Just New Yorkers sending messages to the app, which gets routed through these drones which I call 
Focused Relay Neighborhood Data Spots. F-R-N-D. Did I just make a friend? You did. <laughs> Seventh grade me was so wholesome. Okay, now, how do we get this thing airborne? There's a lot of competing signal traffic, so try to follow the path I marked on your visor. It'll give us a clearer signal. Network should be online. Let me notify the app users. Reports should start coming in any minute now. We did it! Back in business. Crime report just came in. Back it up. Let's go. Come on. We got plenty of time. Cops are busy with all this sand stuff. So let's clear this place out. Come on, load them up. Stealing weapons? Not on my watch! Stick to the plan! Try when you've already lost! Whose idea was it to have a gun club in the city? I think I'm gonna start a petition. Replace all the gun clubs with something better! Is it gonna be good? Like a compliment club! Compliments don't hurt anyone, and they're free! For example, you take a punch really well. Good job. Here come the exterminators, Spider. Hey, I think I'm onto something. Less guns, more compliments. You I'm gonna get hit. That was a big crew, taking advantage while the city's covered in sand. I wish I knew what got into Marco. More of them coming. Let's give him a warm welcome, Spidey style. Sometimes. Just keep looking for people to help. Now you sound like you're angry. I'm not angry, Miles. Just focus. That's what my mom always says when she's angry. Come on. You've known me for a long time. When have you ever seen me angry? Uh, I'm thinking. It was a rhetorical question. Got it. That one time we were playing a board game at your place and you kept losing. I wasn't angry at you. 
I was angry at the universe! Okay, the new app is compiling. I figured as long as we're at it, we might as well give it an upgrade. We don't need anything fancy. We just need to see citizen reports. Totally. While the patch is updating, we should widen the net. Let's check in with Miles. Over there. She was having trouble breathing. Miles, you busy? What do you need? Get to the roof of that building nearby. Yo, you sounded stressed earlier. You doing okay? Yeah, there's just a lot going on, and I'm hungry, and the vending machine only has those plain low sodium table crackers. Oh man, that sucks. I'll manage. Hey, so I'm finally doing that app upgrade I've been talking about with a little help from my friends. <laughs> that's, that's a brilliant pun that doesn't make sense to you yet, but it will in a minute. Okay, I'm here. There should be a launcher somewhere around there. I don't see anything that looks like a launcher. Maybe it's under the sand? Okay, I see the launcher. Now what? You're gonna 3D print a friend. Get it now. F-R-N-D. Let me guess. Friendly Relay Network Drone. Close, but it doesn't really matter. What matters is that it uses spatial and temporal correlated signals. Over-the-air computation? You're a genius, Genki. Oh, you. I marked a path for optimal network stability. If you stay in the path, we'll get a stronger signal. Network is connected. New crime report. I see it. On my way. Boy said Spider Man was at the gun club. Gotta move before he gets here. <sighs> Hey, need a hand? Lost your keys? There's a locksmith up the street. I dare you. 
All of you guys are for one armor card? Seems like overkill. What if instead of stealing you, I don't know, tried to help rescue people? In the air! Cut him down! Spider-Man's throwing stuff! Finally updated. Check it out. Ooh, nice work. New request just came in. Genki, nice yeah. work on the app. This will help a lot of people. Thanks. Miles, let's hit these last requests and get back to school. Check it out. Sandman again. Did he escape already? No, I'm at the raft. He's right in front of me. I have a hunch. Sit tight. Let me talk to his doctors. Okay, now you pissed me off. Okay, I talked to the doctors. Is there a sand crystal thingy near you? Yes! Okay. The doctors say Marco's mind is broken. Literally shattered into pieces. Freaky! So why are these sand dudes attacking me? Probably bits of his subconscious trying to protect whatever's in that crystal. But listen, if you can find all the pieces, they say you might be able to make him whole again. Being a sand person sounds complicated! OK, 
Okay, Marco. What was your subconscious protecting? One minute I was with you, and the next, you were gone. A talking crystal? Okay. Seems like it holds a part of Marco's memory. MJ said that there were more crystals scattered around the city. Gotta keep an eye out. Hey, you wanna grab that last request? Looks like some VIP stuck in a limo. On it. Yankee, is Mr. Sumita still there? Yeah, he's with Haley right now. She's trying to stall him for you. Nice. Hopefully he's gonna tell me how to write my college essay. You're not done with that yet? You know, since I already got into ESU, I can help you. Nah, you do too much already. Plus, if you help me get into college, you never shut up about it. Yeah, that's true. Limo. Ah! It's the spider. Get him. Nars, paparazzi's bad enough. A paparazzi with guns? Y'all are the worst. You know that? Why can't we all just let people be people? Look out! He's up there. Let's check on that person in the limo. Gotta come see who the VIP in the limo was. I shudder in anticipation. Sealing a hydrant, then I'm on my way. Mr. Jameson, it's Spider-Man. Are you with me? Flying in. On your left. Hey, Spider-Man. Look who it is. What? Uh, where am I? Spider-Man! Jonah, my sunshine. You okay? Help! I've been abducted! What? No, I, I, I'm helping you, man. Someone get a photo with us. Mass criminals kidnap beloved newsman. Some things never change. Just be nice to the doctors. No, oh, they kidnapped me. I did not consent. I, I, oh. uh, menaces. I'm surrounded by menaces. But J. Jonah Jameson is not going anywhere, you hear me? I'm not going anywhere! Wait, where am I going? Where am I going? Mr. Parker, where are you? Uh, Principal Evans. Hi. Yes, this is me, Peter Parker. I, I'm sorry, there was an emergency and I... I'll, I'll be there soon, I promise. I better see you in 10 seconds or... Oh, no. Um, are, you're uh, breaking up. I, well, soon. I can't believe I just did that. <sighs> Where's Mr. Sumida? Oh, he just left. Something about going on vacation? What? That's incredible, Haley. Also, while you were gone, I found out that I got the Rand Scholarship. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> yeah. Bro, that's like a full ride. Well, big day for everyone. I'm really missing out. Oh, man. I can't watch this. But 
I also can't look away. Hmm. Principal Evans. Yeah. Guess who decided to show up today? I, I know this looks terrible. Looks? And I, I'm, I'm so sorry. It's more than looks. No, I know, I know, I know, I know. This and is this is the last ridiculous. thing that I wanted to happen, and it'll never happen again. I've had enough of this. No, I look. No I, more excuses. Your job is to protect these students, not to abandon them. You're fired. Dude, you being Spider-Man must be so hard keeping a job. Uh, but I'm sure that you're gonna figure it out. about the job. You weren't the worst teacher we've ever had, if that helps. Think I can put that on my resume? Well, listen. There's an open photo claw at the New York Bulletin. I just sent a shot in yesterday. It's not much money, but it's money. That's Robbie Robertson's paper. We used to work together at the Bugle. I think I know just what he'd like. Thanks, Miles. No problem. I might send him a few more shots, too, if I have time. Robbie always said, don't show me the city, show me New York. That's something. <laughs> there. Now to submit and... Peter! How you doing, son? Robbie, hi! I know this is out of the blue, but I wanted to let you know I just sent in a photo for your open call. Wonderful. We can definitely run this. I gotta duck into a meeting. But if you find the beating heart of New York anywhere else, send him my way. It's good to hear from you. You too, Robbie. Thanks. Always talked about going here. She'd walk across the bridge every Sunday to get the freshest vegetables in the city. But one time, she was late, and the guy in front of her bought all the tomatoes. And that's how she met my grandpa.
not bad. <laughs> Is that? Oh, 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 man. I haven't been there in years. When we were at the Bugle's old office, we'd hide out here whenever Jonah was about to blow. <laughs> I finished a lot of assignments sitting at that bar. And a lot of grasshoppers. <laughs> My suit is sandy in all the wrong places. Might be time for a change. Is that good? If it's great, post it. If it's not, let it die. Okay, you can send it to me. And also, am I prominent in the picture? I do represent large <laughs> Looks like one of Marco's... Haha, <laughs> the bodega beef. It was already a rivalry for the ages when it was just David versus Goliath. But when Tails had to deal with the bodega copying his success by using the exact same mascot, it stepped up to a whole nother level. again? Time to check out that crystal. Someone's watching us, Kimia. But I don't want you to worry. That's my job. Marco thought he was being watched. And who's Kimia? Was being attacked. Better hurry. Okay, you should have yourself. Hope you don't mind me interrupting here. You're done now. Please don't leave me. There's an ambulance nearby. I can take you to it. Oh my god, thank you!
We're close. You're doing great. Here you go. And now you're in much better hands. Bless you, Spider-Man. because of all the articles about his new flavors, but his traditional ones would have kept me coming back. Sometimes a classic is a classic for a reason. Hey, MJ. Hey, I'm headed to your place to drop something off. Is the back door unlocked? I don't know. Left in a hurry this morning. I'll just meet you there. Okay, cool. You and Miles get back to school, okay? Yep, yep. Quite a first day for you. Hopefully tomorrow will be quieter. I am sure it will be. See you in a bit. Uh, what's worse than getting fired? Telling your girlfriend that you got fired. Without the tinkerer, they were picked apart like vultures. I'll let Miles know we can put this stuff to better use. was awful. Tan Man really made a mess. Seems like you're getting the hang of that thing. <laughs> well, it is convenient in the city, but I'm not convinced I'm a bike person. You convinced me. What's wrong? I got fired. excited about this job. I know. I had the whole semester planned out. Next week, we were gonna make a potato-powered helicopter. <sighs> I'm so sorry. I might be joining you in the unemployment line. Jonah already cleaning house? Sort of. He's instituting a radical meritocracy. <sighs> Yikes, what does that even mean? It means that whoever doesn't write a front-page story in the next week is fired. Oh, well, you'll be fine then, because you're the best reporter they have. What you got in there? <laughs> Unsold some Kariot books. Running out of storage at my place. But you got great reviews. I sold 14 copies. Nobody wanted to read about some Karia. The Bugle is the biggest outlet in the city. I can make a difference there. But if I get fired, I don't know what I'll do. Do you even need the bugle to do what you want to do? I 
tried making an impact from the outside and 14 copies. Now I, I need to change things from the inside. I haven't had time to clean. Back room? Yeah. I'm just gonna tidy up a bit. the house to keep beast afloat and now I'm sinking oh man I've been wanting to play this just need to find the time remember that the teaching thing didn't work out what's next you think I don't know to be honest I'd like to take some time off but can't really afford to. What about selling the house? I can't. I mean, I could, but I can't. If you need time, I can cover the mortgage. No, no, I can't let you do that. Plus, you said Jonah might clean house. I won't let him fire me. I know how much this house means to you. We'll figure it out. I don't deserve you. Hey, so, have you thought any more about moving in? We talked about this. I need to be in the city, close to where the action is. But think of all the romantic dinners we could have here. When was the last time you were home for dinner? Fair point. Hey, what's this? Is all this maze stuff? Yeah, I need to donate it, but not just yet. What are you looking at? Some pretty cute old photos of you. Man, I haven't seen these in a while. Huh. I think that was in my bedroom. Why did she take a picture of that? Balance. What does that mean? Wonder if this is still there. I'm gonna go take a look. Let me know what you find. I'm gonna keep looking at these photos you've never shown me. Ugh, adorable. Don't worry, May. I'll keep your wheat cake recipe alive and well. Where was that hole again? I, th I thought I, I heard a, a rat in the wall. Hey, what's, what's wrong? It's nothing. I was just... When I was your age, I was head of the debate club, captain of the soccer team, and second violin in orchestra. Every year, I wanted a new feather in my cap. 
But when I tried to add honor roll student on top, I fell apart. Instead of being good at a few things, I wasn't good at anything. So, I scaled back. Balance is a process, not a destination. I'm still working on that. Oh, come on. Come on. Maybe May had a point. I can't take too much on. Something's gotta give. I should go check on MJ. Oh man. It's you like a rogue wave sometimes. Still smells like May. This place could use some candles. People put candles in bathrooms, right? Just got a tip. Raf's moving a couple of inmates to Ravencroft tomorrow for evaluation. They say who? No, but I'm gonna find out. Ah! MJ! <laughs> Whoa. Doctors haven't cleared me for MJ hugs yet. Sorry. <laughs> Harry. I missed you. I missed you too. I heard about May. So sorry. So how was Europe? Yeah, sorry about all that. I was being treated in isolation here in the city, and I, I didn't want you guys to worry about me. Is it the same thing your mom had? It was. Past tense. We think it's in remission. Harry, this is... <laughs> I can't believe it. You look great. I feel great. Oh, I have to get to work. Dinner tomorrow? Coney Island? World time sake? It's a date. <laughs> <laughs> That's new. Yeah, it's a little skill she picked up when we were in Sakaria. Sorry for coming by unannounced and all. What? No, are you kidding? You want to come inside? Actually, I was hoping you might have time to go for a ride with me. Sure. I'm surprised the frugal flyer is still on the road. I was thinking we might roll like we used to. Ooh. Uh, is that my old bike? Nah, I, I found it on the internet. It's a close match though, right? Wow. Yeah. It's even got the same stickers and everything. You sure this isn't my bike? You ready? Yeah. Where are we going? You'll see. Come on. Try to keep up. You sure you're up for this? Oh, yeah. I'm feeling good. I was using the cane just for insurance, but I don't even need it. I think you have more energy than I do. So, tell me everything. What's been keeping you busy? Just substitute teaching in between getting fired. I've also been tutoring a high school kid. He's special. Reminds me a little me, actually. <laughs> Lucky kid. I never would have passed honors calc without your help. Hey, I read about your old boss, Dr. Octavius. That must have been crazy. That's one way to put it, yeah. I wish you'd been around. Harry, why didn't you tell me you were sick? I'd have been there in a shot. You wouldn't have liked what you'd seen. The treatment was horrible. 
I was floating in a tank with a healing agent. It gave me awful nightmares. A tank? Wow. Experimental stuff. That's intense. I'm really sorry, Harry. Wait, we're at Midtown High. Is that actually where we're going? I can neither confirm nor deny. Uh... This place looks exactly the same as it did 10 years ago. Oh. Come on. Why'd you bring us here? We both hated high school. Remember that time Flash and his buddies cornered me and broke my laptop? We lost that presentation. For the Young Entrepreneurs Competition. We'd worked for months on that thing. And the state meet was the next morning? I had a backup on a USB. But it was in your locker. We called the school begging to let us in. But they said no. It was after hours. We were so desperate, we walked around the entire school, <laughs> trying every door. <laughs> Until... We got to this one. Wait, what do you... I remember we had to jimmy it. <sighs> Shall we? The coast is clear. Come on. You sure the drive is upstairs in your locker? Pretty sure. What? You said you were sure. I was. I mean, I am. Uh, why are you asking now? I don't know. I'm nervous. Don't worry, it's there. Next up to bat is rookie all-star, number 12, Hold up. Eric Monticelli. It's right field, Rick. What's he doing here on Friday night? Listening to the game? RBI. Show us that rookie of the month stuff, kid. You're gonna be on this team forever. Folks, we're gonna see him around for a lot of years. The fans are putting the pressure on Just aim it at something loud. This recent home stretch. Bucket. And they're ah, too messy. Flash, get ready to be tackled. No, we need noise, not property damage. Hey <laughs> that was a nice defensive play. And we're gonna wind up back at the plate with two outs and the last player in the order. Come on. This is what criminals do. Am I a criminal now? Hey, forgot to tell you I showed our presentation to my mom. She thought it was really great. She had one critique, though. The name. She said we should rename it Heal the World. Holy cow, that's perfect. Right? Once we get to the top of the stairs, your locker's right there, right? Me back at the gym. Hey, who's that? We're in trouble. We're in trouble, Mayday. Someone in here playing tricks, huh? I could really use a refill on my web shooters. Wait, I think I have extra web fluid stuff in the photo lab. This is all still kind of new. I gotta get better at fluid management. Kids has gotta be around here. So, library to photo lab, photo lab to gym, Jim to locker. Easy. Path is clear. Time to move. What was that? Crap! Hey! Oh, I really wish I had backed this project up online. 
was definitely a kid. No such thing as the ghost of Midtown. Eating vents. The spider's best friend. Okay, where did I leave my web fluid stuff? Admit to a little bit of hero worship here. Ran into MJ right after this. Couldn't decide between hey or hi, so I said hey. -ay. Ugh. Harry and I climbed up a rusty hundred year old fire escape to get this shot. Totally worth it. ESU. Dr. Octavius is doing a guest lecture there next month. Gotta get tickets before it sells out. I know I put these under here somewhere. should figure out how to increase the capacity of these things so I don't run out. Now to meet Harry at the gym. Oh, the gym is on the other side of that fan. Gotta get past it. Old backpack. Forgot I put that here. Gotta start keeping track of these things. I can't get away from this guy. Gotta distract him so I can get out of here. me making a break for it. through the gym. Okay. It's all coming back. That was crazy. Well, this place looks the same. Except no security guard on our tails. Which gives us a minute for some hoops. Are you sure you're up for this? Question is, are you? Oh, let's see it, big talker. A little rusty. No biggie. All you? So happy you're feeling better. Seriously. Thanks. Hey, I didn't get a chance to see what you did with May's house. Nothing yet. I've been busy and I don't know. It feels weird to change it. I get it. That must have been really tough, Pete. No rush. Okay, here we go. Oh. 
Well, when MJ moves in, maybe she'll help with the house. I don't know. You don't think she'll help? I don't know if she'll move in. Oh. Huh. Well, I mean, it seemed like you guys were doing good. She was at your house? We'll figure it out. We always do. Eventually. What's the score? I have no idea. <laughs> me neither. <laughs> Thanks for bringing me here. I needed this. Me too. But we're not done yet. <laughs> I know that look. What are you up to? Still think you can find your old locker? Where do you think that security guard is? Probably still in the East Wing. Then let's get that thumb drive out of your locker and get out of here. We gotta make Flash pay for breaking your laptop. Just let it go. You can't just let him get away with it. He's captain of the football team, and I'm a backup singer in Glee Club. He's gonna get away with it. Our best revenge is to win that competition tomorrow. Finally. Quick, get under there. Gotta get him back in that elevator. I checked this floor three times already. That damn goose. What are you in there? What's going on? Touch is uh, this guy part of all this too? Nope. <laughs> Run. Hey! Dude, we're gonna get arrested. Not if he doesn't catch us. <laughs> <laughs> this is not the kind of nostalgia I like. <laughs> you still got that thumb drive? Yeah. Gotta make it to those doors. Almost there. Open up, it's the police. I called the cops. You're in trouble now. No, but hold them off for just a minute. I got an idea. What should I do? Don't get caught. Wait, I keep forgetting. Us? Yeah, they're in here somewhere. All right, you two spread out while we get this guy's statement. Now to get the guard alone so I can get the thumb drive back. They're in here somewhere. The guys are looking, but we need your statement. Tell me what you saw. Well, uh, right field brick. Uh, I mean, Whoa! have you actually seen? Well, have you actually seen them? <laughs> Not so much, but I've heard them. How can you be sure there's more than one? Shouldn't you be looking for them? They're probably getting away right now. What was that? This ought to get things rolling. Nice. Now I just have to distract this last guy. Don't move. I'll be right back. He's alone. Now for something I like to call the upside down pickpocket. These kids playing tricks. I got time. Nice nonsense. That should put me right above him. He's probably waiting up for me. Probably made some popcorn. That tea. Got it. Huh? What was that? Uh, now, how am I supposed to get out of here? I huh? just want to tell you how I'm feeling. 
Not the cops. It's my dad. Dad, I told you I'd call you when I got home. It's your mother. What happened? Uh, Peter. Would you excuse us for a moment? What is this? You know, I still think we would have won state if we'd presented. <laughs> Lots happened in the last 10 years. It's a miracle I'm even sitting here now. I got a second chance. And I'm gonna take advantage of that. But I need you with me, Pete. Wow, this is uh, a lot to process. Why don't you come by the lab tomorrow? Check it out. You have a lab already? I'll show you some of my ideas, and we can talk about it some more. Deal? Sure. Pete, we're gonna heal the world. You busy? I need whatever it is. I'm down. Need some help with a babysitting mission at the rack. Sounds fun. Fill me in on the way. How's the essay going? It's it's going. Uh, I'm gonna head out though. Pete, call for some backup. We're just. It's better if I don't know the details. I'll be fine, Ma. Espera un momento. 
Um, you know how there have been a few nights recently where you've been working late, and so I also worked late? Well, I wasn't working. Don't give me that look. I'm not in any trouble. It's just, um, I've been going on some dates. Dating, actually. Oh, right. And there's this one guy. I've seen him a few times, and it's, well, it's going well. Now, what are you asking me? I'd like to have him over. For Barcelona. I'm sure there's some spider stuff I can be doing. I can give you some privacy. No, I'd like him to meet you. And I'd like you to meet him. But if you're not comfortable, I totally understand. Ma. Look, you had me a pate alone. <laughs> I'll see you. Okay. Después. Better head to the raft. Maybe these wind tunnels can give me a boost. There's another one! I should catch that updraft! Another updraft! I should check the view! Love a windy day! Hey, Miles, I'm just getting to the raft. You on your way? Would have missed it. Who are babysitting? MJ got a tip yesterday that Scorpion's being moved to Ravencroft. Not enough resources for him since Sandman became his roommate. Scorpion can definitely throw a tantrum. I'll be there. Nice. Sometimes, I worry with all the terrible things that happened in our city. Hey, it's another one of Marco's memory crystals. Should take care of that. Sorry, guy. Didn't mean to wake you up. this crystal. Maybe I'm being paranoid, but everywhere I go, I see them too. Work, the corner store, in the park. They're tracking us. Marco was really freaked out. Wonder if whoever was following him is still out there. Hey friends, it's Danica. You are listening to the Danicast. 
Get this. Now the fastest growing podcast in New York. Hold on to your knickers, Jonah. I'm coming for the crown. For you new listeners, welcome. The Danacast is your spot for real takes on real news about real people. Did y'all hear about this train worker, Dennis, who single-handedly kept the trains running during the Sandman attack? The main track control booth got cut off by a power failure, and he had to patch in from his cell phone on a hotspot to keep the lines up. Thousands of people got evacuated to Queens and Brooklyn thanks to him. Dennis, we at Denicast salute you. Keep doing what you're doing. Perfect for Robbie. <laughs> I swear it, that's what she said. I mean, if I was rich, I'd take advantage of that backdrop too. I'd also be worried about constantly launching balls off the roof, but I guess they can afford it. Like I'm just in time. Keep it moving, Gargan. Ready for the next one. Next one? Thought we were just babysitting Scorpion today. for fireworks. We gotta go. Should have stretched. Your head will make a fine trophy. Whoa, those blades are sharp. You must be new in town. Hi, I'm Spider Man. In case you didn't know, these guys are bad news. Definitely want to keep them in prison. Get out of our way. It does not concern you. All right, guess we can skip the welcome wagon. Incoming! Stop that night, Jersey! Spider-Man! Who the hell are these guys? I was hoping! 
something you knew! We'll cover you! Keep them out of the ship! On it! Fire, you fool! Take out the defenses! Now.
Spider-Man, you gotta get topside! As soon as I get everyone clear! You okay in there? I'm trying to get out. I'm looking for civilians on the way. It's bad, man. What happened out there? Did those guards get to safety? Hello? No signal. You better hurry up. Whoa! It's getting worse out there. I'll get you out! Eyes on Scorpion.
We got him. No, Lee! Lee! You cannot escape! What is this? I've been empowered. I can barely control it. Spider-Man! They got me! Scorpion 2! I'm after them now! Miles! Do you think you can handle Lee? I can turn around right now! No! I got this! Go on! Are you sure? I can't let him near my family again! Not after what he did to my dad! I have to protect them! They need me, man! Nothing will happen to your family! Nothing! You got this! I'll be back soon! I've got this! Get back here! <laughs> went from bad to each river on fire bad. That's... Well, okay. I'm on my way. We'll deal with Scorpion later. Come on! Come on! It won't start! I got you! Hang on to something! with 
these guys beating on me. We've got it. How many times I gotta tell you people? Lee stays with me! Got him for that! First responders are on site now, at least. Police are still fishing, but there's no sign of them. Any luck up river? Nothing but debris. Who are those guys? Whoever they are, they're packing some serious tech. And now they got all that, plus Scorpion and Lee. Hey, whatever they're planning, we'll find them. We'll stop them. Yeah. Pete. When I saw Lee inside that ship, my powers, they... You think his energy got entangled with yours? I don't know, man. But it feels volatile. Wherever Electric Blue came from, it saved the day back there. Hey. We'll put Lee back where he belongs. Promise. Don't leave me hanging. I'm trying to soak over here. Not on my watch. Come on. <laughs> You're too much, man.
Hey, Miles. Getting used to hearing that voicemail of yours. Dropped you a pin. Wanna come through? Hey, Uncle Aaron. What? Too busy to visit your fam? Nah. I was just giving you space after you got out. Don't need it. Besides, we gotta settle some things. We do? See you soon, kid. Just go see him and get it over with, Miles. Then we focus on whoever took Lee and Scorpion. Something tells me they're planning something big. This trouble for a little Christmas. So I told the cops that someone's out to get us, but they don't listen to me. No one ever does. Time to take matters into my own hands. I haven't seen Marco in years. I would have been there for him if I knew he was in trouble. Hey, I was just talking to my source at the raft. Marco's been belligerent and incoherent since he got there, but they said he's starting to show signs of improvement. Whatever you're doing with those crystals, keep it up. Another day, another disaster befalls our beautiful city. And guess who's to blame? In what should have been a routine prison transfer, the Spider-Men felt the need to inject themselves into a situation that was already being handled by the proper authorities and completely botched it. A new group of mercenaries made their presence known in the hijacking of the supervillain Scorpion. <laughs> Say what you will about social media, and I can say a lot. It's helped so many businesses stay afloat here when they would have gone under a long time ago. Crystal's mine this time. Yeah.
this crystal. It's my turn to follow them. Figure out who they are. I end up at this abandoned school in Harlem. And I'm already beginning to regret this. Marco thought no one else could help him. Feel for the guy. You really gotta do this with the mask on? Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Kid? Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. You getting some? How did you... And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. I've heard this dude can turn your brain into scrambled eggs. Leave it alone. Now, what else is going on with you? Our school, college, anyone you like? I don't know. So there is someone. I'm here. What am I looking for? Just use your eyes, nephew. 
uploaded some Prowler code into your mask when I swiped it. Of course you did. The stash stays hidden until it detects the code from my suit. Last step is to decrypt the key. Give it a shot. Don't cheat. Take your time. Done. Not bad, kid. Another gate. Sweet. Can't pull it open from down here. made a decent problem. You should be seeing how to get inside now. Hmm. Got it. You want to finally tell me what this is? All suit prototypes. Feel free to keep it. Some good tech in there. Cool. Could definitely use this. Sounds like my tech is right up their alley. I want it falling into the wrong hands. You're the only person I trust with this. Okay. I got you. Coordinates are in the mask. Thanks, nephew. Don't be a stranger. Wonder what Ma's gonna say about this. Oye, Miles. Me enteré de lo que pasó con el transfer y con... Está bien. Sí, Ma. Todo bien. Está by you done to Uncle Aaron with some stuff. Ah. ¿Y cómo está él? Está trotando. Pues qué bueno. Mami, te veo en casa. And before you ask me again, estoy bien. Te lo juro. Te quiero. Let's head out into the city. See what's going on. Maybe even find Lee while I'm at it. <clears throat> Someone's playing with fireworks? Bad idea. Sorry, be right back. Fireworks? Better warn those guys they're illegal here without a permit before someone calls the cops on them. Remember? You go on your way? Oh, right. That's the day. Mr. Atlas is confirmed to be here. He's got the best music technology program in the state. And I heard he's talking scholarships. I have so many questions for him. Be there soon.
coordinates are showing a stash near the top of the Braxton building. How does he come up with this stuff? Send me after your cat. In the skyscraper. Ever heard of the Braxton Heist? Uh, no. Exactly. It was my debut score as the problem. First time working with the crew, too. We went in to steal prototypes from Braxton's secret tech division. But this kid double crossed us. Who? Never got a name. She was good. Pro. A thief in the truest sense of the word. Wasn't mad, though. It was a valuable lesson. Starting to get why you were dad's toughest case. <laughs> Still no sign of Lee. Or the gang that took him. Wonder if Pete's having better luck than me. <laughs> Maybe I should make some spider stashes around the city. Angle to pull that unit up. been watching way too many bad spy movies. No way Prowler crawled through those lasers without a fail safe. Something here has to deactivate that laser field.
There you are. Found my stash out in Hunter's Point. Prowler's first training ground. Wait, really? I had to test out my tech somewhere secret. How'd you get the hang of your problems? I actually did the same thing. <laughs> Maybe we all related after. Yeah, except you stole your tech and I got bitten by a radioactive spider. You know, you still owe me the whole story there. Because I've had a million spider bites. Never ended up walking on walls. <laughs> Sorry, spider code. Fair enough. Thanks for grabbing the stash, Keith. That was for you, Lex. Hey, do either one of you guys have a permit for those? but I'll get him to a hospital. I knew those fireworks looked shady. Is he gonna be okay? I think so. Looks like he's just unconscious, but I'm not taking any chances. Ah, where am I? Spider-Man? Don't worry, I'm taking you to a hospital. Also, for obvious reasons, I gotta tell you personal fireworks are illegal in New York. Uh, we didn't know. They're for our brother, Lex. We, we lost him a few years ago, and he always loved them. So we try to launch a few around his birthday. Oh, man. I'm sorry. Spider-Man? Wow. There. Staff here is great. They'll take good care of you. Thanks. Actually, wait. If those fireworks we bought were sketchy, Maybe you should check where we got them from. Some docks north of us between those two bridges. I think I know which place you mean. I'll take a look. Hey, just dropped my car. You thought I should check where y'all bought your fireworks from, too. The dock guys? That's a good call. But watch out. I know I saw two of them with guns. Like serious guns. I'll be careful. Thanks. Watch it next to that barrel. We can't make any money if our stock blows up. You want to do this? Get back to checking the guns and let me work my magic. Yeah! 
Happy birthday, Lex. Was that you? Oh, man. I hope Mike saw that from the hospital. Lex would have loved it. Hope y'all enjoy your time in New York. Stay safe. to do a better job hiding their stolen tech. No one left my backpack around here somewhere. Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, good to see you. Man, I can't believe Mr. Atlas is gonna be here at BV. Maybe one of those scholarships has my name on it. If he likes my sound. New reproductive technologies are on the horizon. Check it out on this brochure. We've got preventative contraception information. Please consult your parents and your primary care physician. They'll help you find what's right for you. Yes, those are free. Remember to stay safe. Miles, glad you made it. Oh, hey, Mr. Sinclair. Oh, hmm. I just love seeing all this innovation in action. Oh, have you heard about the chemistry club? They're filling in while Miss Ferguson gets ready to demo the new robotics drone. She's running late. The presentation's on the main stage. Oh, yeah. I'll try to make it over there. Enjoy the show. Thanks. See you around. Morales, the music master. What's up, Delisai? You here to see that university rep, Mr. Atlas? Yeah, definitely. Nice astronomy booth. Thanks. You should stop by later. I made a 3D model of Saturn, but get this. <laughs> it's cake! I'll save you a slice. Hmm, thanks. Hey, you made it. I want to talk to him about that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? That's just it. We don't know. She left to get something from her car and then never came back. I just heard two words. Missing in person, so I'm gonna say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. You. 
Gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I can find out more. Do you have any of her personal items? Yes. She left her phone behind. Is it unlocked? Have you seen any texts coming in or anything? Here we go. Just some notifications from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps, wherever she is. The students adore Miss Ferguson. I hope she's all right. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's missing. Oh, man. Sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. Wonder if I could find that signal. All right. Let's see where this fitness tracker is. Last known location, Dawson Harbor. Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. ETA? Oh, man. Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Ugh. Can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Sent you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work, and he asked for a phone call with you. Is uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. But now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi. Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh, well, I used to do music production, but it's been hard to find time lately. Yankee here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and, uh, thinking. The tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable. Trustworthy. Someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally... What... Sorry. Gotta go. Um, I'll call you later. Or email. That... could have gone better. Maybe I can make it back to BV in time to meet Mr. Atlas in person. And clarify some things. <laughs> All right. Get those guys out of the way. Let's see where that tracker signal leads. There she is. This glass looks pretty breakable. I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. Time to squash a spider. You're dead, Spider-Man. He's ours! You hide. I've got these guys.
up my operation, spider brat. Your operation involves kidnapping. How am I supposed to let that spot? Oh, here we go. Give me a break, Spider-Man. Get him down! Help me! Get out of here! By yourself? That's in my job description. Ready to go? Are you going to carry me? Sure. I've carried people before. As long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you, you won't sue me. Uh, consider this confirmation. Just try to tell a brother first. Thanks to Spider-Man, our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. You are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now, back to the Quan. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So let's do this right and meet this week on campus, in person. Got a few app requests popping up on BB's campus. Thought I'd call you directly. Ah, uh, someone's asking oh, their special one to homecoming. I can't do this alone. But it looks like things got out of hand. Did they overdo it like one of those gender reveal things? Sounds less dramatic than that. Why I think I it's kind of sweet. Take him out yeah, to dinner right. or something. Okay, on my way. Seems like you might need some spider help. Yeah, I had everything planned out. The clues, the screens, the art, the people, everything has to be. Perfect. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I got you. Can you explain a little slower? What happened? <sighs> okay. I want to ask someone to homecoming, but he's special. I couldn't just do flowers or chocolate. I got some screens, and I want to light them up with the message. But the generator's busted. The guy who rented it out to me won't answer. What a scam. I think I can help. Thanks. I rented the generator from Reynolds and Company Rentals. I'll send you the address. On it. <laughs> Generators are going for a lot these days. This baby's ours. You understand? That's no ordinary rental transaction.
up, stupid! It's Spider-Man! <laughs> <laughs> Takes care of these guys. I should check on the salesperson. Thanks, Spider Man. Glad to help. Your client asked me to look into a delivery delay. I guess we got our answer. Yeah, about that. I'd love to deliver this thing, but those idiots already did so much damage. If she's salvageable, it'll take weeks of repairs. Mind delivering the bad news for me? Can do. Better call Vijay and give him the bad news. Tell me some good news. Well, it's news. Generator's busted. Wait. Okay, I'm not out of ideas yet. Just come back. I've got something else in mind. Since the generator's no good, does BV have any backup ones? I know they keep generators on the roof, but they're all overpowered for my setup. We'd blow a fuse. Unless we find something underpowered. I should be able to pick up that low voltage frequency. And your electrical powers would fill in the rest. Theoretically. Worth a shot. Or a shock. I've got a friend who would love that joke. Found a generator, but it's deactivated. See? That should work great. Mind giving it your special... spark? <laughs> got the voltage we need. Now we just gotta route it to the ground floor. Yes! I knew you'd figure it out. Maybe I could connect these power nodes. seems to be traveling through an old circuit. I should go into electrical engineering. <laughs> Thank you, a million. Oh, maybe you should call yourself the Great Electric Spider. Thanks. I like Spider-Man just fine. Oh, just got a text. He's on his way. Ah, uh, don't go just yet. I could still use your help. Just hide. Vijay's texting me. What? A whiteboard? Hmm. <laughs> oh, Vijay, what are you up to? Wait a sec. That's the equation he helped me with on our first date. Study session. Study date? Spider-Man, that's the first clue. Mind flipping it? <laughs> <laughs> okay, looks like I'm going this way. <laughs> okay, what is this? 
Aw, that's the movie we saw when we had our first kiss. Look, braces, lip balm, and all. <laughs> but still, best kiss ever. Spider-Man, the poster is stuck. Can you give it a tug? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Vijay must be in the quad. Time for the big reveal. Find a seat and grab some popcorn. Vijay? This whole thing has you written all over it. I've always known you're a special guy. And I'm lucky you're my special guy. I love you, Lucas. Will you... Will you... Uh... Home? Ah, uh, not exactly. Oh no. Gotta be something I can do to help here. Need to use my chain lightning. Homecoming? Oh, VJ, of course. Matching sequin blazers? Hell yeah. Phew. That was close. Spider-Man! Come down so I can thank you properly! Thank you for making this possible. Holy crap! You really got Spider-Man in on this? Best day ever! Anything for love, guys. Happy for you both. Enjoy homecoming. Lost drone at uh, somewhere o'clock. Can't be too hard to find. Don't they have tracking chips in them? Yeah, except this one stopped responding. It might be tougher than I thought. All right, be there soon. Somewhere. Hey, I heard you lost a toy drone? It's lost, but it's not a toy. I was using it to gather aerial footage for my senior project. I'd look for it myself, but it lost communication at uh, 300 feet X and 140 feet Y. That's the Northeast building. Can you help? Our senior projects are due Friday. Oh, right. Wait, you knew that? I, uh, get around. Here are lots of things. I'm Spider-Man. Oh, okay then. So you'll look around for me? I'm on it. It must be stuck on the roof. Check the tall building on the northeast corner of campus. <laughs> uh, 
That drone has to be here somewhere. There it is. Hey, the data's corrupt. Can't turn the camera on, but it's rebooting. Awesome. Thanks. Well, since you're up there, would you mind snapping a photo of campus for us? I can make that happen. We'd like a shot of the sky bridge from the rooftop. Could you take it? Perfect. Look at that composition. And that lighting. You've really got an eye for this. Could we get a couple more? A shot from each of the other two super tall buildings around campus would do it. Okay. Get to the tall buildings, snap a couple of pics. I can do that. Recruitment office? <laughs> Is this senior project part of this year's AV Club recruitment video? If this shot doesn't wow the new kids, I don't know what will. Okay, so next. I forgot we need to capture students in their daily life. Just... just three shots of that, and we're golden. We want to capture the eSports team, the drone club, and the greenhouse. An impromptu shot of ponage in action. I'm not a good one. favorite thinking spots on campus. <laughs> the plants make great company. <laughs> cool. Nice action shot of the drone. You captured their movements beautifully. Hey, while you've been up there, I've been tinkering with the drone. The camera's still busted. 
But at least it still flies. One last favor. It's the last thing we need. For real. Could we get a tour of campus in one continuous shot from the air? You can meet us up on the rooftop to start the fly through. All right. I'll get something nice for you. day's work that'll do it thanks to you this recruitment video is really gonna shine don't suppose you'd be down to do 10 hours of editing for me better let the master cinematographer handle that part thing I've attempted all week. I'm in. Everything okay? Lance! He was kidnapped by Midtown. Don't you guys have, like, a huge game against them tomorrow? That's the whole point. Look, they explained it in this note. I'm pretty sure that note leads to the Stewart building, but we can't access the roof. See why we called you? Yeah, I'll look around. Mm, that RJ kid. I knew not to hold the door for him. <laughs> Guess he didn't really forget his badge. <laughs> Wait! The Stewart building? Wonder why the Midtown kids took Lance there. Did you find him already? Not quite. But I have to know. Why the Stewart building? A BB Kid won a robotics contest against Midtown at Stewart Robotics and Engineering last year. Midtown lost. Sounds like Midtown is super bothered about it. They'll be even more bothered when we get Lance back. It looks like the right place. Midtown Science Club is legendary for their pranks. It looks like RJ left another note. Okay. If I want to find Lance, I'll need to shine the UV light on the mural somehow. Hmm. Maybe I could re-angle these beams. I'm sure that old box won't mind if I just give it a little love tap. Nice. Hit a message. I knew it. We BIPOC artists are birds of a feather. To find the next clue, all a band together. Hmm. BIPOC artists. Haley's art expert. Let me give her a call. 
I heard you're looking for Lance. Did you find him? Not yet. Midtown's making us work for it. But I could use your help, sending you a pic. BIPOC artists. Birds of a feather. Hmm. There's a bunch of BIPOC murals at Rodney and Third. Don't know what Alabama means, though. Thanks, Haley. I owe you one. That thank you was plenty. But I'm always down for coffee. You got it. Ton of murals here. Gotta be a hidden message on one of them. How are we doing? I'll find Lance soon. I think. Midtown's hidden messages on murals around town. Right now I'm at Rodney and Third, trying to find the next clue. Where Anders Oliband's painting is? <laughs> Makes sense. Oliband? Midtown mentioned him in the clue. But who is he? PD's own premier art prodigy turned research fellow at the Musée de la Vie in Paris? Maybe Midtown's jealous they don't have an alum like that. Competition is stiff, but your tactics are stale. The greatest in the region shall soon prevail. Hey, Haley, got another clue for you. Sent a pick. Hmm. Greatest in the region. If it's about another mural, you might want to try North Williamsburg. Didn't BV and Midtown have a chess match there last week? Yes. Regional. Ended in a stalemate. Aha! That explains why Midtown's so bitter. I'll check it out. <laughs> Two murals this time? Man, Midtown really doesn't want us to find Lance. Good thing Brooklyn Visions has Spider-Man on their side. they get all this equipment this setup is impressive like ridiculously impressive how do they even have time to set this up In Main Street? Main Street has hundreds of locations. I need more details. Wait, why didn't the second one light up? There must be more to do. <sighs> I guess if I have time to be Spider-Man, they've got time to set up an elaborate puzzle around the city. Red and blue flags? Would there be two paths? <laughs> so there are two paths then. Gotta hand it to Midtown. They spent some serious time on this one. be the street number. Finally. Okay, what's it say? 1121 Main Street. That must be where they're hiding Lance. Hey, Miles. Speak on it. I think I found Lance. 
1121 Main Street. Knew I could count on you. You around here, buddy? Maybe he's in here. <gasps> Lance the Lion. Time for you to head home. One of you must be RJ. Spider-Man? No fair! Brooklyn Vision's cheated! Whoa, Spider-Man? Guess BB couldn't figure it out on their own. Thanks for the fun and games, but I've got to get this guy home. Any luck? On my way back, and I'm bringing a fluffy friend. Lance, you found him! Is he okay? Did they hurt him? Looks safe and sound to me. They had him in the garage. It was kind of dusty. He might need a bath. Anyway, hurry back. We're all ready for him. On my way. Him. You did it, Spider-Man! Thanks for getting Lance back safe, and just in time for the game. Hey, Pete, you ready to come by the Foundation? Sure. I'm excited to see what you're up to. Great. I'm excited to show you. Oh, gotta grab this call from MJ. See you soon. Hey, how you doing? Good. Just got off the phone with Harry, and this Foundation thing could be interesting. Oh, nice. Some hope on my work front, too. I dug into the tech that Yang used to mess with the prison transfer. It's DARPA-level stuff. Yeah. Whoever's behind them has a ton of resources. Miles thinks he saw their leader, some kind of big game hunter, fur vest looking guy. Interesting. I'll keep digging. If I can get this story on the front page, it might help us track him down faster. Maybe save my job, too. Everything okay? We're about to demolish a hospital that was damaged during Sandman's attack, but there's a lot of debris slowing down the technicians. If you're free, they could really use your webs to help keep the building stable while they work. Absolutely! Thanks. We'll keep working until you get here. Does anyone have sunscreen? And will one of you do my back, please? They won't give up! Crystal time. I find them, and they're waiting for me, with all sorts of weapons. What the hell have I walked into? Weapons? Whoever they are, they're definitely right up on Marco. Hey, what's up? Just wanted to let you know that I talked to Gloria, and Feast is gonna send a donation truck to the house tomorrow for the rest of May's stuff. 
Uh, I don't think I'll be able to go through everything by then. Could you cancel that? I promise I'll donate it all myself as soon as I'm finished with... everything. I'll call him right now. But don't push yourself too hard, Parker. I'm serious. Hey, you know I'd much rather be curled up next to you with the latest physics journal right now. <sighs> Especially that French one. Sometimes you're just too romantic. I'll talk to you. You know, I saw an old grandmaster playing there last week. Anyone could walk up and challenge him. And he lost to a kid who lives down the street from me. Damn. Never seen anything like it. The police would have impounded all this by now. A sand crystal. More Marco memories scattered all over New York. Shouldn't you guys be in an hourglass or something? Get that sand crystal! now. They're circling me, Miha. Oh, wishing I'd just stayed home with you and came here. Helped you with your homework. Made you the one meal that I know how to cook. But it's too late now. Kimia is Marco's daughter. How did I not know he was a dad? Just check back in on Marco. He's steadily improving, making more and more sense. He's even eating again. Doctors are hopeful. Good work. coming we've managed to set our explosives in every zone except the last one the demo crew's in there there's four of them i'll find them just keep your radios open and make sure nobody touches that detonator <laughs> spider bot can search faster in there than i can your time to shine little guy make spidey daddy proud Find the people, Clark gets them out. Is anyone out there? Help! Is that a robot? Hey, it's Spider Man. I just relayed your location to fire and rescue. So they'll be here any minute. It's gonna be okay. Spider-Man. Thank you. Hey, Clark. Did you get the location I just sent over? Our team's moving in now. Thanks. Spider-Man's here. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> I mean... Whoa. to test out my pulse blast then. Anyone? I can't move! Help! Hang 
on. I'll get you out of there. <sighs> Thank you. Help coming. Fire and Rescue knows where you are, and they'll be here soon. You're going to be okay. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Clark, you should be getting a new location any time now. Just came in. We'll head right over once we finish getting Mr. Robleski out. Those breathing exercises again? on the way. Just try not to move. They'll have you out of here soon. Okay. Uh, thank you, Spider-Man. Looks like I need to go up. So it's field testing time for my latest upgrade. Shoot, it's better than this, I swear. Hey, Clark. Did you get the last location I sent your way? Heading there now. There's only one other worker left inside. Hurry, Spider-Man. Leave it to me. I can see light through that ceiling debris. Just sent a new location your way, but this guy said someone else is still trapped. Really? I'm not missing anyone else. But if you can find them, we'll get them out. I'm on it. Nobody here. Never, never even mentioned the flame. I just, I just wanted out. 
then you should have remembered we all go out the same way we come in. Painfully. Get out of here! The fool's beacon! Prophecy said you'd face us eventually. Prophecy? Oh man, I've always wanted to be in one of those! Not crazy about the nickname, though! So, what's my prophecy? Endless fighting? Death by building? Throw four arms and become a giant man spider? A bird like the rest of the unworthy! Did anyone else hear that? Whoa, guys, can we take this outside? Is everyone okay? Besides me knocking you out, obviously? We are better than you ever will be. A flame burns eternal. Who are you people? The only one yeah. worthy enough to survive yeah. what's coming! Finish him off before the police get here! Christy sure this yeah. building is gonna fall apart before then! I destroyed the Thanks. So what's your deal? There you are. Hey! You never did like my smoking. Yuri? Well, life's call me Wraith. Fits pretty well, I think. I tried... Where have you been? No time. What about them? They made their choice. This will be a new record. And they said it couldn't be done. Looks like Yuri took off. I thought she'd just need some time after what happened with Hammerhead. But coming back with that suit and a name like Wraith? I should keep an eye on her and the other on these cultists. I need more eyes. suffering through a litany of problems right now. Inflation through the roof, feckless government officials, and a country on the brink of a collapse not seen since the fall of the Roman Empire. Yet the worst, most insidious dilemma we face is that of the faceless. It seems that... You can hear me, Marco. Not interested in a puppet show. Try 
seen Sandman in so long. He gave it up for her. I was wondering what this place was. You made it! I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker! <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. And now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this Place. Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... Got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Yes, this is Catherine. May I ask who's calling? Oh, of course. Put him through. Dr. Young. Have data does not cross-tabulate with the AI learning we did during the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. 
the carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Wanna see how? Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that we're training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves away, not the wolves. Oh, nice! Yes! Yep! Oh, yeah! Gotta protect the hive! Hear that, little bee wolves? You still get to pollinate another day, too. You're done, Peter. A very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to Entomology. Attention. Bee drone testing will be taking place in the atrium throughout the day. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow. I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance I can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but, uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. So that was crazy. But it seems to be working for everyone to have Dr. Connors here. Guess I'll look around. This is the original prototype from Otto's lab. This would have been crime scene evidence. I wonder how it ended up here. Nice. Seems inspired by some of Otto's work without the hardwiring problems. Wonder if Dr. Connors has used this. Though after that lizard rampage, he may be done testing his work on himself. origins of life on Earth were made a mystery. How could organic life forms have arisen from non-biological chemical compounds? Recent discoveries of meteorites containing organic molecules considered the building blocks of life may provide a potent clue. Asteroids, meteoroids, meteors, and meteorites. I PhD. Fish. Not just fish, research subjects. Want to feed them? Yeah. 
Japanese koi fish have well-studied pigmentation variation, which is ideal for our research into enhanced reflectivity. Stacks of intracellular anhydrous guanine crystals. Separated by cytoplasm, we're finding it very useful for eco-friendly roofing materials. So cool! May would have loved this place. Did you do the XRF analysis? Well, what if I needed a higher... Hey, spectrum? what are you doing with these bikes? We're working on ultra-efficient batteries, charged by bicycles. These bikes? Can I ride them? Not right now, but when they're road ready, we'll need people to test them. Nice. I'll try to come back. Guess this is what it's like working for an awful. Yeah. Hey, whenever you're ready, come meet me up here. I'm on my way. I'll see you in a sec. Imagine coming to work here every day. It's almost too good to be true. Could start paying off the mortgage. Uh, but what if Spidey work gets in the way? <sighs> Gotta think this through before signing on. Looks like Connors is putting the research he did after he lost his arm to good use. Wonder if he regrets testing that serum on himself. It must be unnerving walking around with dormant lizard DNA in your body. What's this? Some kind of radiation treatment, maybe? Wonder if this is what they used for Harry's treatment. Let's see what's going on here. Maybe I can help. Oh yeah, that would take a while. I'm not sure there's time to dig in now, but I'd sure like to come back and work on this later. So many cool things here. The need for medical organ transplants far outnumbers available donors. An innovative solution uses 3D printing technology to create custom replacement organs, decreasing the likelihood of transplant rejection and increasing the chances of a successful outcome. Here at the Emily May Foundation, this cutting edge work is the saving life. Beehives show complex group decision making and group locomotion. Swarming is an annual process in which the colony expands and splits. The Emily May Foundation has discovered that specific changes in the honeycomb's vibrational spectra precede a primary swarm. This research will help beekeepers support healthy swarming without invasive observational techniques for optimal health and reproduction in our beleaguered bee population. Drones? Yeah, uh, doing a little cross-collaboration between the energy lab and the agricultural lab. Ultralight drones, using the new battery tech for crop monitoring. Very cool. Do they collect crop data too? They will, by the time we're done with them. That's awesome. Thanks. We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but we'll have it back up in no time. Incredible. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Really? Even before high school. To middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? 
Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? Yes, that was so great. Interesting research project. And lowers the old cortisol levels, too. Right? I honestly think it's one of my favorite spots in the building. Hey, it's me. Yeah, we got the dough machine. It expands the base of the member system and the debris of the extractor. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm-hmm. Say we're good to go. This way, dude. Let me know when you're on your way. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Match the base pairs to incorporate as many growth genes as you can. That'll be a plant that can feed the world. Interesting. Okay, I think I get the hang of it. Great. Now you're ready to try the real thing. This is a plant we're working on to grow well in drought conditions. Corporations patent GMO seeds for profit and are rightly criticized. But ours are open source, developed for sustainability instead of financial gain. So smart. Let's see. One step closer to feeding the world. <laughs> nice work. Listen, I know you're not officially on, but could you look at one more gene for me? Curious to get your take on it. It's a crop specifically adapted to urban gardens. Of course. Beautiful work, Peter. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show off. -y. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. But don't decide just yet, not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Go ahead, swipe. Wow. Man. Harry. 
This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> One quick thing. <laughs> I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Coney Island later, yeah? You bet. <laughs> oh, hey, I forgot to tell you. Some of our researchers have field experiments set up around the city. If you have time, check them out. I've sent you the location, and your badge will grant you access. All right, I'll swing by. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on, don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but duty calls. Trust me, your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right, good luck out there. Dr. Foster doesn't mind if Spider-Man helps Peter out. Peter, excited to have you on board. We've partnered with your friends at Feast to feed the community, starting by improving our gardens. To help, please collect some samples of nearby plants and put our gene splicer to use. Easy enough. Collect some samples, splice some genes, feed the people. I think I can improve on this. Let's look for the best samples. Should be something around here. efficient with water. I can use that. <clears throat> this one's really productive. Lots of fruit. That's perfect. This 
one's technically a weed, but the hardiness could be helpful. Okay, got some great samples. Time to bring them together. I can't believe that EMF is making these GMOs open source. Profit shouldn't be part of the equation when it comes to basic human necessities. Let's see. will be growing faster and bearing more fruit than ever. Just imagine what Feast could do with all of that. Okay, made some great new hybrid seeds for them. Just gotta get this place ready to plant the seeds. Let's optimize their water. I just gotta patch this up. Seems to be multiple leaks lowering the water pressure. If I don't find them all, the system won't work. Gotta take... Just a few more to patch up. Hmm, pipe's blocked by that car. Would be counterproductive if I drowned all the plants. May used to have a green thumb with her tomato plants. Maybe I have green webs? This should do it. Dr. Foster will be pleased. He doesn't need to know Spider-Man helped out. I wonder what other field projects the EMF is working on. about that new Emily May Foundation. Who are they? What do they do? Well, big picture, it's an Oscorp spinoff, which we don't love, I know, but the man in charge, Harry Osborne, has got a decent rep. At the very least, he hired my favorite bee scientist, AKA apiologist, Dr. M. Young. They're the foremost expert on colony collapse disorder and a pretty sick ukulele player if you happen to follow them on the socials. So, young Osborne, your foundation has a lot of work to do repairing your father's legacy. But, so far, you're off to a good start. Don't forget to pay your rent on the first, or, you know, withhold your checks in protest. Whatever, do you. Later. Don't see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong. Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Ah, oh, man. We were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Littering? Come on, man. What in the... Uh! 
arachnid, come on! Now have your boss with the main get this kind of tech! A true hunter knows how to camouflage. I could have just said I don't know. some answers. Okay, Birdie. Take me to your nest. I'm gonna miss these chases when I'm an Emily May. The adrenaline, going through the city like it's an obstacle course, never gets old. Getting to do real science, though, for actual money. I finally did it. I have a stable career. Okay, cool it, Parker. Daydream about those fat science stacks later. Time to chase. Whoa, is that a real gun? That actually works? Hope you have renter's insurance. Mind if I take a look under the hood? I'll take that as a no. That's too close now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. Bring heat, damn! I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention. Yeah, but Scorpion is? Okay. Keep coming. You know, I've got nothing against Gargan. I'm just saying I've kicked his butt a few times. And yet you always held back. By not killing him? Yeah, killing really isn't my thing. Now, where's your boss? Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay, let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh, is that your home? Oh, come on, Bertie, let go! Come on! Stop by a ticket for this ride! I'm gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, MJ. Did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. 
building sold a few weeks ago. Wait, this buyer. There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city, like whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I want to find out. Good luck. Need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta draw one of them away. something two things this armed group calls themselves hunters and they've got a lot of accents hmm international mercenaries that's what i'm thinking could be front page material for your article i'm writing it up now thanks oh and speaking of work i accepted harry's offer that's fantastic we should celebrate later after you're done with your current work totally talk soon <clears throat> Nighty night. That's a lot of gear. It's like they're prepping for war. Incident. I got put on, what do they call it? On a leave of absence, so I torched their building. Nice. Hold up in my place afterwards and waited for him to come for me. But it was Craven who did. Asked me if I wanted to hunt real game. Wait. Stay down. Yes, Please. I was wrong. That's everyone. Now, what were they up to? Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others. All around the city. I'll send this to Genki. But he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? Why? Yes, it's loaded. What do I use? Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. What's the point? You hungry too? Relax. Aw, for me? Shouldn't have. Oh. oh, sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Nice. Toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Cloaking feels operational. Good. Beetles, talandrons, ammunition, rations. Hmm. These 
These guys are better equipped than most armies. This Craven guy must be rich. Or well connected. Or both. The spider is here! to next. Looks like this is the only way. <coughs> Note to self, stay away from poison clouds. A research lab? in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to Riotea? Guess Craven could. Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal... Ugh. Dr. Farley Stillwell? His genetic experiments gave Scorpion his abilities. Craven sure does his research. Aunt May was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. Craven's studying Lee's blood. Maybe he's trying to figure out where his powers came from get them for himself. An inner demon mask. Lee's old superpower gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Were they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa! And not a single scratch? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. <laughs> Would you look at that? Hey, MJ. I have another name for you. Craven. Seems like he's the boss of these guys. And he's here on some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. 
Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? Already on it. Stay safe. I hear you were not impressed by the Scorpio. <laughs> it's not that I wasn't impressed. Relying on hallucinogens and playing with your prey, it's just not the way I hunt. But I can still appreciate the skill. Speaking of, you take a look at what he's some answers instead of questions right now. That looks promising. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. I get bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. I don't... Never gonna win best in show with that attitude! <laughs> nice, doggy, kitty, robot! No joke! Heal! Roll over! Play dead! Finally! I was wondering when animal control would show up! Beast 
Guys, putting together quite the team. You can go. They said you were a killer. Imagine my disappointment. For what? En serio. My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. <sighs> Can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. See, you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? I'm 
sorry. Look, next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. I found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters, as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name, Craven. And he killed Scorpion. And he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee? I don't know, but this list is extensive. These must be the people Marco warned us about. They were hunting Sandman. No way. Felicia's on their list, too. Black Hat? Your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up and... We're going to find Lee, Miles. I promise. <laughs> Guess I've got some time until MJ calls. What's going on in the neighborhood? Maybe I should try to find some hunter hideouts. <laughs> hey, Haley. What's up? So all that help you gave folks at Brooklyn Visions, they banded together to make you a thank you gift. That's sweet. But Spider-Man can't accept gifts, unless it's hugs. Haha. -ha. Hugs are great. But I think you'll put this gift to good use. Swing by the rooftop garden when you get a chance. The mecca of basketball. Sure, you can play it anywhere with just a ball in the net. But when you got the people in the apartment buildings watching, the other players trash talking, and the sound of rubber hitting asphalt, there's a reason they call it the city game. Addresses Pete mentioned for a few black cats. Above! Looks like Pete was right. This is definitely a hunter boy. Maybe I can find out if there's a base nearby too. Tell me where your base is! Yeah! 
were they guarding? Come here, Birdie. Tell me a story. A map of a base. Any chance you can show me what's waiting for me there? If I disable that relay, they won't be able to call for backup. Nice. So you've been to two other blinds around Harlem, huh? Better scope out the other blinds. Maybe they'll lead me to a base. Hey, Miles. I have those addresses Pete mentioned for a few Black Cat safe houses. Head into the first one now. Thanks for offering to do this. Pete can get kind of blindsided by Felicia. I know you're busy with your college essay. It's cool. I always have time to Spider-Man. Sounds like you're as good at work-life balance as I am. I'm scrambling to finish my hunter story. Might save my job. But you guys, what happened to Scorpion and Lee in the wind? I can't focus while he's out there, MJ. Don't. Don't let it eat you up. It might be best to just focus on the task at hand. That's not all. When I face Lee, I got some new powers. They're blue and weird. I mean, I'm no expert on spider powers, but C could it be from stress? What you're going through, it it's a lot. But you're not alone. Even Pete and I, we're still figuring it all out. One thing at a time, right? We'll find him. I know. Thanks, MJ. And Miles, be careful with Felicia. You can't trust her, no matter what she says. Warn her about the hunters and get her out of the city. Understood. Let you know when I get there. The other Spider-Man's got this. Thanks, Miles. Science time. Welcome to the real-world trial for our ultra-efficient battery bicycles. Nice. We'd love you to take a bike for a spin, passing through 10 checkpoints to measure real-world battery metrics. Head to the bike rack in Central Park and hop on. Your badge will grant you access. No need to make headlines. This is a job for plain old Pete. Now to grab one of these sweet state-of-the-art rides. Okay, let's head to that first checkpoint. Check it in at the checkpoint. Concert happening today. MJ and Harry and I have been to some great shows in the park. Hey, that sign will make a good ramp. Awesome! Got a little air on that one. Harry and I used to go to concerts out here every summer. Maybe we can bring that tradition back. Check. Oh, that's not right. I don't think this bike was supposed to provide its own fireworks. This isn't safe. At this rate, the battery will overheat and explode. I've got to hurry and get it to the bike station, where it can drain the charge safely. Hurry! 
Spike. Hold together. Maybe I can vent some of this excess charge by depleting it with a speed boost. The bridge is blocked. Gotta get over there somehow. Excuse me! Look out! Phew! That was a close one. The battery will safely drain, but I've got to tell Dr. Wynn a short circuit seems to have caused thermal runaway. If it didn't happen in the lab, I'll bet fluctuating outdoor temperatures are the culprit. I've got some ideas for better thermal regulation. Friendly people, what's been up? I found the sweetest email in my inbox today, and I just had to share it with you. It reads, Dear Danica, I know you're reporting on high-profile stories these days, but if you have time, I'd like to forward a public thank you on your show. I'm a BVA senior who would never have gotten an A on their final cinematography project if it wasn't for Spider-Man's help. I was so grateful, I decided to name my new hamster after him. It meant a lot that he took the time to help me, given how much he's had to deal with lately. Sometimes, the smallest good things make ripples. If you read this, thanks for reading. Sincerely, Odyssey. Oh, Odyssey, I love stories like this. Small things make such a difference. So, here is my challenge for all of you. Do something small today. Give a stranger a compliment, buy a friend a coffee, put a coin in the meter next to yours, anything. You never know what good it'll do. Well, that seems like enough advice for this episode. Take the most care, everyone, and take care of each other. I really don't see anything romantic in proposing. It is very romantic to be in love, but... There is nothing romantic about it. Oh, do you do headshots, Spider-Man? Sorry, sorry, sorry. He was a new one. Whether it's on the stage or in the open air, where else can you see legends and soon-to-be legends performing every day? London? That's really far away.
do we got? Place looks like it was ransacked. Perfect chance to use the AR tech Genki upgraded. Scratch marks. Huh. Any sign of her? Found some scratch marks with traces of metal. I'll run it to see if it matches her claws. Just have to isolate the molecular components of the metal filings I found. Okay. Try that again. That's not right. Hmm. Nice. Titanium. What else? Let's see here. Done. Cobalt. This is looking good. Who says science isn't fun? Got it. Tungsten. A match. Did it. It's her. Scuff marks from her shoes. She must have been hustling. She was grabbing something from that box on the wall. Looks like an emergency stash box. But it's empty. Hunters. That should be enough to reconstruct the scene. They attacked. But she's on the run. They're already on to her. This is exactly why the city needs to be warned about the hunters. She could have. Keep me posted. Whoa! Well, that's gotta be her. Well, this went from a friendly warning to a rescue mission pretty quick. I just hope I'm not too late. Alicia's resourceful, but everything we've seen from these hunters has me kind of worried. You're worried about your boyfriend's ex? That's compassion. <laughs> Looks like I just missed them. Any signs of where they went? Let me scan the area and see. I miss another stash box this one's still locked she risked her whole life to get to it gotta open it but the power's disconnected it must be behind there
about those wires? Bet the generator could power that stash box. <clears throat> Need to power up this generator if I'm gonna find her. Black Cat needs help. Can only find her by powering up the generator. If I tether my web to the generator, I can get into the box. This looks right. Nearly there. MJ, how's your French? Non-existent, but send me what you got. Okay. There's some instruction manual for a Wanda Watoom. Watoom? Hmm. I'll do a search. Give me a sec. Hunters. Wherever they're headed, I should follow. According to a translation of the Mystic Arcana, that wand is old. I'm talking BC old. Supposedly, whoever wields it can create portals to pretty much wherever they can think of. Like magic? If she gets her hands on something like that. I can think of some uses for it. Miles, let's just stick to the plan. We're in position. She's ours. <laughs> Definitely inside. Gotta clear these hunters out. Whatever that one does, it does it right. You look tired. Cat's doing magic in there, or I'm missing out on a hell of a raid. <laughs> of weird things going on inside this building. Looks like the rumors are true. Bad day to be a bad guy.
postcard translates to my reason for living. Time is short. Hmm. A new partner? Alicia? You never know. That's the last of them. Now let's see what's up with Felicia. Spider wants to play, huh? MJ! She stole the wand! And magic is very real! What? What happened? Hey, Cat! Can we talk? Will you slow down? Back off before I portal you into the Pacific Ocean! How'd you get on our comms? You're still using the old channel. Don't you have better things to do, kid? Alicia, you have to stop. This is reckless, even for you. Who's this? Is <laughs> that you, Red? How are things with the old spider these days? Can you knock it off? I'm trying to help you. I need your or any other spider's help. You know what you can do with that wand? She's just gonna use it to steal more art. Rude! I can hear you, clowns. Whoa! What the hell? Felicia, that could have hurt people! Ah! Watch out! The hunters are back! Aw, they must really like me. We can end this tonight. We can stop the guy trying to kill you. Steal your own mystical artifact. Uh, oh, didn't even bring my scarf. That wand can take us right to Craven. This was never about Craven. Why won't you help me stop this guy? You're Spider-Man. You've saved the city before. You'll do it again. Spider-Man was right about you. You only care about yourself. Look, kid. Not that it's your business. My girlfriend's in Paris. And I got her into trouble with some bad people. Have you ever done something for love? She needs me now. If only I could figure out how to go more than 10 feet with this thing. MJ said not to trust you. <gasps> Red's a smart one. But you gotta make your own choices, kid. There's the cat! Take her alive! She's mine! What's behind you? They never saw you coming! Up above! You should go! Portal out of here! The instruction manual for this artifact was not clear. You seem to be getting better at it. Not better enough. We're gonna figure it out. Together. Damn. Plucky attitude, kid. It's Spider-Man, not kid, thank you. All right, Spider-Man. Let's see what you've got. More of them. On the roof. Hey, use this portal. Get the wound away from it. Gotta stay far enough back. That had to hurt. Here come the claws. Uh, there's a turret now. Another portal for you. I'll take all the help I can get here. Any magic tricks for bullets? 
You got Web. Hit the turret and take it out. Eiffel Tower. How are we, Felicia? She's safe. For now. You finished your story? Just send it to Jonah. Wish me luck. You got this. Dude, head to Coney Island. What? What's up? You know how Mysterio just got out of prison? Well, he's opening a new attraction there. He could be the hunter's next target. Good call. And guess who else is at Coney tonight? Hint. Crushed on her for like over a year. <laughs> Come on, bro. Don't bro me, bro. You and Haley are made for each other. You don't ask her out, you're violating laws of nature. We'll see. After we check on Mysterio. I'd love to see you all at the fair next week. I'm going for the chili dog record. And I hear the shrimp cocktail competition is going to be biblical. That's good. Hey, you pay for that photo, Spider-Man? I'm <laughs> just kidding. You're cool. Oh, no, you're radical. 
I heard this guy dips his hot dog buns in tomato juice before eating them. Now, I get that it makes it easy for them to go down, but tomato juice? Brother, that ain't right. Gotta change it to miles first. Then I'll scope out the park. Incognito. I don't see any bad guys. Hmm. Now should we take a closer look? Hello. I'm Quentin Beck, master illusionist. And this is Betsy, my business partner, and Cole, my technical advisor. And this... is the next generation of entertainment. <laughs> no way, dude. Excellent! Cool. A brave young man, ready to experience the future firsthand. Is there anyone else out there with courage in their hearts? Come on, come all, and experience the future! There's a kiosk up ahead. Just keep moving. If you enjoy your experience, please tell your friends and feel free to visit one of the many mysteriums now open around the city. Our free trial ends soon. Thank you, Betsy. I'm sure you will. Now to customize your experience. As you look at these images, I want you to think about your future your hopes and your dreams. Ah, yes. I'm getting good data. And we're done. No way! <laughs> Enjoy the show. Don't worry, I'll be watching and listening. If at any time you begin to feel uncomfortable, just let us know. Enjoy your dream come true. All right, let's get it. Oh, nice!
Mikey, you gotta try this. What is happening? I was rocking the club. Then a bunch of bad guys showed up. Now they're trying to rock me. Oh, dear. I hope you're not hurt. I can hold my own. But can't you just pull the plug or something? It's not that easy. But we are trying. Wiki. to it. Fast. I think if you finish the song, you might hit a break point in the program. On it. There. You should see an exit. Make your way to the... Okay. Time to go. Are you okay? Yeah. I, I am very sorry. We will do our best to find out what happened. But until then... Miles! So, uh, what's up with that? Oh. <laughs> uh, the future of entertainment still has some bugs to work out. Hi, Pete. <laughs> cool shirt. <laughs> cool shoes. Uh, really cool shoes. Cool everything, really. Hey, Miles. Thank you. Uh, guys, this is my best friend, Harry. Uh, he just got back from overseas, and he's starting up a new research foundation. You mean, we're starting up a new research foundation. <laughs> hey, good to meet you. New job, huh? Still gonna have time for tutoring? We'll figure it out. Shall we? Uh, actually, that thing back there really messed my head up. Can we dip? Okay. Nice meeting you, Harry. Yeah, you too. Mm -hmm. 
you you good yeah actually uh i'll catch up with you later hey we should really check it on miles make sure he's okay yeah i will okay well they seem nice <laughs> not too bad they're gonna miss out on the best night of our lives huh <laughs> All right, here's the plan. Tonight is the greatest hits album of our childhood, and the top three singles, each of our favorite attractions. Welcome. All right, let's do this. Step right up. You have no idea who you're up against. <laughs> Good luck. You'll meet it. Now, Pete, you got this. All uh, right, players. Fingers on the trigger, eyes on the target. They're off. The great Coney Island Open returns after three years, and our returning competitors seem to be in the highest of spirits. Harry, what are you doing? Distracting you. Duh. Not that it's working. Oh, that's dirty. Go, Pete! You're taking his side? I don't root for cheaters. Ooh, burn! And our returning champion keeps his crown. <laughs> Hold up. You guys want your prize? Oh, we're good. Thanks. I'd look good in a crown. Sorry. Next on our top three, MJ Watson featuring the Speed Demon. <laughs> yes. Let's hit the other rides and games on the way. If we do enough of them, we can win something. This one looks fun. How did I let you talk me into this? Ah, stop and smell the popcorn. How can you think about food right now? You know me, I have many talents. Sure. With the spinning vertigo ride out of the way. <laughs> Forgot how much I loved that one. You were saying? <laughs> yes! Let's hit the other rides and games on the way. If we do enough of them, we can win something from the prize booth. I knew I read that somewhere. Up. You know! God, you I hope the speed the demon is as terrifying as I remember. <laughs> Weirdo. Swish, swish, fish. Never knew you were so into basketball, Harry. With all this energy I've had lately, I'm into everything. <laughs> oh, there he is. Yes! Show him how it's done, Pete! Yeah, let's go! <laughs> Another stamp for our ticket. Knock him down is calling our name. Throw the ball and knock him down. The baby could turn pyramid to the most stable structure. Let's test that out. I know somebody who blew 20 bucks trying to knock him down. Yeah, yeah. supposed to be able to do that. And another one's gone. Ready to put our love to the test? Okay, you two go get declared soulmates. I'm gonna fly solo. See if I give off Casanova vibes. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> soulmates, huh? No pressure. What does this thing know about us? Maybe that you should move in with me? Or maybe that everything's too up in the air to think about it yet? Yeah, maybe. Whoa, that can't be right. 
What is this thing reading anyway? Our body temperature? <laughs> or our skin's pH? Highly doubt it's that sophisticated. Over here, let's do this one next. Just three left. Go karts, anyone? <laughs> With your driving? Hard pass. Come on, you two lovebirds. We've got more park to explore. doing here looks like he's a mechanic and saving the day <laughs> thanks for pulling me out man that could have been really bad maybe we should try the roller coaster <laughs> tombstone stereo this park really is a magnet for reformed supervillains. <laughs> yeah. Come on. We still have a little more memory lane to walk down. It's so nice to just wander around. People watch. I honestly don't remember the last time we let ourselves relax for a night. Seems like it's been forever. Stuff just always gets in the way. Man, Pete, you must have had one packed tutoring schedule. <laughs> yeah, so. You two have always had your noses to the grindstone. Sometimes you gotta stop and smell the roses. Says the guy who started a foundation two seconds after finishing life saving medical treatment. I know how lucky I am to have gotten a second chance. I have a responsibility to make the most of it. Work hard, play hard. You got this. This is the best. What's next? I want to go scope out the popcorn situation. You guys want anything? Caramel corn would hit the spot. On it. It's good to be back, Pete. Can I ask you something? Being gone, I've missed a lot. You just lost your job, MJ's got work woes. Are you both... okay? Yeah! Yeah, we're okay. Everything's great. I mean, especially with EMF. We're gonna change the world. <laughs> yeah. Didn't you have a bag like that? Over there, the guy in the blue shirt. Oh, no, that's, uh, a knockoff. How can you tell from here? Ah, oh, print's too big. The wrong shade of red on the piping. You can see that? Well, it's candy apple. You can see it from the top of the big wheel. Yeah, that is pretty bright. See? I know things. So, anything corn-based is a no-go. Hopper's cracked. I got one. Sorry, in a hurry. The real mystery is why this place is so expensive. How's it feel? Weirdly high. Or do you mean being this handsome, this charm? Being Peter. Being Peter is nice. <laughs> I think we could both use more nights like this. Yeah, we always say we will, but let's pinky yeah. promise this time. Just not right now. Too high. All right, postponed pinky promise. Oh, needed that. It's so relaxing up there. <laughs> Two more. Cotton candy, anyone? Can't. Strict diet. Doc's orders. Too sweet for me. I think I'll go see if that claw machine is still finessable like old times. You two coming? We'll catch up in a sec. Glad he's doing what he loves. Killing it at the claw machine? 
I meant the foundation. It's great that he gets to make a living helping people. I'll bet your book helped more people than you realize. Always looking on the bright side, huh? Better than the alternative. I don't believe it. Claw Machine has a new high score. Couldn't beat it. Tragic. I didn't realize how excited I'd be to ride the Speed Demon again. As long as I don't have to see my picture on it. Smells incredible. Hey, Harry, want to get that chili dog you were craving yesterday? Too early for that. I want to cap the evening off devouring as many chili dogs as I can fit in my pie hole. <sighs> What's your secret admirer one? Hold on, let's do this one. Hey, Pete, <laughs> this is the best night of my life. Hey, Harry, me too. <laughs> I want to have my birthday here this year. I didn't think I'd get any more of those. There'll be plenty, buddy. <laughs> that was great! What a ride. One <laughs> left and it's prize city. So, you haven't made it. What's your secret admirer one? <laughs> Who, Jonah? Nothing. Not a word on my article yet. Still can't believe he's your boss. Let's just find something to hit. Finally! Let's hammer some hydras. Yeah, let's do it. This thing's a token. There's literally no way to win. All right, new strategy. I know. I totally All right, little hydras, come out, come out wherever you are, dude. That's kind of dark. Gotcha. What? They're not pigs. They can't exactly threaten to blow their houses down. Have you ever considered like? I don't know, not dropping sass? I have not, thank you very much. Yes! Take that, you stupid Hydra! Yo, MJ. You good? Great! Thanks! Yeah, MJ! Show those Hydras who has opposable thumbs! <laughs> Whew, I really needed that. So, whose face were you picturing? On the moles? Classic transference. It was totally Jonas, wasn't it? That's everything. Hey, there's a prize with our name on it. Coming through. How about this prize right here? Shoot, it's a handbag. Never taking this off, right? You're gonna wear that to the office. Co-founder approved. <laughs> Such a gentleman. <sighs> Doing okay? I'm really nervous. Don't worry about it. Chances the person Harry gave his prize to would be the single writer sitting next to him. I mean, it would be one heck of a meet cute. Should we tell her? Tell her what? What are you two whispering about up there? Woo! Just reminding MJ to keep her hands inside the vehicle at all times.
<laughs> right? <laughs> I needed that. <sighs> All right, fearless leader. What's next? Our last showcase of the night. The muscle up. Oh, you know it, baby. Never did hit that bell. But the dream always kept me coming back. I think this will be the year. <laughs> I was thinking that this Wow. I hope Miles gets to see these. Haley's got some talent. Expert color theory at work here. Feels familiar, yet modern. Well, somebody remembered a thing or two from AP Art. so much smaller now and forever tickets were so much cheaper 10 years ago but kitty allowance has made it hurt twice as much true now here's a strapping young lad ready to ring that bell welcome who's up first pete come on Nice! <laughs> Take it easy, Harry. Don't hurt yourself. The only thing that's gonna hurt is your Parker pride. Boys, boys. You're both pretty. Sorry. What? Um, okay. Uh, I guess this really was the year. Harry, that was something else. <sighs> yeah, I have no idea how I did that. Okay, how about we do something more chill? Looks like the Ferris wheel line has died down some. I'm gonna let you two go ahead and be cute together. I'm gonna go see if I can win a couple more unicorns. <laughs> you look really happy. It's funny. Harry's getting a second chance, but I feel like I'm getting one, too. You two are gonna make a hell of a team. <laughs> the Bugle posted. Did Jonah put you on the front page? Oh, you're gonna be an editor! I should have brought champagne. Hunters and scorpions and explosions, oh my. Don't opposed to the new guy story. MJ, uh, yeah. It already has 5,000 views. <sighs> I've got to write a different kind of story. Win his trust somehow. Hey, you come up with something. You always do. Thanks. Sure. And hey. If you need some help from your friendly neighborhood Spider-Man, I'd say we make a hell of a team, too. Even if I do forget the champagne. Next time. Tombstone. Tombstone. 
Raven's goon squad, huh? What super villain are you hunting this time? The stereo? Tombstone? Don't let the spider get in our way. Take him out. Didn't expect to see me? Well, the feeling's mutual. One night off. That's all I wanted. But no. This is grim. Tombstone can handle himself. Can't let them hurt anyone who hasn't gotten out of the park yet. Oh no. Harry! Come on, Harry, pick up, pick up! Hey, it's Harry. Leave a message. MJ, Harry isn't answering his phone. I've got my hand full with these hunters, and I don't see him anywhere. Our Ferris will punch is about to touch down. I'll make sure he's safe. And you stay safe, too. <laughs> you know I don't go anywhere without my Simkarian sidekick. Is that what you call your sable stingray? Still workshopping it. I'll let you know when I find here. This should be over soon, if you'll just bear with me! Taking the shot! on the raceway. That's where Tombstone was working. He's tough, but so are these guys. Ah! Hunter, start your engines! And may the best spider win! I knew it! Ah! Watch your head! Not yet, but I saw Mysterio. Raven's goon squad doesn't seem to be interested in him. Like, at all. And they must only want Tombstone. Thanks for the tip! Yeah. I'll keep looking for Harry. Additional units are on their way. Stone. You just worry about breaking through that net! You defend me! You and me both, Lonnie. But these guys' this boss wants you dead. He's a hunter, and he's making supervillains his prey. He's not open to a call from my parole officer about how I turned my life around. Since he's already killed Scorpion? Probably not! Nice 
talk. We sure do. Spider-Man. I know, I know. But first, what are those things coming out of you? I think it's my treatment. <laughs> Dr. Connor said it's some kind of self-learning exosuit, but I had no idea it could... Wait. You know what this means, right? We both have superpowers. Just think about all the stuff we could do to heal the world! Sorry. I, uh... Guess I still gotta figure out how this thing works. Well... It's a real shame neither of us has a state-of-the-art science lab to run some tests. I'll go make sure the coast is clear. Meet you there. Give me a call when you're ready. what happened at Coney. What was that? Well, uh, remember my friend Harry? Yeah? That was him? How? Honestly, no idea. I think it's this treatment he's been... Oh, that's Harry. Gotta go. Hey, I cleared out the foundation. All right, I'll swing by. <laughs> swing by. Man, how many times have you said that in a minute, literally? Code says Unk hit a stash here. My pleas for peace have been rejected by calls for violence. From, you know it, Spider Man. An attack on what was once a destination. Get in the hang of this thing. I think I can pull that steam pipe up. my stash at the old radio station. Was wondering where I was. That station was the hottest ticket in Brooklyn for up-and-coming hip-hop artists back in the day. You and Pops get any airtime? We got close. 
but they bumped us last minute with this next level group out of Staten Island. Still got your beats if you want them. <laughs> NYC ain't ready for a prowler spotty mixtape. Take it easy, kid. Hope Unk starts making music again. It'll be a good distraction for him. That'll definitely work. Ah, the Manhattan Bridge. Can you believe they started building it in 1901? Finished in 1909. I thought it was old when I was a kid, but now? It's just amazing, the history that's in this city. I think this is Pete's thing. All right, EMF, what do you got? These wind turbines are tiny but mighty. Once deployed on high altitude currents, they are a potentially self-sustaining source of clean power. Eventually, they'll shuttle back and forth to a dock. But right now, we're looking for a way to place these for an initial test run. I think I can get these up to the right altitude with the web wings. They don't call it Brooklyn Heights for nothing. Here we go! Huh. Web wings alone aren't getting me enough lift. I need a little push. The intersection of Court and Montague is super windy. I've certainly lost enough papers walking through there. Let's use that as a natural wind tunnel. Now to deploy. This is really high. Fly free, little turbine. Bam! One more! There we go! Great! They're all happily launched! I'll just head back... A turbine's been compromised? What? How? Need to check on that! Gotta get up there! Talon drone's attacking the turbine! I've gotta stop them! <laughs> You guys again! I really wish we'd stop meeting like this! Yeah, yeah, I'm all right. uh, we won't have to! Uh, really? I'm in your way? get this turbine back in place. There. All up and running. I should make sure Dr. Wynn sets up some turbine security for these. You guys need help with that? Come on! Can't you just give me the crystal and I'll be on my way?
Sorry, guys, but I'm not leaving without that sand crystal. <laughs> Marco, what's going on in that head of yours? I tell them to leave us alone, but they don't care. They shoot me with a net, try to hold me down. I was sand before I knew it. I'm so ashamed, but I had no choice. I gotta get back to you. The hunters were after him. Marco had to do something, or else he'd be just like Scorpion right now. Hey, that's over the speed limit! There, let the spider hunt us! Wait, are you baiting me? You're baiting me! Ugh. Now we have you! Any more traffic violations and we're gonna have to revoke your license. Reports coming in from Brooklyn are to be believed. These Spider-Men have grown more powerful than we feared. Magic portals, subway cars disappearing off the tracks, fire engines flying through the night sky, and the newer Spider-Man at the center. Webbing and property damage weren't enough. Now we add mystical arts into the mix. Does their desire for destruction know no bounds? I almost feel sorry for this lost soul. Groom for a life of criminality and degradation. Speaking of it, it seems Spider-Man was cohorting with notorious thief, the Black Cat. Their costumes must be cut from the same corrupt claw. If their entanglement doesn't paint a clear enough picture of Spider-Man's intent, then here's a little story for you. The Spider-Men show up, and the group we now know as the Hunters follow. Clearer now? These Spider-Men are magnets for malefactors. Now, the Black Cat seems to have vanished. Good riddance! If magic is indeed real, then we must hope upon hope that someone out there is using it for good and will erase the stain in our city known as the Spider-Men. May we go one day without another spider incident. There we go. Hey! Hey, Pete! Watch this! Uh... Woo! Oh! You okay? Come on. Let's see what else this thing can do. What are you doing? Science, buddy. I'm doing science. <laughs> so, Spider-Man, you told MJ, but not your best friend? To protect you. I, I wanted to. Right. Yeah, I get it. And that kid you're tutoring, he's the other one? Uh, a lot happened while you were in that tank. Trust me, 
I know. <laughs> nice and gentle. Whoops. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna make some coffee. It looks like it's gonna be a long night. What the hell happened here? Um, we were, we were just, um, uh, doing some experiments. Where's Dr. Connors? Uh, maybe he took the day off? No. He doesn't take days off. I'm gonna go. Yeah. Yeah, I'll call you later. I need a minute. Harry's got superpowers? This is all happening so fast. Wait, what's that? Hey, guys. I'm getting a strange spider bot signal. You got that, too? Uh, Genki, you testing something? I was just about to call you guys. A bunch of them just pinged the network out of nowhere. They're using some funky wireless protocols. I'll check it out and let you know what I find. Looking sharp. Uploading info to the Spidey server. Got it. I'll keep an eye out for more. Send me the data when you find them. I'll try to track down who made them. Hey, long night? Hey, MJ. Harry and I stayed up doing tests on his suit. And we may have had too much pizza. It was really nice. <laughs> Just like the good old days. So I gotta know, what's Harry's radioactive spider? I've never seen anything like this before. It's some kind of exosuit that completely eradicates any trace of his disease. Dr. Connors really outdid himself this time. That's incredible. And great timing, considering what happened at the park. Any leads on where they might have taken Tombstone? Not yet, but if I hear anything, you're my first call. Oh, you're the best. Yeah, I know. Okay, what's next? I still haven't figured out who made that weird spider bot. Hey, watch the traffic. Nobody's teaching class in the ER today. That's perfect. Is that a good photo, Spider-Man? They sent it to the student newspaper. The Spider-Man aren't the only superheroes in New York. Getting students to class on time? One of the greatest powers I've ever seen. Hey, Yuri. I track the followers of the flame to an abandoned clinic in Chinatown. We go together, maybe we'll find their boss. So you can leave them to die too? Not unless I have to. Look, this call needs to be stopped. You want to come along, it'd make things easier. But I don't need you. If I win, I could keep an eye on her. Danicast clan, let's talk about Coney Island. First off, the latest news from first responders is many injuries, but... No fatalities, small blessings. But we have got a lot of unknowns. Who perpetrated the attack? Who was the man who helped Spider-Man? I've gotta be honest, folks, this is giving me not good flashbacks to the underground and rocks on brawls of last year. Here's hoping that with two Spider-Men in town, we can steer away from more citywide chaos. Anyone who tells you these things happen for a reason should be cursed with Wet socks. Forever. Huh. 
If you weren't a robot, you'd definitely be venomous. Inside? Nope. How is this going to work? Just team up like normal or how long you been tracking these guys? A few weeks. Heard rumors for a while. They leave bodies in their wake. They care a lot about the Crimson Hour, whatever that is. <laughs> the hot new club in Hell's Kitchen. Wow, that just Popped out there, huh? Who says stuff like that? Not me. Let's all mine. We shouldn't show off. When we find their boss, how will we know it's their boss? Something tells me these people aren't fans of subtlety. Let's look around. The guy I rescued who tried to leave the cult. If he's smart, he's left the state by now. I don't think they've been here for long. Maybe a month at best. Take out the cultists and keep moving? Sounds good. So, it's been, what, a year and a half since... How have you been? You don't have to do this now. We're here on the job. I have them now. He's trying to web Getting up soon. No signs of their boss yet. Let's keep going. Uh, it's locked. And I bet forcing it will trigger an alarm. Doesn't look like it takes keys. Must be a way to unlock it around here. Is this supposed to be a good thing or a bad thing? How does any of that look good? Looks like the cult uses tattoos to show off their ranks. Seems like new recruits are always paired up when they join. Good way to keep an eye on everyone. Wait, I've got an idea. You want to share with the class? Just watch. That's it. The door only opens when it sees the correct pair of tattoos. I've got mine. You see anyone with a Hephaestus tattoo? Please, please don't wake up. And not the tattoo I'm looking for. There we go. Second time's the charm. So, you got any tattoos? Just the one of Spider Cop's gravestone. Come on, really? <laughs> if you run away again... He won't be so forgiving. Trust the flame. For everything burns. <laughs> For everything burns. You hear that somewhere before? They didn't see that coming. Let's check on the prisoners. We'll get you out of here. The door controls are in the next room. Hurry! How many followers are in the building? I... 
I don't know. A lot. We're gonna get you out of here as soon as we can. Please. I'm not supposed to be here. We'll find a way to get you out. If the flame lets you. Hey, you okay in there? Hello? We're here to help. Don't be so loud. So the controls are in the next room. Someone's bound to see us if we go through the doors. If they're the followers of the flame, is that the flame holding Corp down there? I don't think so. He is still worthy. Let all doubt be washed away as we celebrate this ember's passage from Typhon to Hephaestus. You doing okay? You sound... I'm peachy. <laughs> no longer will you need to hide your true self from the world. For now, there is no way in which the world <laughs> will Looks like there's no other exit out of this room. Let's hope there's more here than that screensaver. The brand is both the shield and sword. It will be your greatest source of resilience and your greatest source of strength. Found him! There's no place for you in the new world! See the door controls anywhere? I'm not sure. The wiring for the cells leads right here. Come on! We really need to stop meeting like this, Yuri. People will think you're trying to kill me. Never thought you'd be able to trick anyone into joining one of your little clubs again. Love is not a trick. None of this is love. I extended my hand when nobody else would. I doubt you, nor the fool's beacon there, would have done the same. But what? Would it take for you to love me? Tell me where you're hiding and I'll show you. <laughs> the old hospital north of Astoria. Stop by any time. If you're both worthy. You knew who the flame was this whole time? No! I had my suspicions, but I wasn't sure until I saw it. Take four! How do you two know each other? He ran another group like this when I was a cop. I shut them down, but he got away. The flame's not even here. We have to go after him. After we help the prisoners get out. the door? Why not? Yeah! 
So this is the first time you've seen him since he got away? I tried to track him down for months. Another ah. got in the way. I knew he was around. What ah. fate is fire! And the followers of the flame, are they like his old group? The old group is alive. You see those? I don't know what's bigger. Their numbers or their cards. Ah. Nice and quick. Now let's get those folks out of here. Shouldn't take us long to get to the hospital. Yuri! This is the most obvious trap I've ever seen! And I fought Trapster. We can't wait on this one. You don't know him. I do know that we can't help anyone if we rush in there and get killed. We need a plan. I'll scout out this hospital base of his and make sure everything's safe. Happy? That's one word for it, sure. Another word would be slightly less stressed. Someone needs help with a photography project. Not sure how Spider-Man can help, but I'll give it a try. Have you heard the one about the criminal who went to prison and came out a better person? Me either! But that's what Quentin Beck would have us believe. After his numerous crime sprees, <laughs> who could forget when he made Spider-Man look like a moron chasing an imaginary flying bus of school children while he made off with two million in diamonds? He finally landed himself where he belonged, behind bars. <laughs> now he's out and wants us to accept him back into society as a fully rehabilitated individual. Let me tell you something. I know one thing to be 100% certain. People do not change. Once a criminal, always a criminal. I don't know if this was a clerical error in our judicial system, but there is no way this man has paid his dues and repented for the damage he's caused. Do not trust this con artist. Attend his attractions at your own risk. And while we're at it, I can think of two other costume criminals that belong in prison with Beck. But that's for another podcast. Hey! Gotcha! Hello to you as well. Ah, uh, I wanted to get a candid shot. I want to be a real photojournalist, you know? Document the city as it is. Like this photo, captured by Peter Parker. That was his first cover photo way back in the day. I want to do that. Oh, wow. Can't believe you have this. First cover. I think I actually remember when he took that. Mr. Jameson? It's Peter Parker. I called about selling you some photos. See, my uncle just passed and our mortgage is due and- Parker, I didn't ask for your life story. Sorry. I'm sitting outside the bugle finishing my coffee. If you can get here before I'm done, I'll look at your photos. But I'm warning you, I drink fast. But Mr. Jameson, I'm biking down fifth. The traffic- If you want something, you go after it. But- Tell me something. Are you a New Yorker or some slack-jawed tourist? Um, New Yorker? Then when something's in your path, you yell, coming through! Hey, and if something blocks you, Lord's go around. Moving. New Yorkers on, always find a way. I clearly you know why me. people live in this town? Is it the cheap rent, the low cost of living? No. This godforsaken hellhole is the greatest city ever created. Oh no, fish. Stop looking for an excuse and keep going. Uh, the smell. Breathe it in, Parker. That's old to Big Apple. 
Oh no, construction ahead. I'll never get it. Eyes on the prize, Parker. Excuse me, can I come through? You're a New Yorker. Tell them you're coming through. Say, look out, halfwit. These are my streets. Hey, halfwit. No, oh, sorry, excuse me, scooting by. Uh, Parker, pathetic. Be a man about it. Show them your manhood. Yes, sir. I'm almost there. I'll cut through Washington Square Park. I'm a few steps away from killing this coffee, Parker. You better haul ass. Kid's gonna get himself killed. Thanks. Stop sounding so timid. Sorry. And stop apologizing. Is that guy getting mugged? Happens all the time, Parker. Act like you live here. Be a New Yorker. A million people in this place, sweetheart. Spidey ain't coming. Hey, leave him alone. What'd you say, you little toothpick? Hey, what are you, a tourist slack mouth? Just kidding! What'd you say, you little Betsy, he's going down. Did your mom knit that ski mask for you? Cause it's really cute, seriously. You're gonna pay for that. Yeah. The bigger you are, the stop get your fat. I didn't mean that. Switch your little. I did it. It was fun, even. You okay? I am. Because you stopped to help. Thanks. Looks like they roughed up my bike, too. Uh oh, my photos. All but one of them are ruined. May needs this money. And I need this job. I can do this on foot. I have to. Out of the way! I'm a New Yorker! Coming through, people! Come on, come on! Where is he? <laughs> Mr. Jameson? Peter Parker. You're late. I have something you're gonna wanna put on the front page of the Bugle. Cocky little guy, aren't you? Just trying to wear my confidence on the outside, like a New Yorker. Parker, this is terrible. Your lighting is flat, your composition is awful. God knows why you're shooting on film like some kind of caveman. And your nose is bleeding. But you're in luck. I need a picture of the spider creep for tomorrow's front page. Congratulations! You're officially a Bugle photographer. Really? Thank you, sir. You won't regret it. Are you okay? Because you've been staring at that for like five minutes. Yeah, yeah. So, can you tell me how to meet this guy? Peter Parker? You don't want his career. You want yours. But what I can tell you is that he learned to go after what he wanted. And if one route didn't work, to find another way around. Okay, I'll find another way. Give me an action shot I can bring to the Bugle. Oh, well, sure. This good? Yeah, and when you jump, angle left so I get your silhouette. I... I will. You got it. Ready, set, jump! Go, Spidey! See you next time! <laughs> Look out, turkeys! New York are coming through!
spiders. Got something for you. Head to this location. Felicia? Hey, Felicia. Heard some chatter about the steel foundry in Williamsburg off a radio I swiped from those hunters. Sounds like tombstones there. He could use your help. Thanks. Glad you're all right. Did you make it to Paris in time? Yeah, I did. Figured I owed you one. Both of you. Even if the other Spider-Man couldn't be bothered to make an appearance. Uh, yeah, about... You can the... save the explanation. We've both moved on. He's a good one, by the way. He really is! Well, thanks for the tip. Not sure I'd be able to find Tombstone in time without you. Yeah, thanks. Take care of yourself. Those fashion school rejects won't be getting the drop on me again. Ta-ta, spiders. Miles, let me take this one. You're gonna miss your essay deadline. What if... If Lee's there, I'll take care of him. Spider-Man can wait. Miles can't. <sighs> All right. Just keep in touch. I hope Felicia's lead was right. Gotta get the tombstone before Craven crosses him off his list, too. this. Yeah! It's perfect. Brooklyn Visions is the best. Huh. I'm gonna miss this place when I go to college.
an abandoned foundry, this place sure is active. What is taking them so long? Extra precautions. Tombstone has proven challenging. Right. Stay ready. Hunt to live? Live to hunt. Need to clear these rooftops and find a way in. It's lousy with hunters. If it's all for me, I'm honored. Hey, finally finished with my dad. Still no clue where Dr. Connors is. I haven't seen dad look this stressed in a while. We'll find Connors. Why don't you call MJ and ask her to go swing by his house? Yeah, good idea. I'll meet you back at the Foundation once I'm done here. What are you up to? Need a hand? In Williamsburg, at the old steel foundry. Sounds like they're holding Tombstone here. Sounds like a job for the Spider Pals. That is not what we're calling ourselves. Well, what do you and the other guy go by? I don't know. Spider-Men? Spider-Mans? That's... confusing. I should go. This place is crawling with hunters. So you do need help? No, do not come here. These people are deadly. Can't risk you getting hurt. Talk soon. We must not fail Craven again. Keep it. No one can... Take five. We'll need a clear exit. Gotta get rid of all the hunters before I go inside. This smokestack looks like my ticket in. Just got off the phone with MJ. She says she'll head over to Connor soon. That's great news. Yeah, just making sure. You said the steel foundry, right? Yeah. What are you doing? Cardio. Get back to your workout. I have to find Tombstone quick before he ends up like Scorpion. We lost communication outside. Tighten security around Tombstone. Calling reinforcements. Reinforcements? Better play this quietly. Tombstone is unlike any beast I've faced. Rather deal with Tombstone than Black Cat. She sent some of the others to Antarctica. I'm on his trail. During my last hunt with Craven, we tracked our prey for two weeks. <laughs> Sleep tight. He will not. <gasps>
Spider-Man's up there. Spider! Do not let him interfere! Get down! <laughs> I think that's the last of them. You guys just can't make it easy. <laughs> Harry? What are you doing here? I'm helping you out, Spider-Man. You're welcome, by the way. I was hoping to do this quietly. Is this my fault? You go left, I go right. Let's do this. I know you said you had this, but come on, look at us. Honestly, kind of hope to start you off with something easier. What better way to learn than on-the-job training? Yeah. Never felt so strong. Don't let it get to your head. We're not invincible. Punching bad guys. I've had to make some hard choices too. That's the gig. Watch out! They're on the platforms, too! I got them! Just stay out of the line of fire and thin out these hunters! Do you think this suit is bulletproof? Now is not the time to find out! Land then! I'm working on it! Get to that back balcony! on how to take that thing down. I'm all ears. Up there, the back. I have an idea. Watch the back. Let's go rescue a supervillain. Reformed supervillain. But still a guy who's tried to kill you a few times. He's trying to change. I want to help him. Man, you really do believe in the best of everyone. All right, let's... Come on! Gotta hit them before they hit us! Uh, here we go again. another one? Get it! Love your enthusiasm, but I like to work smarter, not harder. What's the matter? We got this. We do until we don't. Understood. I won't let you down. 
You okay with all this fire? Yeah, actually. Not even breaking a sweat. Get out of the way! This escalating quickly. It always does. Your boy. I got something for you. Getting a little hairy here. If we don't move, it won't see us. Well, that was wishful thinking. They're here! What was that thing with your suit? I don't know. That alarm really messed with my head. Just glad you're all right. Arrows, machetes, rockets, now robot birds? Don't forget the robot dogs! What's gonna try to kill us next? Depth here. Sure, we can do this? Of course. We're the Spider Pals. All right. Yeah! Oh! There's our guy. 
What's the plan? I think we should get him. What? I'll run a distraction. See if you can break him free. On it. They grow up so fast. I'm gonna break you out of here, okay? You can't. They rigged this whole thing. Then I'll derig it. What did I just tell you? Sorry, it's my first day. Gonna need a hand here! Be right back. Are they getting bigger? One more time into the fire? You're making jokes at a time like this? Part of the job. The spire Hey, you owe me one! Where do they keep coming from? Some sort of booking agency? We have to turn off this furnace! There! If we can overload the machine with a coolant, it should shut down! in time to shut down the furnace. All right, this should... You trying to kill everyone here? What's the plan? Sorry. They don't quit. Well, neither do we. Getting hot in here. I haven't noticed. I think this suit is fireproof. Lucky you. We don't have time for this. What do we do? Hunt faster. That I can do. We gotta get Tombstone out. Maybe we can weaken the cage. There. Pull out those supports. Call me crazy. But this might be one of the best days of my life. We really need to get you out more. <laughs> Don't die, don't die. Only two left. What's this thing made of? I don't know, but this place is falling apart. Keep trying. It's not working. Just hang on. We need to pull those supports down. Unleash the bullet.
Now what? done wonders for my mental health. Who trying to die here? Move it! No, 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 no! We lost him! Don't panic! Quick, this way! Harry! Harry! We gotta keep moving. Hold up! Can you see if we were followed? <sighs> On it. Only downside to going straight. The game keeps you in shape. Glad we got to you in time. Some of the others weren't so lucky. <laughs> they couldn't have off me if they tried. Sides, they were waiting for their boss to do the deed. You have someplace safe to go? Yeah. They come for me again, I'll be ready. Tell your friend thanks for looking out for me. See you around, Spider. Yeah. Looks like they split. We should too. Yeah. Hey, good job back there. Really? I was pretty sure I was just messing everything up. You were, but in the best possible way. What are you... Hold on. <laughs> Sorry. I'm still figuring out how this thing works. <laughs> nice design. What do you mean? Didn't you just... Huh? <laughs> I guess I did. <laughs> Would you look at that? I guess we really are spider pals now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna head back to the lab, see if Dr. Connors has showed up yet. Good call. I'll catch up with you soon. because you saw a millipede again. Better check in with Pete first. Hey, Miles. Yo, man. It's been a minute. You need any spider help? Actually, we're all good. We managed to rescue Tombstone before Craven could get his hands on him. We? Oh, long story short, my buddy Harry, he has some sort of power suit. He can kick all kinds of butt with it. He's gonna be a big help with these hunters, that's for sure. Wait, is he one of us now? Sort of? It's all happening fast, but we'll talk later. Gotta run. Talk later. He says that a lot. Okay. Better see what's going on with Ma. Yeah. <laughs> 
a look around. Just taking a little peek inside. What else is at this base? A couple of webs should do the trick. I still need the base location. One more blind to go. on the trial of the century, the people of New York versus Norman Osborn. You remember Democrat, how Mayor Norman was indirectly responsible for poisoning the city a couple years back? Well, his lawyers have slowed the march of justice down yet again with more delays. Our source inside the courtroom tells me they're bringing frivolous motions to prolong discovery. <sighs> All love to my legal eagle friends, but some days you just gotta say it. Screw you. All right, see you next time, kids. Perfect for Robbie. Reminds me of the people who ride into the bugle. And a few who work there. Freedom of speech is a beautiful thing. But saying a thing over and over again doesn't make it true. <laughs> that looks like one of Beck's Mysterious. I thought they were gonna shut these down. Need some help? The Mysterium is infected with a virus or something, and it's trapped someone inside. If you execute the breakpoint condition, the system should reset. Just try not to get hurt in the process. How would I get hurt if it's just an illusion? That, my friend, is what we're trying to find out.
think I did it? That was a nightmare. Well, the nightmare is over. You're safe now. We have enough data, but don't let that stop you from jumping in again. Oh, you found one of our dev diaries. This is a project Betsy was passionate about. Unfortunately, more people are trapped in Mysteriums throughout the city. Oh, we must find out who is behind this and bring them to justice. This whole Mysterium thing feels shady. But if there are people trapped, I gotta help them. And try to figure out what's really going on. Your pain is real! 
make such a difference for the community. Thank you so much for your support. Okay, bye-bye. Miles. Hey, Ma. Babe, mm. siéntate. I just wanted to check in, see how you're doing. Todo bien? Mm. Fine. Everything's good. <sighs> okay. It's just a lot right now. So much to take care of in the city. <sighs> Super stressed about my college essay. Pete's busy doing other stuff. And Lee. Lee's still out there. Doesn't that bother you? Of course it bothers me. But I'm committed to making this community better. I've got to let go of things that don't serve me and focus on where I want to go, not where I've been. ¿Entiendes lo que te digo? Yeah. But Lee? I can't just let him go. Angela, I'm gonna have to call you back. No, how can you be locked out? You have a key. Oh. No, no, I, I understand the urgency. Uh, let me make some calls. Okay. Mom, do you need me to go? Didn't you just finish telling me how busy you are? Yeah, but I always have time for my community. Okay, Ma, where am I headed? Harlem Cultural Center, 116th and Convent. That was my friend Angela on the phone. She's the curator, and she's trying to give a prospective donor a private tour. But the security system locked her out. Whoops! Awkward! Angela lined up a bunch of items for a new music exhibit, but the funding fell through. And if this donor doesn't cover the costs, the museum might have to close. I'll make sure they get in. I'm passionate about preserving the musical heritage of this community. But how can I donate to a museum where the security system isn't even functional? Darren, 
I hear your concerns, but I assure you this museum will be... Spider-Man? Oh, thank God. The system's locked us out, and it's not responding to any input at all. Let's see if I can figure out what's wrong with it. <laughs> Need to find the control panel. Control panel. <laughs> Relays are overloaded. Gotta get inside the walls to fix them. Let's patch things up so Angela can give that tour. Who are these guys? You sure the alarm won't go off? EMP took out the whole system. We're all alone in here. Just need to break this padlock and we're in. So that's how Angela got locked out. Better reset the system so I can get in there and stop these guys. There's a security room. Let's open it and see what's up. Hmm, not too bad. Let me fix it up real quick. Got it. But the system's still down. Gotta find the other relay boxes. Hey, Miles. I checked in with all the feast shelters. No one has seen Martin Lee. Thanks. I can't believe I let him get away when I could have. You know? Could have what? Made sure he didn't hurt anyone else. Right. Well, don't worry. I'll keep looking. Keep following that wiring. There must be some valuable stuff in here. These guys seem like pros. This back online. Nice. But the system's still down. There must be more relays. Zax and Drum are already in the truck, right? Yeah. But we got time. And a lot more room in the trucks. Gotta get past these guys without being spotted. How about a distraction in the key of C? some kind of joke on me. I should stay out of sight as much as I can through here. Keep it together, man. Don't you punk out on me. You could do this. Another vent above that guy. Okay? I ran into a snag, but I'm handling it. While you're there, check out some of the instruments. Get you ready for college. Ma, I'm going into music tech. Computers are my instruments. Music starts with a human, their instrument and their soul. When you're mixing or sampling, you have to listen close and capture that soul. Computers can't do that. You know how old you sound right now? Old and wise? stronger signal now. Looks like there's one more relay to bring back online. Oh, man. Gotta get all the way across the room. How much time we got? 
couple minutes. Grab the last few things and get ready to load them into the trucks. Copy that. Last relay online, then head to the voting dock. Who did that? Abort! Let's roll! Nice work, Spatterbot. Now it's my turn. Spider-Man, the front door's finally open. But there is a bunch of stuff missing. It's all up back in the loading docks. And I'll make sure it stays there. Let's get out of here, quick! Go, go, go! That's gotta be his. Webs. Just what I was afraid of. Here we go! Get Spider-Man! Yeah. Yeah. said this would be an in-and-out job. Yeah. Spider-Man's here! Yeah. Whatever! Take him out! Tell your boss, don't go messing with my neighborhood. We got this, we got this. Hold him here. Meet at the rendezvous point you now. Not today. those trucks. Uh, gotta pick one for now. Give it up, guys. You're not getting away. Funky drummer.
They only recovered items from one truck? What a mess. Sorry, Angela. This is a deal breaker. There goes our best hope for a big donor. There's still the fundraising gala. If we don't find that second truck, there is no exhibit. Without an exhibit, there is no gala. Without a gala, the museum will have to close. That won't happen. I promise. Here. This belonged to Clyde Stubblefield. Ooh, the original funky drummer. <laughs> Do you know how often his rhythms were sampled? <gasps> he was so influential, a direct line from funk to hip hop. <laughs> Thank you. And don't worry, I'll find the rest of those items. Thank you. I should check in with Pete. Hey, bro, you have a sec? Of course. Uh, actually, uh, Harry's calling. I have to take this. Catch up later? Oh, uh, sure, man. Later. Hey, Pete, I'm at EMF. No sign of Doc Connors yet, but I could use an extra set of eyes. On my way. Have you heard anything from MJ? You said she's stopping by his house, right? Nothing yet. She told me she'd call when she got there. Let's hope he's just taking a sick day. Yeah, definitely. I'm gonna check her office. Just come by when you can. Uncle Aaron stashed some tech near the stadium? to reveal the stash. A generator? It must be supplying power to something. like some trouble with the current. My web can conduct that electricity easy. the stash. Ah, <sighs> uh, you found my stash by the stadium. Now that was my favorite. How come? <laughs> Let's just say I had a New York City that no 
no one else knew about. I used to tap into the stadium's mainframe and watch the games through my problem mask. What? No way. It was like sitting courtside for free 99 Maybe we can hold on to this Prowler discount. You know, at least during the season. No can do, Ma. Gotta get our nosebleeds like everyone else. But the tortures are finally good. Sorry, guys. But beach day is canceled. This is for your own good. Sand crystals, all mine now. I lose the grapes at the school and come home. Walk through the front door. But you're not there. They are. What have they done to you, Kimia? Craven's real evil for having his people drag Marco's kid into this. Gotta find more crystals to figure out what went down. Marco's memory is returning and he's agitated. The doctors are piecing together what happened. It, it sounds like it's not all his fault. Let you know if I hear more. Oh. Ma left me a message. Miles, about the stolen museum pieces. I went to the impound yard and saw an old phone number on that truck you chased down. I may be onto something. Can you come meet your mama for lunch at the park by my office? Chopped cheese on me. Any clue is a good clue. If we can't find that truck, the museum will have to close. Plus, I never turn out a chopped cheese. Wherever hey, you friend, go, I have got a very I I had a tail. Hey, get this. It looks like these imposter spider bots are getting pinged by some third party. Like someone else is tracking them? Exactly. I just need to figure out who. Collect any others you can find. I need all the data I can get. Nice one, Genki. Got us one step closer to solving this trick. You want to survive? You have to go through me. 
are back to operating safely, it'd be great to get a Spider-Man endorsement. Pro bono, of course. <laughs> We're running out of capital here, and it's making Quentin quite anxious. Anyway, just a thought. No need to call back. Uh, bye. Sorry, Betsy. We have a firm rule against Spidey endorsements. Might want to rethink that business plan. Uncle Aaron's got a stash here. Better find it. Box? Guess I'm zapping my way in. <clears throat> that didn't open the door, but it activated that first switch. Must be more circuit boxes nearby that activate the rest of them. <clears throat> There's a box. must have set these on a timer. I'm gonna have to spark each box before it runs out. all of them. Should have access to the stash now. Hmm. Now 
Now you're really bringing me back, kid. My very first stash. Why in Queensbridge? The Moon Turtle Arcade. Or at least it used to be. They tore it down and built that skyscraper. Your dad and me basically lived there when we were little. I used to run out of quarters so fast. But Jay would always spot me some kid. I'd give anything to go back to that arcade with my big brother. One more time. I'm missing. Me too, Unc. Wish Dad and Uncle Aaron could have made things right before he... Yeah. I think there's a prowler stash nearby. There it is. I might have to move that somewhere else.
opened up plenty of these before. Don't mind if I do. After his tank. Everything good, kid? Got a few unauthorized access attempts for my stash in the shipping yard. Ran into Craven's hunters. You were right about them wanting your tech. They must be real good if they found you. Even your dad wasn't able to. Dad? It was the first showdown between Officer Jefferson Davis and Prowler. I had to hide in that shipping container for hours just to lose him. Almost wish he'd caught me right then and there. Never wanted him to get involved. Well, I'm glad you're out of the game now. Stay safe, Unc. Same, man. Will do. someone tagged your shop yes it was hideous until someone else showed up and painted over it such detailed work best thing to ever happen to me business has never boomed no bloomed like <laughs> this <laughs> that is gorgeous well when you see them tell them I said thank you mm. oh, here she is you can thank her yourself hey Miss, thank you for your services.
Wow. <laughs> You're amazing. You know that? Wait, 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 wait. I thought you were here buying flowers for them. Enjoy the autumn sunshine, Bouquet. me. They were labeled order for music man. Not very cryptic. Oh, well, hey, I want to support what you do for them. It's really cool. Thanks. You're really cool. Later, music man. This is more than an illusion. This may get violent. That's the plan. Be sure to look both ways before crossing, Spider-Man. I know this is all an illusion, but it feels so real. However much time you need, you're safe. Another message from Betsy. Hi, Spider-Man. Betsy here again. I have Cole here with me while Quentin is off doing some focused work. You mean off being all weird and moody? Dude needs to talk to some. Yes, well, 
I'm working on getting him some help. We're all a little stressed. Which is why I'd like to ask if you can expedite your work on the Mysteriums. The sooner we can fix this, the sooner Quentin will return to his usual brilliant self. Sounds like Beck is taking this hard. I feel for him. Mask is showing a prowler stash close by. There it is. Should be able to move that, no problem. The webs will keep the will in place. for me. Hmm. Hey, Miles. Got an alert from the stash at my old place. You live in that penthouse? Back in the early Prowler days, when I was on Fisk's payroll. Fisk? Yeah, I know. You'll remember when I got the keys. I wanted to impress my big bro so badly, but he was ashamed because he knew how I got it. Whatever Dad felt, I know he always loved you. Appreciate that, nephew. Maybe one day I'll believe it. Still a lot I don't know about Uncle Aaron and Dad. Wonder what other stories they had. Enter at your own risk. The fun really starts. Get me out of here! Help! I'm working on it. Move fast, Spider-Man, or you will never escape. Can't let him hit me. Reality. You can only feel it. Hmm. Deep. You can't save anyone if you can't yeah. save yourself. Yeah. Take down Mysterio!
Thanks, boy, man. You're all right. Take a breath, try to relax. I think I know how to use this. <laughs> Look at that little face. Are those tiny stickers? through a lot. Betsy called again? Let's see what she had to say. Hello, Spider-Man. Um, I just wanted to let you know that Quinn has agreed to enter some court-monitored counseling to help him with his post-prison transition. Finally. Cole, please be respectful. He's been through a lot. Sorry. I'm just... I just 
glad he's getting help. You know? Anyway, Quinn asked me to pass this along. He thinks he's close to figuring out what's going on. So just keep up the good work, Spider-Man. Good on Beck for going into counseling. We all need help sometimes. Spider-Man, thank you for coming. I'm looking for my Grandpa Earl. He kept talking about meeting someone here, and now he's gone, and... Can you please help me find him? Any clues on where he might be? Just this picture. He was staring at it all morning. Hmm. This looks familiar. Some kind of exhibit. This looks like it was taken 60 years ago. Around the same time of year, too. I'll find him. Don't worry. Please hurry. He gets confused, and I just don't want him to get scared or hurt or... <sighs> don't worry. I'll find him. That picture had some animal in the background. Maybe an exhibit? Hmm. No, Grandpa. Let's see what I can find. Those flowers by the sea lion pool. Is something else there? My wonderful Earl. Yep. This is him. Hey, I didn't find your grandpa yet, but I did find a note for him. It name drops a botanical garden. My grandparents used to take weekend walks through the botanical gardens. That has to be where he is. has grandpa's name on it. It can't be too far. If I could figure out what's in the inhaler, I could probably create a trail leading to grandpa. Hmm. Hey, your grandpa isn't at the gardens, but I was able to create a trail using his inhaler. That should lead me right to him. Oh, no, really? Please hurry. He needs that thing like he needs lungs. <sighs> Lately, I've been so busy. Sometimes taking care of him felt like a thing I had to do. But the thought of losing him... All I want is to sit with him. What's wrong with me? Don't be so hard on yourself. Look, trying to keep responsibility straight is tough. Trust me, I get it. You're doing your best.
found him by the lake. I'll hang with him until you get here. You did? I'm on my way. Stay right there. Hey there, sir. Spider-Man? Whatever you think I did, I didn't. <laughs> Your granddaughter's looking for you, sir. Granddaughter? Oh. Well, tell her I'll be back in a minute. I propose to my wife here. Right here, where we sit. Man, you're making the rest of us look bad. How'd you ask? First off, we had to go to the zoo. Never met a soul who loved animals more than that woman. I was terrified. I meant to ask her at the meerkats. <laughs> she said they reminded her of me. But my knees were knocking, man. I couldn't see straight. We left the zoo and just kept walking. Ended up here. She... <laughs> if you saw her, man, just... Perfect, but clumsy. Nearly fell into that pond there, <laughs> face first. You ever been in love, Spider-Man? I, uh, maybe. It's beautiful. Nothing more beautiful. Can I tell you something, Spider-Man? I know I'm fading. It's scary as hell. I'd be ready, but nothing gets you ready. Nothing. When I'm here, it's like she is too. Like I'm living it all over again. All nervous and sweating and whatnot. Then I look into her eyes and it's like I'm home. I was so nervous that day, Spider-Man. Almost didn't even ask. It's like I blinked, and she's gone. I'm sorry. You said my granddaughter was looking for me? Let's go see her. I should have guessed you'd come here. Sorry we lost track of each other. It was my fault for wandering off. But Spider-Man took good care of me. Had a nice chat about your grandma. Oh, yeah? She used to love this spot, huh? I feel like I spent every weekend here with her, feeding the ducks. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. I don't know much, but I know that she loved you. I know, Grandpa. She was always saying, Tasha, if you don't eat that sandwich, they will. Tasha, you're funny like her. Too funny, kid. That's good. You gotta hand it to New Yorkers. I wasn't even trying to be funny there. If there's a good time to be had, they'll find it. memory crystal. Let's get it. Get 
how there's so many of you! I'll give the sand crystal right back! I promise! some strong stuff to sedate Sam, man. And what happened to Kimia? figure out a team name. Pete didn't mention Spider Pals? Any sign of Connors? Nothing yet. It's MJ. Bad news. Connors' house is crawling with hunters and the doctor's MIA. Good news. I think I know where to find him. Somewhere across the river. Maybe around. Let's move. He's waiting.
Where the gear? Sable paid off sooner than I'd hoped. The zoo. Connors has to be around here somewhere. I have to tell Pete. That window looks open. Then late. Where is that van? Genome readout. They're trying to reactivate his reptile genes. They've been studying Dr. Connors. Oh God, they want to hunt him too. in there after all this time perhaps he will finally get what he has longed for looks like they've set up shop here mm. looks right <clears throat> hello you know I don't like being snuck up on So many have tried to kill him, human and beast. I don't believe it's possible. You're right. Buried alive beneath rubble, grabbed in the jaws of a lion. I know he hopes to die. <laughs> On my way there. That would be my weakness, but no. Not even that could save him. He's dead. Phone. Got her cell phone. Oh, please don't tell me. Harry, it's MJ. I'm at an abandoned zoo in Jersey. It's. Don't understand. <laughs> A 
Let's get you out of there, Doc. They used a code to get in the cage. And Connor's shackles need that key. Just have to find them. This is a waste of my... <laughs> This 
looks right. The hunter who input that code has to be nearby. I've only seen one of Craven's hunts in person. I must be preparing I these for Craven. About it. This one will be special. The hunt of a lifetime. <laughs> Checking it out. <sighs> the hunter with the code came this way. Where is she? Come on. Who doesn't write down their passwords? <laughs> Simkarian. He called himself Mongoose. Huh. Mongoose. Maybe whoever that is knows the code. Just need to convince them I'm Vika. Some kind of ranking system. Looks like she's high ranking. Good to know. I need assistance. Radio designations. Let's find out who this mongoose is. Garin, my trusty subordinate. Vika, mongoose Bojo, Balasoy. They'll see right through me. I need to figure out who Vika is. Simkarian poetry must be her first language. Vegre, yo hear. Her Simkarian is perfect. Hopefully, mine is convincing. All right, let's get that code. Come on, MJ. Her Simkarian is still good. Enough. Just answer. Itvika, Vika, Monguznok. Vika, the tech voice. Garin elegem vana hiva shait bol. Hol vana ka kezulekes kodok. A kodok, sorosata os informatios tablan van. Tudhatnád? Te pedig azt tudhatnád. Milyen hongon beszélhetsz velem. Ne hív többet, mert a fejed be kerülhet. I felt kind of nice. All right, better move before he comes looking. Where's that whiteboard? There you are. Codes for the enclosure. All right, Connors, let's get out of here. Move. Do you think we've done enough? We will find out. Sounds like Craven is on his way here. We have to get out of here. Fast. A generator. Could cause a good distraction.
More hunters must be coming. this beast. His name is Kurt Connors. He's a good man. There's a lab in the atrium. Might have a syrup. Syrup! I don't have much time. Then we'll buy you some. Right up the hill. That glass building. Please, hurry. We'll clear a path. Keep your heads down. Don't worry, Doc. Get you to that lab. You're not turning tonight. I'm on target. <laughs> These hunters must have a death wish. Push tombstone. Have a lizard. Seems like they're just doing their bosses dirty work. Their benefits must be crazy. Now look who's joking in a bad time. You're learning. <laughs> Okay, the lab is right there. MJ, move ahead, but stay low. Got it. Got some hunters swapping our route. They even brought some animals from home. Guys, it's not looking good. I, I can feel it. Please. We're almost there, Doc. Focus on breathing. Okay. Okay. Clear. Let's move. This, this 
Watch this, I can use this to make an antidote. He's here. Nothing. Remember in fifth grade when you. No. No. You gotta stay awake, buddy. Wait. MJ, get him out of here. I'll handle this. Locked on! 
And I feel sorry for him. MJ, I'm on my way. What are you? Track the lizard. The spider is mine. Stop hovering. I'm fine. Maybe some water. Water. On it. So... The suit cured your... Yeah. Which means without it, you... Yeah. Okay. We gotta figure out how to get this back onto Harry. How did you give it to me? I... I, I don't know, it just... sort of happened. Okay. Uh, let me try. Pete, there's something in here. What? Uh, uh. Okay, not what I... What the... Uh. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, I'm fine. Let me try it again. Dr. Connors. Except he's a drooling reptile right now. Craven! The serum! He had it around his neck. That's what he used on Dr. Connors. If we find that serum, we, we could analyze it, use the equipment here to, to engineer a cure. And bring Dr. Connors back from the land of the lizard. I'll start tracking down Craven. He's probably already cleared out of that zoo by now. Well, lucky for us. He left a piece of himself behind. There's this pawn shop in Little Odessa that specializes in rare artifacts, just like this knife. Let's start there. Good thinking. Weirdly enough, I feel energized. It does... did that for me, too. How does this thing work? Honestly, I can't explain it. I just think and the suit listens. Okay. Maybe it'll help with finding Craven and his serum. Just don't get stabbed this time, please. I usually try not to. I'll be fine, I promise.
Mysterium. Good looking out, Pete. drive anyway. heard by now that Mac Gargan, the Scorpion, has been found dead. 
His stinger removed like a trophy. One can only assume this was at the hands of the hunter. Are they doing what the ineffectual Spider-Men won't and removing these dangers permanently? Then again, maybe Spider-Man has finally changed his tune. I, for one, say, let them wipe each other out. They're not making our world a better place, and the less of these mass marauders roaming our streets, the better. When they're gone, we can turn the corner back to simpler times. Wouldn't that be refreshing? I yearn for the day. What happened? Hunters. They've been coming through here for days. Sorry I wasn't here to help. Nah. Could you tell me about this antique I found? It, uh, almost killed me. I cannot help you. I've seen this symbol before. Please leave. Wait! I can protect you from the hunters. I'm not worried about them. I thought I left this behind on Volgograd. The flames have been lit. This is his jungle now. Craven? Craven off. The flames have been lit. Huh. Dude! MJ told me you almost died. You okay? Hey, Miles. Actually, never felt better. I should have been... Wait, really? Positive. Hey, let me call you back. Got some bonfires to crash. Uh, okay. Do you think Craven would be at the feast tonight? <laughs> What's this I hear about lighting some fires? <laughs> Some kind of party. Wonder what they're celebrating. Pretty rude of Craven not to extend an invite. Never stopped me before, though. The celebration is even more. Do you have a city permit for that bonfire? they were up to. They're shipping in more luxury goods from Volgograd for this... event? 
These shipments have to be coming in nearby. No airfields here. But what about the docks? <gasps> Maybe something there can lead me to Craven. Don't make me ask again! Oh, I told you! I, I, that's everything! Where is the rest of our ship? Please! That guy needs my help. Kill! You are brave to steal. A lot of hunters for some vodka and caviar. This can get more painful than it needs to. Why is Craven doing all this now? Please! Sense. It is just us. No one can hear you scream. One second he's hunting supervillains, and now he's entertaining. Harry must have done a number on him at the zoo. to your boss? Dock worker. They did a number on him. There were so many of them. <clears throat> easy, easy. You're in pretty bad shape. Let me help you. Hospital. Please. There's one close by. <clears throat> You're gonna be okay. I thought they were going to kill me. What did they want? Some cargo it went missing on the journey. Here. They thought I took it. Sorry about the bumpy ride. You're safe. Now, where's the drop off? 718, Kent. Wonder how Harry's doing without the suit right now. Hey, buddy. How you feeling? I'm fine. What's happening? Craven, or Cravenoff, is hosting some party at 718 Kent. Figured I'd stop by. Looks like a social club. Hang on, I'm almost there. <laughs> Looks like a busy night. Hope our VIP is here. They're more riled up than usual. Just keep your head down. And... How are you getting in? Kitchen entrance. You should change. The classic Peter Parker look isn't gonna cut it. Too bad my tux is at the dry cleaners.
forget to mention the suit could turn into a tux. Oh, never did that with me. Hey, hey you, come over here. Take this to Mr. Kravenoff's bodyguard. His bodyguard? Dima, move. Well, sounds like your shift's starting. Yeah. I'll leave you to it. Better go find Dima. What is up? How are they eating so fast? Don't keep them waiting, move. Don't ignore me. I know you can hear me. Just get off my back and let me Five to the pack. That was 30 minutes ago. I need it now. Don't want any dead plates. Let's go. Swanky. Huh. I clean up pretty nice. And I'm feeling great. Excuse me. <laughs> Interesting choice. Keep moving or I'll break your bones. A 300-year-old sleeping dart will never work. You are so certain. Oh, yeah. Show me, then. <sighs> I'll show him, too. Yes? Take him. <laughs> Let him squirm. The poison is ancient, and you don't even know how to use that thing. A true hunter adapts. Sleep well, my friend. Those hunters were nuts. Can't believe the suit listened to me. Wish my suit had a neural interface like this. I could work with Harry, do the hero gig, and take a vacation all at once. That's probably the maitre d' by the podium. Has one of the shield bearers arrived? Uh, yes. He is in the other room by the fire. Will Mr. Kravenoff be joining us this evening? Uh, there are some... Uh, mm, mm, quite right. <laughs> Damn. Craven isn't here. Shield bearer. Hm. Sounds like a bodyguard to me. I'll rip him in half with my bare hands. He's not your target. You kill him. Must be him. <clears throat> Your meal, sir. Mm. What the hell is this? Um, I was told to deliver this to Mr. Kravenoff's personal bodyguard. What makes you think I am him? <laughs> you know, you're, uh, huge. Dima is very hungry. You should leave now. So funny. I was just about to do that. He was looking up at that room. Gotta find the elevator. If that's just the shield bearer, how big is Dima going to be? It's too scary. I don't want to serve him food anymore. Just drop the plate and leave. Simple as that. See how you feel. Coming through. Oh, sorry. Don't be sorry. Move! Coming through! Ah, uh, 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 this... Uh, this mess! If everything isn't perfect, we're all dead! Coming through! No! No! No, wait! Uh, 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 why were you standing right in front of the door? I told you to wait. No, you come didn't. On. I was just minding my own. Come on. Shut up, both of you. Pick everything up and let's move. We find Dima, we find Craven and his weird blizzard serum. Easy. Be 
Dima. Crap. Well, that explains the secret menu. Someone's a little angry. A tiger. That's new. All right. Let's give Dima something to eat that isn't spider flavored. That raw meat must be somewhere. There we are. Something in that study might help me find Craven. But first, gotta break out the apron. That hunter's right there. What the hell was that? A meal fit for a Russian tiger bodyguard. That sounded weird. I have to make a few minor adjustments to this meal. Where's that sleeping hunter? A lot of bodies by that sleeping hunter. Did anyone hear that? Time for Dima. Snooping time for Peter. If this doesn't work, there's only one other thing on the menu. Me. Hi, Dima. I'm back. With a little snacky snack. Spidey masterpiece. Guess Craven's too cool for his own party. Should look around in case he left the lizard serum somewhere in here. Don't see Craven's lizard serum here. But what are these potions? Wonder if this is how he's so freakishly strong. Didn't know hunting could be so existential. He's better read than I would have thought. Nothing like some light philosophy between hunts. No serum. These drugs are for late stage chemotherapy. Are these cravens too? Apple prepared. Saint Sophia is only a few blocks from here. Craven has to be there with the serum. Time to move. Must have just missed him. So Craven has a pet tiger. That tracks. It's not what it looks like. Keep him alive. Okay, suit. Let's see what you can really do. Ah! Ah! 
Harry did not tell me it felt like this. I feel so strong. This thing knows exactly how I like to fight. One man army now. We can get used to this. Get to the chapel quick. That was fun. Craven yet, but I think I know where he is. How's the suit? Weird. It's like it knows me. Don't worry, buddy. I'll take care of everything. Promise. Cute back there, I knew it! I'd love to get to know you better, but I got some business to take care of. See, your boss has been up to no good lately. This is my city, not his jungle. He killed Scorpion. Let the lizard loose. And he stabbed me pretty good! I'd like a word with him. Especially about that last part.
I'm coming, Craven. Here to pick up a serum order for a Dr. Connors? You have hunted me. This is good. Let's see if you have the strength to finish what you started. Save my friend. Serum. On my way back to Emily May. How'd it go? Really well. Things just got a little intense with Craven. He's somehow stronger than he looks, if you can believe that. Hey, the important thing is that you're okay. And you got the serum. You did great, buddy. I'll start prepping the gear. How'd it really go? It was totally... I didn't want to worry, Harry. Craven knows now that the suit malfunctions when it's within range of certain frequencies. How bad is the malfunction? Not pleasant, but I can handle it. Well, I'm glad you're all right, but watch yourself out there, too. Let me know how things go at the lab. Absolutely. Talk soon. Still got it? Let's see what this thing's made of. Okay, I've overlaid the serum with an old sample of Connor's blood. If you can destroy the atoms blocking the lizard receptors, we can make an antidote, and then we're golden. 
Like a goose. Like a clever goose. So how's the suit working out for you? It's good. Great, even. Just takes some getting used to. Yeah. I'm gonna really put it through its paces when this is over. Won't be long now. There. Huzzah. Huzzah. Wait. Does the structure look unstable to you? Huh. If we could beam a few electrons in there, it'd stabilize it, but it's not like we have a... Particle, particle accelerator? accelerator. <laughs> That'd be like using a shotgun for a haircut. Hell of a haircut. The text said it needs repair, but maybe it's okay. No black holes, no black holes, no black holes. Huh. <sighs> Pressure change popped an intersection out of alignment. There's no way to fix it without going inside. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? The suit will protect me, right? Peter, I don't know about this. Relax and be a good proton. Huh? Stay positive. <laughs> so, what's the inside of a particle accelerator like? Amazing. You gotta crawl in this when you get the suit back. Oh, yeah, it's at the top of my list. What's gonna happen when I realign it anyway? There aren't any other pressure problems, nothing. You can come right out. Harry! It's, it's powering up, but the beams are at it. Use the magnets to stabilize it. How? Just find the sweet spot. Particle accelerators do not have sweet spots! Now the other... There, good. There's one more set of magnets ahead. If you can't stabilize the beam, it'll destroy the serum. I got it. Do not wipe my library cards. Don't touch the beam, don't touch the beam. Next. You did it, Pete. We're home free. Come on out. What is that? Probably a static discharge. It means the accelerator's working. Clever frickin' goose. Here we come. So the suit's got some sensitive ears. Apparently. What happened? More static discharges. The accelerator's still running, though. The serum's okay. Fire. Fire fast enough. There's got to be something else I can use. That'll work. Good, good. The static discharges must have fried our fire suppression sensors. I'll try to trigger them manually. Is the antidote still getting made? Should be. But if the fires damage the accelerator, we'll lose it. Stop with the spreading already. Beautiful. Whoa. 
Loss of thermodynamics. Easy. Everything down here is clear. I just need to help out upstairs. Harry won't be able to put out the rest of these fires himself. Out. How you doing, Harry? I'm bypassing every safety lock known to man. Living life on the edge. That's the last of them. It worked! <laughs> so you'll power it down. I'll grab the antidote, find Dr. Connor. Not so fast. There are 67 shutdown steps. If we take it out before, then we'll lose the antidote. Oof. Sounds like it's gonna be a while. You hungry? I could go get a pizza. Shut it down and get the antidote. I'll handle this. No Craven? I thought we had a thing going. You are not his only friend. Please, tell me where he is. Do I spy some electromagnets? Whoops, my bad. Extension on my student loans. Real excited about that. Almost powered down. I'll finish it and grab the antidote. You need to get out. I of can't here. leave. I'm the only one. Watch out! No. No. I was just so... In the suit! 
You okay? I think so. I'm going to the breaker room. I can do the next steps there. Are you okay? Yeah! I feel amazing! Let's do this! Come on! Craven was smart to stay home! in these woods. Okay, before we get down to business, there's something I have to tell you. I'm fresh out of honey. <laughs> Come on, I thought it was funny. Maybe we'd even keep some of it as a patch of honor. Oh, crap. Those arrows must have ruptured the accelerator's shielding. The beam's scraping the tunnel. Can you still shut it down? What about the antidote? Still being made, but time to start crossing fingers. <laughs> Give me a sec. 
hurt? I'm fine. We both are. But the Foundation... I don't care about that right now. Are you sure you're okay? Yeah. Get in there and see what you can save. I want a detailed report of the damage. Your dad's right. The Foundation doesn't matter. What? This was our dream. And it still is. But right now we have to focus on finding Dr. Connors and getting you healthy again. I got this. Hey, you've reached P. Ah, uh, it's good enough. Leave a message. Where the hell are you, Pete? Hey, Yankee. Hey, dude. I wonder if the friend's got its wires all crossed with an old hunter transmission. Figured you might want to look into it. Maybe it'll lead to Lee. Sending you the source coordinates. Really appreciate it, man. No problem. Everything good? Haley and I are a little worried. It's okay. I just need everything to get back to normal first. I'll make it up to her, though. But for missing her exhibit. Okay, dude. Hope the lead pans out. Yeah, that'll definitely work. Protesting isn't just the constitutional right in New York. It's your civic duty. Especially when a multinational corporation is behind a bioweapon unintentionally getting released into the city. And Spider-Bot's got him on the ropes! Oh, was that a steel chair? <laughs> In good condition, too. <laughs> Look at you rocking the time. Okay, story. friends, my feeds are blowing up about the commotion out in Jersey. A fire at the old zoo? A secret hunter base? And Spider Man trying on his friend's black suit? Things are getting weird out there, folks. I mean, I know there's a lot of excitement about SM's black is the new black look, and I mean, it is fire and all, but isn't it just a tad moody for our friendly neighborhood so-and-so? No takers? Just me? Okay, well, you know, you, you come to me for the real real, so I'm just trying to deliver. Stay safe out there, y'all.
one seems really high tech. Hey, I've got some news on our mysterious bots. This third party ping is coming from far away. Like millions of miles far. Like, like from space? No, they must be scrambling their location or something. Yeah, I think I can get to the source if you find just a few more. Whoever's doing this, I want to shake their hand. Hey, Yuri. I checked out the old hospital that the flame said he'd be at. It's guarded, but nothing we can't handle. You ready? I still think it's a trap. We need a plan before we go in. Sure. There's a rooftop near the hospital. We'll talk there. <sighs> See you soon. Beat a classic. You are looking shockingly good. They're still breathing. But I don't know if the flame is gonna be so lucky. Not after Yuri said how dangerous he is. We have no idea what their Crimson Hour Doomsday event is. And she just runs in. This wasn't a part yeah. of the prophecy. Trust the flame and keep watching. She has to leave eventually. They alert the others. That's not a good rumble. Just need to get to her. supposed to happen? Why Brooklyn? What's Oscorp got to do with all of this? A warehouse? Scrapyard? Parking lot? Library? What's the connection? some concern amongst you recently concerning our losses at the clinic. 
My concern is that you thought of them as losses at all. Those embers who fell revealed themselves to be unworthy. And though we miss them, we have only grown stronger without them. So, when little Miss Yuri and the Fool's Beacon come to visit us, you show them how worthy we are! Trust the flame. For everything burns. Who is this guy? I want this cleared as soon as possible. What happened to the roof team? You're not in charge. Get it together. The flame Clear needs that us. Rubble now! Now! Yuri's behind that rubble. I take out these cultists, I can get to her. And the flame. Wait. They're making explosives here. They're not waiting for the Crimson Hour. They want to cause it. Just think of the Crimson Hour and how beautiful it will be. You're late, Fool's Beacon! Or did you get left behind? Don't you know? Only squares show up to parties on time! Where's this Crimson Hour? Is Brooklyn the target? Brooklyn's just the beginning! What do you people want? It's not about what we want! It's about Now to clear the rubble. Who said anything about Oscorp? No! Stop! The fool's beacon himself! As I prophesied! No! no! I knew you had it in you, Yuri. There. That'll keep pressure on it until I can... If you want the flame, you're gonna have to go through me! Then you're about to swallow a lot of blood! You're going to have to kill him, Yuri! My prophecy says he'll never stop! Stop! Like you! I'll finish you when I'm done! Flame makes you die, Spider-Man! The longer he lives, the more people will get hurt! There are other ways to stop him! Less traumatic ways! What about the Crimson Hour? We still need to learn more about it! You're acting like he'd cooperate! This path you're on never ends well, Yuri. Trust me! Trust you? What about you trusting me? You weren't there the last time you escaped! You didn't find the bodies! You didn't see his face! No, I can't even imagine! But that still doesn't make this right! I am not letting you get away again! I can't! Well, that's too bad, Yuri! I don't die. It's not like I want to free him!
congratulations. You get to live out the rest of your life behind bars. <clears throat> and I owe it all to you. your priorities because I'd rather lose sleep over the one person I killed than all the ones I didn't save I know my priorities I, I am not going to let the flame hurt anyone else I'll find him somehow What do we got? Friends of the Danacast, I woke up today with one question on my mind. What the hell happened at the Emily May Foundation last night? One minute we're talking 
philanthropy and using the means of production for good. And the next we're looking at a war zone. And yeah, listen, clearly those hunters were involved. Clearly they're the baddies here. But y'all saw the same footage of Spider-Man I did, yeah? The way that new black suit moves, how vicious it is. <sighs> Call me a worry ward if you want, but something ain't right. Times like these, take care of the little things. 64 ounces of water every day. See you soon, folks. I can't believe Crusher Hogan. You get a lot better shots if you come to the show, Spider-Man! <laughs> New York's always had a thriving underground wrestling scene. Even been to a few shows myself. That combination of theatricality with amazing feats of strength and athleticism, it's electrifying. Perfect for Robbie. Oh, okay. Well, Should look where I was going. When my son was growing up, I helped coach his youth baseball team here. Every game we played, the parents talk more trash than the kids, myself included. So the phone number on the impounded truck was the pre-1970s kind with letters. Harlem 7, 4321. Did the truck that got away have the same one? Yeah. But I'm not sure I'm following. <laughs> Pre-1970s trucks were terrible polluters because they had no catalytic converters. My office did an initiative to get them off the roads. So there are now very few old trucks in this neighborhood. Si tuviéramos alguna forma de localizarlo. I got an idea. Nice work, Ma. Back in business. If Ma's right about those trucks, they probably left behind some kind of residue. Hey, Miles. I heard there's a star-studded gala at the museum. If I find the missing pieces, yeah! Never been to a gala before. Do you want to go? Thought you'd never ask. What should I wear? Here's black, loopy glam. Bro, let me focus. Right. Uh, good luck. I can't believe people would do this. I was so excited about this exhibit. The whole museum, really. Look, this is an unfortunate situation I'm in here. I mean, you know how much I care about protecting the collective history of this community. I do, which is why I hope this won't derail your support. Okay, let's see if those trucks left anything behind. Spider-Man's here. Spider-Man, any news? Working on some new leads. I'll let you know. Well, I've got business to attend to, but you know my feelings. For me, it's about preserving the history at all costs. This looks like it could be something from a prehistoric heist truck. Ugh. Smell that sulfur. Definitely from an old engine. Maybe I can isolate it further. To identify the substance, I need to get rid of the contaminants. Hey, Spider-Man. Now we know you're helping on this. You're good. Thanks.
aromatic hydrocarbon. This will never make it through a catalytic converter. Hey, Ma, you were right. That truck was so old, it left a unique contaminant in its wake. Fantastico. Can you track it down? On it as we speak. I suddenly have hope we might really be able to find everything, pull off the gala, and save the museum. Whoa, 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 whoa. One thing at a time. Okay, I know. Well, be careful, and let me know what you find. Sorry, couldn't hear you. Anyway, we delivered everything we had. The rest of it fell off the truck. Then you better freaking find it! I understand, sir. We'll keep looking for the last item. He's stiffing us. What did I tell you? No. No pay when we deliver the saxophone. The saxophone. I think you know where. Settle down, idiot. This guy's loaded. Just need to make him happy. Damn it! Just oh. Spider-Man! Did you really think you seen the last of me? How the hell did the spider find us? Yeah. Right there. Yeah. He's up there! Yeah. Four friends? Let's go! Come on, guys! Yeah. Yeah. spider punk. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Okay, that's all of them. Let's open up that truck and get the rest of those museum pieces. Empty. They must have already given their boss whatever was in here. All roads seem to lead to that guy. Sounds like somebody's phone. Okay, so there's something out there they're still looking for. So I found the second truck, but it was empty. Oh no. But they lost one of the pieces somehow. Charlie Parker's saxophone. Oh, Miles, head over to CJ Walker Park. Okay, why? One of our interns said she heard a guy talking about a saxophone he found. I didn't believe her at first. She's kind of a bochichera. If it's the one these guys lost, their boss seemed really interested in finding it. As he should be. Charlie Parker's a legend. That saxophone is priceless. Who should I look for at the park? I don't have a name. They said a trumpet player was talking about it. Trumpet, got it. Thanks, Nyaranita. Let me know what happens. Te quiero. Gotta change clothes first. Don't want to disrupt the festival. Okay. Where is this trumpet guy? This place looks a lot better today than it did when Fisk and his crew took it over. Hey, Miles. Steph, what's up? You here with Gloria? Nah, she's working. I just got here. Was looking for a trumpet player. You seen one anywhere? Yeah, Teo is here, playing his trumpet. Teo plays trumpet? Mm-hmm. I think he was over near that far gate. Great. Thanks, Steph. And say hi to Gloria for me. It's just basic drum circles. <laughs> <laughs> Tail's gotta be in the park. Let me double back.
Bye. How you been? Good. Busy. How's business at the barbershop? Booming, my friend. How you liking those locks? I like them. Took my mom a little while, but I think I won her over. Ha! Ah. Well, just keep twisting. But they're looking good. Thanks. See you around. Hey, Camilla. Miles! Can I get you anything? Uh, no thanks. I'm looking for Teo. Have you seen him? I've been busy in the truck, but I can hear him. Just follow the sound of his trumpet. Will do. Catch you later. Thanks, everyone. Hey, Spider-Man. Hey, Miles. Teo! Sounding good, man. Wow, I didn't know you played the trumpet. I dabble, I dabble. Hey, I was actually gonna call you. When I was in keynote music this morning getting my horn fixed, some kids brought in a sax they found on the street. I was thinking it could potentially be the one from the museum. I don't want to get anyone in trouble. We're trying to do the right thing. Yeah, 100%. You talking about keynote on Cathedral? Yeah, talk to Eugene. Thanks. Headed there right now. Trumpet sounds great, bro. Hey, Ma. Found the sax. On my way to pick it up now. Ay, bendito. Angela will be so relieved. This just might save the museum. Hey, did you know Teo played the trumpet? He's pretty good, too. Had an audience and everything. The whole park was bumping. Precisely why this museum is so important. Music enriches our community and brings it together. Is that my mom or Councilwoman Morales talking? Uh-oh. This doesn't look good. Hey, Spider-Man! I was about to put an alert in your app. What happened here? A couple of creepy guys just dragged Eugene out of here. Definitely wasn't right. They went that way. Thanks. I'll check it out. Let's scan for any clues here. Sledgehammer? Oh, these guys meant business. Better find Eugene fast. We know you've got that saxophone somewhere. I don't know what you... Hey, fellas! You wanna learn to play music? There are better ways to do it. It's the spider! Get him! Man, here comes the rest of the band. Spider-Man. You okay? A few bruises are okay, as long as they left me my keys. Here, take these and open my trunk. Charlie Parker saxophone. That's the real deal right there. I was getting ready to return to the museum, and those guys busted in. He used that to record his masterpiece, Ornithology, 1946. You a bird fan? <laughs> My dad was. 
I don't know much about old music. Mm, mm. Oh. <laughs> when you hear an MC today, you syncopated accents, stress the offbeat, flow in and out of the rhythm. That ain't number bebop. I have to listen a little closely next time. I'll get this back to the museum right away. Then I gotta call my insurance company. Okay. Thanks, man. I could get into the phone these guys were using to communicate with the mastermind. Wow. All zeros is a number equivalent of password as a password. Just a midnight rendezvous with the criminal mastermind. No biggie. operation and find the rest of those museum pieces. here yet. I'll just hang for a bit until the party starts. You were supposed to pay us on our last delivery. You'll get paid when I get everything. Where is it? Where is what? Lewis said you were bringing the saxophone. Lewis said? Lewis got picked up by the cops. He don't got no saxophone. You set this meeting up! No, we didn't. Now where's our money? Where is the saxophone? Darren? The big donor from the museum? I better bust up this party than have a talk with him. I should get the whole bunch wrapped up before they hurt someone. What's he doing here? We need Leon with the big gun. Yeah. They're still yeah. on the way. Yeah. Spider-Man, help me. Yeah. I was just trying to get the stolen things back to the museum. That's not yeah. true. I can explain. Yeah. That's going to have to be a longer conversation. Yeah. 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 Well, that seems to be all of them. Let's get to the bottom of this with Darren. <laughs> oh, thank you, Spider-Man. And I assure you, there's a very reasonable explanation. That seems extremely dubious. Wait till Councilwoman Morales hears you were involved in this. Leon, here! Time to exterminate a spider! Darren, stay back. Get down! Ah, mate, get down! 
Darren? Are you kidding me? He was right here. I still have his number. Sounds like he's close. Bad guys on Darren's tail. Can't blame him. He wants their money. Who is it? Is this Lewis? Darren, stop the car! Spider-Man? Can you at least stop these guys chasing me? You weren't trying to retrieve those things. You were the one behind the robbery in the first place. I care about these objects! You pretended to care, and then stole from the museum. It's this community's history. It's my family's history. I don't expect you to understand. I don't think I'm the one who doesn't understand. Let's get these other bad guys out the way first. We've gotta stop this to put all these guys behind bars, including Darren. Gonna regret waking up. <laughs> Police are on their way. We gotta catch up to Darren. Oh, are you still there? Look, my father was one of the most successful music producers ever. He produced half the artists in that museum. Good for him. Now stop the car and tell me where the rest of the pieces are. Which one was the break? I should probably get my license one of these days. Just so I get this right. All that talk of supporting the museum. All Angela's time you wasted asking about operations and security. All lies. So you can learn how to steal the collection. But my family... No. I'm sure you do care about this music. But those things don't belong to you. They belong to this community. Let's go, sir. You're under arrest. This event would not have been possible without our wonderful curator, Angela, mm -hmm. and this entire community. The way we pulled together to recover the stolen items is nothing less than amazing. Okay, okay. Thanks to every one of you for saving the museum. And thank you, Rio Morales, our city council person, who championed this event so tenaciously. Yeah, those are some fun beats. Gotta study up on this guy. And I say she's off to a stunning I can say I accomplished that much someday. All that? And she was a secret agent fighting Nazis? Huh. Josephine Baker, a role model. Hey, I heard you helped find the missing saxophone. Yeah, I got to hold it. Er coaxed miracles from that hunk of metal. My dad was a big Charlie Parker fan. He'd be happy to know the sax is here for everyone to appreciate. And maybe lead them back to the music. Music mm, is magic. I think Abuela had a book about her. Gotta take a look when I get home. Hey. I guess it all worked out. This museum is fire. And so much music I want to go listen to. <laughs> right? Bro, oh, it's so inspiring. Hey, you want to have breakfast tomorrow? I can tell you all my new music ideas. Let's do it. I'm going to keep checking this out.
Miles, isn't this place awesome? I'm embarrassed to say I've never been here before, but after hearing about the robbery, I thought I'd better come check it out. From what I heard, that guy convinced himself all this stuff rightfully belonged to him. Crazy what some people can convince themselves is true. many people. Gotta go around. <laughs> Down on Lennox Avenue the other night, by the pale, dull pallor of an old gas lamp, he did a lazy sway. He did a lazy sway. That's some lyrics right there. Art and music can really make a difference in the world. Ah, <laughs> we were hoping you'd be here. Oh, wow. Your mom is something else. That she is. Can you believe that guy pretended to be a donor and then robbed the place? Thank God he didn't get away with it. I agree. This stuff needs to be here. Not in some guy's penthouse where he's the only one who could see it. so cool how other people have been able to do music and save the world stuff. Angela, I'm Miles, Councilwoman Morales' son. Miles, she talks about you all the time. Congratulations on the exhibit. I'm glad it all came together. Thanks to your mom and Spider-Man, of course. Whew, this neighborhood is blessed to have them both. Hey, Miles! I figured I'd better come see that saxophone in its rightful place. It was your tip that helped with the saxophone recovery. Aw, oh, not really. It was all our Spider-Man. The guy, not the cat. Well, it was a community effort. Give your Spider-Man some ear scratches for me. I will. Basically, Bebop let musicians show off. Eugene was right. That is what MCs do. <laughs> Better listen a little more closely. <laughs> I should finish looking around before I go talk to Ma and head out. Thank you all. Thank you so much. <laughs> Angela told me the museum has a record number of new memberships. Seriously? They're gonna be okay. <laughs> Couldn't have done it without you, Ma. Now, hear me out. What if we really teamed up on the next one? I can get my own suit. Ma! Maybe. Algo con brillo. Ma, stop. Stop. <laughs> stop it. Get out of here. <laughs> Dance with me. Shumiya <laughs> sauce.
innocent thefts at the Harlem Cultural Center. Turns out, Darren Shipman was pulling the strings. If that name sounds familiar, it's because he's a multi-millionaire with his name on everything, because his money is in everything. I see you! Give him no! I'm not telling you to go home! You can't stay here! Enforcements. some snooping. All right, Droney. What do you know that I don't? <laughs> a map of a base. I think I can dig around to see what's waiting for me there. If I take out the base's relay, the hunters there won't be able to call for reinforcements. Looks like you've been to two other blinds. Maybe if I explore the rest of the blinds, I'll find myself a base. Spider arms? You wore it better, buddy. wanted to fight in an invisible blanket fort? for some info. What will this little birdie tell me? <laughs> Let's see what else this base has going on. Supply room full of weapons. 
be a shame if some Spider-Man wept them up. Two blinds down. May find the base location at the next one. Let's see what Dr. Young is up to out here. for helping us out with our machine learning trials. Similar to what you did in the Emily May Foundation, we're now teaching our drones what to do in the wild. Once you get yourself set up, this recording will continue. Glad these scientists can still work from home after the Foundation was destroyed. Okay, let's get up and running. This is a two-part trial. First, you need to teach the drone what it should target to protect our bumblebee population. Great, let's train some bee drones. Oh, and you need to do it before the drone depletes its charge. Sorry, we're working on battery life. Got it. Let's go. No thanks, bee-eating wasps. Bee wolves, bee gone. Who knew rats ate bees? In the second part of the trial, you'll teach the drone to identify and mark optimal nest sites. Be real estate, here we go. Look for the flags. These are ideal relocation spots. Here we go. Estate agent. A real estate agent. Bingo. You've completed the set. The drone will self-pilot home and upload the data. Thank you, Peter. That should be some good stuff for the AI. Hope Dr. Young finds it helpful. it all. <laughs> I think he was right. The friend picked up a signal from this satellite. Let's see what we're working with. This is no hunt to be proud of. A stain on my legacy. A disgrace, but deadly nonetheless. Find them, kill them. Craven, how many more people are on this guy's list? 
drone. It's using this satellite network to track his targets. Oh, you're not getting away that easy. Picking up some kind of data surge from the drone. If I stay in the slipstream long enough, my still can pull the embedded data and lead me right to Lee. These things have bombs? Looking good. Targets got corrupted into one file. The drone had no intel on Lee. But these people still need my help. Otherwise, they'll end up as heads on Craven's mantle. If there are more birds out there, I can decrypt them to discover the identities of the targets before it's too late. Should upload the data to the Spidey servers. He's gonna want to see this. Harry? Uh, hey, you with Pete? Hey. No. Uh, listen, I saw you chasing that robot bird around on the news. Do you need any kind of tech support? Like, running the app or something? Actually, I got a friend doing that already. Gotcha. Uh, sorry, I'm just feeling useless, and my mom would always say, if opportunity doesn't knock, build a door. Even though she's gone, I still ask her for advice. Is that weird? Nah, it's the same with me and my dad sometimes. Nice to know I'm not alone. Thanks. And good luck out there. You too, man. Maybe some advice will be good right now. Dad, could really use your help right now. I'm doing everything I can to find Lee, but nothing's working. I know what you say. A hero is someone who doesn't give up, and I'm not. I just don't know what else to do. Maybe I should just ignore everything else and spend all my time trying to find Lee. No. If people need help, I'm helping. And I'll find Lee. If Pete's too busy, 
I'm Spider-Man. I can handle everything myself. Wish me luck, though. Thanks, Dad. I love you. So, who needs help out there? Spider-Bot. That guy's getting up in those people's faces. I'm there. Swing you over to an ambulance. They'll fix you right up. Oh my god. Thank you. Just a little bit farther. Wasn't too rough of a trip. Take care. Bless you, Spider Man. Hey, MJ. Hey, Miles. Just spoke with Pete. He's heading over to Dr. Connor's house in Queens. Stay ready in case he needs backup. Oh, really? Did Pete ask you to call me? Well, no, but. <laughs> Figured two Spider-Men are better than one, right? Sure. Okay, thanks, MJ. Sounds like he doesn't need me. Maybe I'll go see Haley in the meantime. Crazy! Someone's gotta be mad! 
messing with these Mysteriums. Based on that last call from Betsy, seems like Beck and his crew have it almost figured out. This ends at the beginning. What does that mean? You've done well so far, but can you hit what you cannot see? You'll be safe now. Another call from Betsy. Spider-Man? Cole and I are a bit concerned. He said he was gonna kill us. Please, Cole, don't panic. <sighs> Spider-Man, we found out Quentin lied to us. Instead of going to counseling, he went somewhere else. When we confronted him, he said some threatening things and then left. Hopefully he just needs to cool off, but if you see him or hear from him, can you let us know? Thank you. Uh, this just went from bad to worse. Hunters are trying to set something up on that roof. Super Q outpost team. Mind if I straight up demolish it? about my camouflage glitching out. Hmm. Got a new voicemail. Spider-Man, we need to meet. Come to Coney Island. I have an urgent matter to discuss with you. Well, that doesn't sound like a trap at all.
we go! Need enough data to figure out who this thing's tracking. Gotta let the slipstream do the work for me. That suit's gonna burn up at this rate. Should send those mini drones back to the nest. Leave it to Craven to accessorize his pets with railguns. Your time's up! Gotta avoid that flat! Halfway through the download. See who this roid rage city pigeon was after. What would Craven want with an engineer? This drone won't be bothering her anymore. Gotta take out the rest. Can't be in that real good. 
Influencer. Maybe Craven just wants some brunch wrecks. Not exactly big game. Why all the trouble for some civilians? Something's wreaking havoc in Pete's old stomping grounds. Not good. Hi, ma'am. Who's there? I don't recognize your voice. I it's Spider-Man? Oh, I, I, I didn't realize. Alba, charm to meet you. I heard you need my help. Yes. There's a monster in my backyard. I can hear it at night. Scratching. Could it be a stray dog? Or a rat? My allergies could sense a stray dog half a mile away. And even New York rats don't get as big as whatever that is. Is there anybody else here who might have noticed it? The family member? The guide dog? Just me. No family. No neighbors. No service animals. Allergies, remember? Whatever it is, I need it gone. Got it. I'll look around and let you know what I find. Please. I cannot afford to repair any more damage. Fixed income, you know. Aren't these breakable? Don't fall, little guy. Never trust a garden statue. They've seen things. 
definitely not human. Ugh, yuck. Time for some analysis at the molecular level. Let's see here. That's not right. Try that again. Okay. Some kind of chemical. Wonder where this leads. From the woods? <sighs> Nothing good ever came from the woods. Trail stops here. Maybe I should look around. What do we have here? It's ripping up cars now? Okay. Is this thing bleeding? Or leaking? Slobbering? Ugh. Oh, man. This stuff stays detectable a long way off. Tears up cars like a T-Rex and jumps like a tiger. Great. Must be getting closer. <laughs> this thing's all over the place. Where is it going? knows what to do with this thing. Uh, hello? Uh, Genki. That monster in Queens? It's one of those hunter beasts. But it seems to be chill. For now. Oh, a hunter beast? Maybe we can hack it. It could give us some intel. out of it easy this won't hurt probably since you're a machine I dumped 10 million random dog videos to its pattern recognition database. No way, that's brilliant! So, what do I do with it? Is it dangerous? Uh, try fetch? Here, boy. You wanna get the barrels? Wanna play? Ha! Yeah, get him! That's a good boy! I'll try to access its memories while it's distracted. Man, a lot of corruption in these logs. That arrow had to come from hunters. Why would they shoot their own robot? Target practice? Let's find out. So, you have a name? Designation F1D0. Fido. Okay. I was expecting killer or angst. Fido was better. This log is cached to a server. Dare I? Um, how deeply do you trust your antivirus software? Deeply enough to download this audio playback. Get out of my life, you piece of junk. She's a trident to cry me. You are the traitor. I was doing my job. 
Defective garbage, get back here! Yankee! You must have cranked our log access. Easy, Fido. Stay. Please? Fido! Heal! Yankee, is there an emergency break? I can't access manual override. Oh, always wanted to say that. Do something! I think it's breaked out! It's definitely acting like it. Do you think it was the recording of that guy? Repressed final memories? Always bad. I think its owner shot it. And tried to cover up the murder. Fido! Stop! You want a treat? No, 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 not the church! There you are. Come here. Yeah, I should have brought you to Fritz with an explosive boat. Yeah, come here. I can't let you to enemy hands. You are a defective board of trash. So you're the guy who tried to kill Fido? You messed up, dude. Fido, attack! Should be the last of them. Fido! Phew, all better, boy. He won't hurt you anymore. Now let's get that arrow out of you. Doesn't look too deep, actually. Here we go. Good boy. You sure this is safe? Hey, if 10 million dog videos can't make you a good boy, there's no hope for any of us. And you're a good boy, aren't you? Who's the good boy? Just to be safe, though, I'll wipe its memory completely. Except the videos. And you. Good looking out. We took care of the scratching sound. Spider-Man? Wait, we? Me and this good boy right here. Oh, oh no, my allergies. It's okay. Earlier you mentioned you couldn't get a guide dog. Well, I found you one. He's a dog, I guess. Made of various metals. Very allergy friendly. He's also got a few hundred guide dog videos uploaded to his memory. Really? He's everything I hoped for. I can have him trained at the center so he can be properly registered. Already so helpful. Thank you, Spider-Man. Adios! A lot of nesting boxes. Good real estate. Fear, thanks for your help here. As before, we're training the drones to identify predators like rats and beetles so they can guard the bees' nesting boxes. Okay, let's get things booted up. Time for target practice. Bodyguards, Queen's Edition. Giving new meaning to Queen's Bee. Ooh, that's a big guy. Rat attack, rat. Yes. This is a strange 
Nice job. Identify predator detected. Uh oh, what's that? Better go check that out. Whoa, that bird! It's going after the nests, trying to eat the bees. Aha, Meropidae albicollis, the white-throated bee-eater bird. It's right there in the name. I need to shoot this bird back to wherever it came from. I wonder if this drone has a real-world mode. Cool. Now I can really encourage this bird to get going. Perfect. This is enough to annoy the bird, but not hurt it. If I can find out where it came from, I can see if there are others. Hey, bird! I can't follow you if you don't move. Get going! I'm giving you a little push. Mush, birdie. Keep it moving, buddy. Gotta shoot him to scoot him. the bees of queens, or the queen bees. Hmm, huh, so this is your home. You must have escaped from here and gone out for a snack. Doors propped open. Better close it before you escape again. Got it. Okay, I think I'm done for now. The drone will pilot its way back to home base in no time. I'm not sure bee-eating birds are a citywide threat, but I'll mention it to Dr. Young. We should definitely program the drones to look for outliers like that. Palindrome? Miles uploaded some data from one. Something about Craven hunting mystery targets. I should look into it. See what I can find. Data should help me stop Craven's latest hunt. They definitely take after their mama. Better avoid him. Okay, that really hurt. Bird is about to be very angry. We're halfway. Soup can't handle that. 
the heat! Ten to go. This data set looks complete. I did it. According to the data, this person died two years ago? Probably just an error. Still more eyes in the skies. Can't leave Craven's toys flying around. play the what can I find here game. They fit a surprising amount of tech in this little guy. <laughs> this must be the base. That's where the little birds go to recharge. Bet I could overcharge them right out of existence. I see you've been to another blind too. That last blind may have the base location. Okay, Dr. Young, bring it on. training session. You know the drill. Help the drone identify predators as well as optimal nesting sites. Just gotta boot up the drone. Let's do some target practice. Gotcha! Another one down.
mark those nest sites. Got the bug? Yeah. Let's get it back in the garage. What? What just happened? Did someone steal the drone? I'll head to its last location before it went dark. See if I can figure out where it went. Hmm, no sign of it. Or anyone. Those guys said something about a garage. There's a few close by. If I can find the right one, I should be able to reconnect to the drone from the roof. No connection. Must not be this one. Signal. This can't be the place. I'm telling you, it's fine. Just a little stunned. It's not really moving. Bingo. This is the place. Let's connect the video signal. What is this place? And more importantly, how do I get in there? Lots of cages in here. More bees. I don't know why these guys are collecting bees. I know they don't belong cooped up in here. I'd better turn on that sonic laser mode. Let's kill two bees with one shot. I free them, and then they'll help me get that door open. Buzz, my little pretties. Fly, be free. Hey there, let's meet our new contestants on Look to the Face. Your man, drone in safety mode. Fly home. All right, guys, you gotta tell me. Bees? What? You never heard of niche markets? Yeah, but this is like niche niche. Stop. We're not taking no a guy dressed like a spider. Yeah. That suit won't change anything. A belated arrival. Get him. Ah! Come on, fellas. There has to be an easier way to make money. Why do you even care about some bees? Do you know how many plants exist because of bees? They play a critical role in... You don't care? Not that much. I need a That's all of them. I'll definitely let Dr. Young know about this poaching operation. It's no good for the bees, real or drone.
Follow me. Okay, where's Beck? Welcome, Spider-Man. If you're looking for Betsy and Cole, they are no longer with us. You killed them? Don't act surprised. You've known from the beginning who you're dealing with. What the...? out there. How is that happening? Oh. Oh. Enough of this! I'll end you myself! You actually think you can defeat me? This is insulting!
with you and stay. You will finally give me the respect. You won't. Hostage? Surprise? Maybe it's time for you to put some respect on my name. Time to get out of here. The sim is down. Get it back. I'm trying. It was Quentin. He made us do this. Where is he? Help. In here. still have a lot of questions. This... You can clear things up. So can I tell everyone Mysterio's a good guy now? <laughs> Mysterio will always be a villain. Just as Spider-Man will always be a hero. It's when you start looking at the people behind the masks that things get messy. I couldn't back now, too. Okay, finally unscrambled that third-party ping. 
It's using the same code and frequency as us. Did someone steal our tech? No way. We keep that locked up tight. Are you sure? I mean, unless there's another Spider-Man out there, but that's... Nah. I'll keep digging. Maybe if you send me a few more, I can figure this out. aggressive plant parents hiding don't worry drone you don't have to cover for them anymore <laughs> looks like they're based to me they can call for reinforcements not if I cut the relay first you've been around all the other blinds haven't you birdie gonna have to check out the other blinds to locate their base Be more careful. Whew. I really need to learn to clone myself before I go springing traps again. Now I don't have to deal with those traps. Want to let me in on some hunter secrets? What else can I learn here? Seems like I can reroute a herbicide to their sprinkler system, which should knock out some hunters. Time to find that last blind. And hopefully their base. <sighs> this 
Another day in the city. I download enough data, these birds won't get near any target. This target died five years ago? Don't think these are data errors. Craven's hunting dead people? Okay, now this is getting weird. Err. I need more data to figure out what's going on here. Target. Existing data. There's no record of this person anywhere. Are they even real?
afternoon, New York. This is your Spider-Man speaking. The bird's hunting someone. Better pull this data fast. Targets share the exact same DNA? It's all the same person. But how? Okay. Officially creeped out. I need to solve this. One more drone should do it. A request from Howard? Wonder where his birds flew up to this time. showing me a sketch of it the day before it went up. New York is nothing without its people. <laughs> no way. They even got the eyebrows right. And the pigeons okay? Oh, uh, we're getting <clears throat> by. Would you like to join us? Of course. How can I help? Sometimes I just sit here, take it all in. Fairies coming in. See it? There it is. You and the birds taking a trip? Think I'll skip this one. Wait for the next. Used to love the ferry. Felt like I was sailing off on an adventure. Howard? See that yellow skipper? With the black bottom? 
And that ride's got style. Honey of a boat. Wish I could take that bumblebee out for a spin. Hey, Howard. Ride it all the way across the river to those three pillars. An ancient city hidden in the clouds. Ancient city? You lost me, Howard. Over to the right. Look for the red lights. I see them. Three smokestacks. But why? I worked in that factory for 20 years. Laid off. Lost my purpose for a while. And then when my wife passed, I lost my heart to but my birds. They taught me how to fly again. Especially little Pidgey. Howard, I'm here for you. Last one. Can you spot Lady Liberty herself? She's way over to the left. That's her, all right. Watch. Huh. That's the flock. I need your help, Spider-Man. I'm finally going on an adventure. But I want to set my birds free first. Let them see the world outside this city. NYC is the best place in the world for pigeons, Can you though. take them up north for me? Somewhere peaceful? But they need you, Howard. It's their time. Try a whistle. You got it, Howard. Let's fly! Let's stay by the water. I'll think of a spot soon. Battery Park! You can poop on anything and anyone there. Nothing you all haven't seen before, though. We'll keep going. You get a nice view on top of the Brooklyn Bridge. Look strong. Let's pick up some speed. Woo hey, Pidgey, hit us with a barrel roll. Yeah, buddy. What about the woods near Queens? Ma took me there all the time back in the day. It was like a hidden oasis. Sounds like a good place to be a bird. Oh, wow, a regatta. Howard would love that. Don't worry, birds. We're almost at your new home. Y'all feeling our web wings? <laughs> Thanks for the inspiration. I'm gonna miss chasing you birds all over New York. Babies to be free? Thought of a place over in Queens. My mom showed it to me when I was little. Lots of nature and space for Pidgey and friends. That sounds nice. Thanks. Not many folks have been kind to me in my life. Anytime, Howard. It's a new borough, but it's still close enough for you to visit. I'll get these birds settled and be right back. Howard?
Hope y'all like the new digs. Well, that was a workout. Whew. I'll catch the next train. Gotta make sure Howard's okay. Can't be easy when the birds leave the nest. Oh. Howard? Looks like natural causes. Oh, hey, Spider-Man. Sorry. Howard was a friend. Take all the time you need. If it helps, um... It looked like he was at peace. It does. He's on a new adventure now. And his wife's with him. Don't worry, Howard. The flock is free. Let's hope Connors is home, and still in control of his green alter ego. Dr. Connors? Dr. Connors, you here? How long has that been going off? Connors' his family. Heard his wife left with their son after the first lizard fiasco. Not that Craven cares.
his son's room. Animal lover. Dual sinks, but only one's used. Doc? Connors was here all right. And fighting for his life by the looks of it. Genetic recombination research? He came home to cure himself. Hard to do experiments in your living room, though. sound. Same song from the mobile. Oh man, what did Craven do to you, Doc? He tore through here. How are you still standing? Hello? No numbers on the keypad. Same key as the piano. Hmm. loves his secrets. These blood samples are for a genome analyzer. Does Connors have a lab here? This lab probably kept him his family safe whenever he had an episode. Reptile terrariums for Connor's initial limb regeneration tests. I never did find out how he lost his arm. The motion sensor triggered the security cameras about 30 minutes ago. What did he put in me? He was trying to test his blood. Come on, Dr. Connors, fight it. and his family through hell. Hunt 
Round ends now! Does Craven even know what he did to Connors? Oh, so he can prove something? Watch your head! Is all this just a game to him? I have a shot! Gonna make it in time. <laughs> Is it eighteen hundreds? I love the braids. still out there. The city needs me. It's Spider-Man right now. Uh, one second. What's going on? The market? Yeah, yeah, I'll be there. I'm sorry. I'll text you. It's beautiful. The mural, I mean. Time Pete called me back. Hey, how's it going with Haley? Had to bail. Lizard's loose. Could you use your eyes in the skies. The lizard? Also, Haley thinks I'm crazy for trying to find Lee. Seems like everyone does. We're protecting you. Revenge to not after revenge. Dad always believed in second chances. But that's not what this is. It's my job to protect y'all. Not the other way around. I get it. Okay, let me boot up my gear real quick. Empty. 
But I better check it out. Guess I'll have company after all. Everyone out! Move it! Go, go, go! Taser 2, keep it tight. They're using drones to track the lizard. Maybe I can use them too. Passive defense system? Yep! Good to know. Gonna keep my distance. I can't let these guys find the lizard first. Gotta clear them out. Spread out. If you find the lizard, don't engage alone. Hey, man. Got your feet up on the battle station. A lot of hunters. Are they using those bird drones to track the lizard? I think so. Why? Got an idea. I'll work on it while you clear the warehouse. You hear that? It's close. tired of watching you kick serious ass. And we got our birdie. See if your suit can override the drone's motherboard. Okay. I'll give it a shot. Okay. My suit's pairing now. God bless you, Nix. Okay. Rebooting the altimeter and... It's alive! How do I look? Like a robot drone, man. <laughs> and a robot drone that's tracking the lizard. Awesome. That was fast. Hmm. It looks like he's through there. Uh, uh, this thing handles like a tank. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, no, this is gonna be bad. Yankee, you good? Yeah. I think this way's blocked now, though. Don't stress. I'll meet you on the other side. Garage might lead to Genki.
were you? No idea, but I've seen some things. Same, man. Let's just find this lizard dude. Cool. Yeah. Drone doesn't have a lock on him, though. I can hear him. He's somewhere around here. His tail almost got me. It's hard to tell. Drone's tracking data is really interesting. Yeah. Get behind me. You don't have to tell me. Gear slipped. It's just his skin. Doesn't that mean he's getting bigger? Hungrier too. Whoa. Hey, man. New threads? The building's swarming with hunters. Any sign of Connors? Uh, yeah. Genki's tracking him. Hey, Mr. Parker. Mr. Spider-Man, I mean. But the date isn't complete. Think I can help with that. Is that blood? Hey, wait a sec. Try dropping it in here. Onboard scanner. Handy. Dude, this is great data. Hang on a sec. Okay, I think I got a lock. Ginky, wait, be chill. That wasn't me. Me neither. I don't even have a stomach, so... Let's go! Connors. Harry's dying, and he's the only one who can help. We won't. You take the drones, I got the jet skis. Spider-Man's here. Pull up, I borrow this? This is really, really exciting. Keep it tight, man. Watch out for those drones. Don't worry. They think I'm a friendly. Spider-Man! I do not want to be lizard food! 
Good, Pete. I saved the tracker. Let's go, man, before he gets too far. No. He's mine. Are you sure? He's got big teeth. So do I. Um, he's not normally like that, right? No. He's never like that. Tracker says Connors is in the Upper West Side sewers. Better move. Hey, any luck at Connors' house? No, but tracking him right now. What's wrong? Nothing. Meaning something. Miles was off his game. We almost had Lizard. I'm sure he was just trying to help. Sometimes it's just easier to do things myself. Hey, that's not fair, Pete. We're a team. We just really need Connors right now. For Harry. Okay. Let me know when you find him.
<laughs> no, that was good. Well, well, well! Spider-Man the Shutterbug! Click, click! Whip, whip! <laughs> yeah. Some things in New York you just can't explain. And that's what's great about it. I can get into the sewers up ahead. Harry. You're alive. I haven't heard from you in a while. I'm close to finding Dr. Connors. As soon as I stick him with the antidote, this suit's coming right back to you. Okay. Let me know when you find him. Lead pipes are messing with the tracker signal. Where is he going? What's a security camera doing all the way down here? Only the lizard could leave a sewer worse than he found it. He burrowed through to a decommissioned subway line? I think that was an accident. Connors doesn't want to be followed. Ugh, he ripped open a sewer pipe. He must be trying to flood the tunnels behind him. Seriously? That's another camera. No way. Oscorp has a lab in the sewers? Norman probably set this place up for Connors back in the day. Must be off the books. What the hell did Norman have Connors working on back here? symbol. Didn't know Connor studied ancient languages. Why was he mapping celestial coordinates? Hmm. Wonder if this is the same sample Connor's used for his original formula. Antidotes. Useless now. Don't even want to know what's in these vats. Cheap ramen and old pizza. Know that brain food scent all too well. seen this before, but where? Mutualism? Connors always thought the answers to his problems lied in other organisms. They built a clean room too? This is our particle accelerator at the foundation. 
Connors used it to break down some mineral? Physical?
this, officers. You're not helping! Are you kidding me, Connors? Medicine. 
Where did you get that? Harry Osborne. He, he said you designed it. Come with me. It's over here. Whoa, 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 back off. I'm going in for a closer look. It's okay, it's okay. of a meteorite that landed outside the city years ago. It's where we found that. I'm wearing an alien. We call it a symbiote. It, it bonds at the subcellular level with its host. Uh, in our case, Harry Osborne. He gave it to you? Not exactly. I was hurt, and... And it chose you. Which means it's more dangerous than I could have imagined. We need to call Oscorp. We need to destroy it. Destroy us? You said it chose me, Doc. Makes me a better Spider-Man. Eyes on the target. Pursuing. You called. How you doing? Good. Storing some more boxes at the house. Just checked on Harry. But how, how are you? I saw the news about the lizard chase. I'm great. Connors is cured. The suit's still going strong. And apparently it's called a symbiote. Oh, and uh, it's an alien. Which is pretty nuts, right? Wait, what? You don't sound concerned. I'm a little concerned, but I also couldn't have stopped Connors without it. Here, the two of you tore through half the city. Like, did you see what you did to the museum? I'm honestly surprised nobody got killed. I'm not. And you know I had to cure him somehow. I mean, should I have just let him keep destroying things on his own? That's not the... I'm gonna work here for the rest of the night. My muse for a new Jonah-proof article has finally struck. Maybe I'll have something to show you if you come back later. What's gotten into her? Must be deadline stress. Some alone time should help. So in the meantime, let's see who we can help out here. Market folks involving the lizard? I gotta admit, I was really hoping that was one big bad who was firmly in the rear view. But lucky as ever that our two Spider-Men were on site to save the day. 
Spider-Man the Younger pulled some impressive water acrobatics along the way. Spider-Man the Older, well, am I a broken record yet on this new black suit scares the bejesus out of me? Well, fine, I am, and it does. Come at me in the comments if you want, but I am putting it out there. This new black suit thing, whatever it really is, it ain't no good. Give me cool. All right, kids, panic out. Hoping to get and we have achieved liftoff. Hopefully, this bird's data helps me figure out what's going on here. And that's the last one. <sighs> Not too talented, if you ask me. A relay signal? The satellites for each drone must be sifting through the target's data at some kind of central hub. If I can hack the relay point, maybe the target's location is in the stream. to give MJ some alone time, but I'm beat. Time to head home for a little rest. I wonder what she decided for her article. Uh, uh, got to wash the sheets at the house again. and ears all over the city? Come on. I think that did the trick. Target acquired. Dispatching hunters to the corner of 67th and Lexington. Oh, no. Did I lead the hunters right to them? I gotta get there quick or else.
They're already here. Check inside. Hello, Sergey. After all these years, how are you? Who's there? Make yourself at home. There's a martini. Think I'm craven? Mm. Ah. Two olives. Two olives. And cyanide? So, you have finally come to reunite in New York. Let us hide and seek, like old times. They can't see me. It's a programmed recording with high tech motion tracking. Hmm. This game's nearly done. No, come on, Pete. Checkmate. <laughs> you found my secret. But who lies with you? I'm gonna die down there, aren't I? What the? Is that my mask? Wait, is this the chameleon's apartment? I thought we put him away years ago. When I fled Volkerman, I never thought I would find a place to go home. But I am happy here. Looks like he graduated too. This tech is insane. Craven's drone snapped a photo of him mid-transformation. I knew something was off about Craven's target. More secrets. This looks classified. Building schematics and hunter logs? The chameleon was keeping tabs on Craven, too. This is the missing persons database. It goes back almost 20 years? What did the chameleon do to them? I gave you everything when you were children, and you would not even share your name. I loved you.
Don't worry, brother. I will do what you could not. Craven and the Chameleon are brothers? That's a family reunion I do not want to crash. Gotta keep an eye out in case he shows up again. Yuri is not gonna be happy about this. Society need to have a collective reckoning with the notion of here. As I warned, a monster we were told was cured has returned to wreak havoc, and Spider-Man failed to protect him. Once again, Dr. Kurt Connors, the lizard, rampages through our streets. The good doctor drags Spider-Man around town in one of the most pathetic displays of heroism I've ever witnessed. Was it heroic to destroy priceless artifacts in the museum? Was it heroic to demolish city blocks, damaging infrastructure, and costing taxpayers millions? What about the dozens of law enforcement officers injured trying to solve a problem Spider-Man created? Of course, he wasn't alone in this monopoly of harmlessness. The hunters continue to run roughshod, unchecked and unheeded. The level of devastation brought upon the denizens of this fair city is too much to bear. That's the story I was telling you about. I wanted to get your thoughts. Looks amazing, MJ. Can't wait to read it. Wait, you're still in the suit. I thought Connors was gonna help you get it off. What about Harry? Sorry, can we do this tomorrow? Just so beat from Lizard Rag. is my only shot. Where are you, Peter? Hey, you've reached Peter. <sighs> uh, it's good enough. Leave a message. Punch her down! Find the cause! Free! 
Freeze. H2. Unclear. Just stick to your areas. If we find anything in the house, we'll tell you. Looking into Copy. it. Copy. We're losing time anyway. The spider will keep moving. He can't run forever. Bring 
them both to me. Team 5 hasn't reported in yet. I must be close to the spider. We'll hear from them when they're finished. Yeah, but make sure we always have eyes on that house. MJ. I'm on it. Pete, 
Still in there, Peter. You have to be.
Wake up! This might sting a little. Search the whole tunnel. He is gone. For now. But he will come to me soon enough. I end up sleeping on a park bench. And why does it feel like I had the best sleep of my life? Weird dreams, though. Harry left another message. Pete, I really need that suit back. Dad's working on a new cure, but I don't know. Bring it back, please. Hugo Web Alert. More article from MJ. Wait, she published before I could read it? Did, uh, anyone happen to lose a 60-foot lizard? No? Because the city of New York just did. Seriously, it's just gone. And you want to know the spooky thing? Two people went into that sewer, the lizard and Spider-Man, but only one came out. So what happened in there? What did Spider-Man do? <sighs> Folks, look, I know I sound like he who must not be named, <clears throat> Jonah. <clears throat> and believe me, I, I feel just as hinky about that as you do, but we trust Spider-Man to look out for us, to do it the right way. What if he starts doing it the wrong way? What then?
I'm sorry to get dark, folks, but those are the times. So let's all hope whatever journey Spider-Man is on, he finds his way back to the light. MJ, what are you doing? Hey, buddy. How you feeling? I need that suit back. Pete. Um. What do you remember about last night? I just remember feeling tired. You're not yourself. That suit is changing you. This suit is the only reason I'm still alive. Yeah, it's pretty great, isn't it? Why don't you pop some more pills and say what you really feel? Hey, don't. I'm busting my ass out there trying to save you, and this is what I get? I said don't. I saw your story. I tried to tell you about that. Yeah, but you didn't, did you? I can't lose this job. Your job is to write the truth. I did. The truth is, I'm the hero here, not you. How was your visit with Harry? Don't worry, Harry's gonna get better. Thank you. For being his friend. Watching you two grow up together. You're like a son to me. I am so proud of the man you've become. Thanks, Mr. Osborne. Uh, I, I gotta run. A lot of work to do. And as usual, looks like I gotta do it myself. 
Peter, where is Miles? He didn't come home last night, and he's not answering my call. Hello? I'm at my office. Tell him to come see me. Now. Why can't anyone take care of themselves? It's always up to me. my need for info. <laughs> Here in the financial district. Well, with these hunters, it's definitely a bear market. A random skyscraper? Interesting place to have a base. <gasps> those hunters are about to find out that they can't plant on my soil. Like you're going deep underground. It'll be like slugging. Me without my headlamp. The data from the blind says this is some kind of greenhouse. Ah, the hunters have a hobby. That's kind of cute. Not that cute. Don't expect any bouquets. Remember, we can alter the sprinkler's source to an herbicide to wipe out what they're growing. Good thing I have whatever the opposite of the green thumb is. Let's kill some plants. Make sure you turn off their relay. We don't want them calling in backup. That's the valve that'll add herbicide to the sprinklers. Sleepy times incoming, hunters. Everything I just heard from That is none of our business. Isn't it? If the family destroys itself, there will be no empire left to join. Worry about your tasks here. Whatever happens in Volgograd, Craven will take care of it. You will not let everything he has built crumble over some family squad. Craven does not seem to care. His attention is elsewhere, it seems. If you are so worried, take it up with him. I am concerned, not stupid. Comes the peanut gallery.
base data you got from the blinds shows another room here. Maybe it's got some intel about the hunters we can use? Jackpot. Okay. There's an encrypted file. Sasha. Give up this obsession. Come home to me while we still have time left. Our time is over, my love. And your children? They will draw blood for control of our empire. The cops must earn their place. Like anyone else. They will see me as an obstacle. Then you must strike first. Craven's family? They sound... cool. Could be trouble down the line. I'll be ready. Let's keep clearing bases till then. Haters, I have some news, and it is dark. Spider-Man was... Sand crystal is mine. I wake up in some kind of dungeon. Lots of empty cells around. You're not here. But are you okay? Marco must have felt so helpless. Trapped. With no idea where his daughter was. scoop on the base. So that 
that's where they are. I'd have thought they would have torn down that old army supply base by now. Hunters have taken over this abandoned army supply base and turned it into a drone station. Are there bird drones? Why didn't they just pick an aviary? Does it matter? They're making these drones to kill you. Good point. Let's stop that from happening. Be sure to hook the charging station up to a power supply to destroy the drones. Let's ground some birds. info on the incoming Kravenovs now?
must run the whole base out of here. Another encrypted file. Vladimir, what is it now? I could have come with you. You are not needed. I'm never needed, it seems. I think you did not want to be outclassed. That is exactly what I want. <laughs> but by you... Does this amuse you, father? To steal your children's birthright? The only right birth offers is the inevitable promise of death. You have us fighting over scraps. But I will take back what is ours. What is mine. Vlad sounds like a chip off the old block. Hope he takes the long way here. I'll deal with him if he doesn't. Let's keep shutting these bases down. The hunters are gone and the drones are grounded. Pretty good at this. Crystal's all clear now. They say their boss is coming soon, and that he wants to meet me. I'm not waiting around. Sorry to break our promise, Kimi, but I'll tear this city apart to find you. Marco was worried Craven's people hurt his kid. That's why he blew up.
reinforcements. Not enough of you here already? See what they've got cooking. <laughs> Map of the Upper West Side. Wonder how they afforded a place here. A base at the abandoned hotel? Gonna get some unexpected room service. Time to head to that hotel. No need to book a room online, right? I see you! According to the blinds, this base is their weapons depot. Not for long! You've got the advantage! down
expect? Won't they run out of weapons? Craven will not stop until he gets what he wants. I am not worried about them. The family can take it. It's the spider! <laughs> We need back! I'll get you for now! Craven's family before they get here. Just sad. Feels ripe for a therapy session. This family isn't worth your sympathy. Let's find the next base. Enforcements. Info treat for me?
here in Harlem, right in Miles' backyard. The abandoned school. They passed the cool base location test. Better get to the base quick. Mr. Parker's got a lesson to teach. First day at Hunter High? Don't worry. I'll teach them a lesson they won't soon forget. Are you uh, workshopping that or? Hey, you signed up for this. What's the deal with this base? Looks like the info we pulled from the blinds was right. They're upgrading all their vehicle weaponry here. Time to put a stop to it. up on the incoming Kravenovs. Here we go. What's this? You seek a challenge to fill the rush of fear again. I will give you something to fear, Father. Uh, your brother made such promises too. Go on then. Terrify me. Anyone who gets in my way will suffer the same fate as Nedorochi. Is that so? And your mother? She was in the way. I assume Vladimir was no problem for you either. I live for the hunt. If you really are the one. Let us see if you can leave Volgograd unscathed. Oh my god. His entire family. All dead. 
Don't know why we expected anything else from Craven. Good riddance. The city's safe. Marco was taken to the raft before he could find her. I need to make sure she's safe. Maybe there's more crystals back by where it all started. There's another crystal, but no sand minions? Not that I'm complaining. Where am I? Where are That light. Hello? Giant spikes! Is the crystal at the center? It's crumbling! Gotta keep it up! His subconscious is starting to fight back! There's the crystal. I tried to be the best dad for you, Kimia. I really did. All I can do is hope they didn't hit you and that you're safe at your mom's. I love you so much, Mia. We'll be together again one day. I know it. Hey, been calling you. My source at the raft told me Marco keeps repeating some address in Queens. Sending it to you now. I think you should check it out. Her mom's. Maybe that's where Kimia is. 
Hey, MJ, you think you could patch me through to Marco at the raft? Hang on while I look into it. Okay, all set. Patching him through now. Spider-Man. Sorry for my... Well, the mess. Thank you. You helped me get my mind right. I'm sorry for not listening. Guess I never got to know the man behind the sand. But I think Kimia's at her mom's. On my way there now. If she's there, do me a favor. Give her those crystals. Something to remember me by. Of course. Take care of yourself, Flint. She's okay. Wish there was more I could do. Maybe I can ask some lawyer friends to help Marco with visitation rights. Civilians are in trouble. I'm coming. Talk about weak. I'm sure he's fine, but 
Give me a call if you see him. Thanks, too. Miles! I've been calling you. For hours. Nothing. You know Miles has been hunting Lee. I'll find him. I'm calling the hospital. I said I'd find him. I've got this under control. All Miles talks about is how to be a better Spider-Man. Not school, not his friends. How to help you. Go help him. Security. Let it work. Maybe one of the others will. One down. I just need to block the rest of them. There. That cleared a small path. Hello? Prisoners? Lee. Was he here? Up and over. Why would Craven lock me up in here? Kenki, I need you, man. What is this? Poison? I have to get out of here. Those generators look like they power the fans. Not 
power up the others. There we go. One more. <coughs> God, what is this stuff? That door. It looks like the only way out. You guys know way out of here? You will never leave this place. It's starting to feel that way. He's above us! Look at all the traps anyway. Testing your blood. That's all of them. There has to be a way out of here. It sounded like they were waiting for me. Door's out. Need to find another way. This place never ends. What if the hunters know who I really am? What if they took off my mask? What if... Genki, can you hear me now? Please. Did they... Did they get to him? Did they get to Mom? Uh, <clears throat> more hunters. Craven is calling for more talent drones upstairs. Craven seems to believe this will be the one. I wonder if he's right. There is an electricity to the air. Yes. After so many have failed, it seems impossible for anything to kill him. I guess we'll see. He's trying to scare us! That looks like an exit. I need to find out why Craven brought me here. Just have to get out of here and call Spider-Man. If he's okay. Okay. What's going on? This is...
is no escape. I tried. I expected you sooner. Where is the energy of youth, huh? Fight to the death. Or die here together. So how many people did you kill before I got here? I didn't have a choice. You always have a choice. Wasting my time fighting weaklings! Prove you are worthy of my life. I understand you want to kill me. But I can't let you do that. What makes you think you deserve to live? I won't die as the man that I was. You are stronger than you are here, little one. You don't get to walk away from what you did. The inner demon? Devil's breath? The city hall bombing? Don't recount my sins to me! I know what you have no idea! But do not underestimate your enemy! Did Craven bring you here? Or was this voluntary? Save your superiority, Pop! Both in this case! You'll never defeat me! Spider-Man doesn't kill! You never fought this one. Bill, come here. Did he disrupt my venom? Sit down. I'll make it quick. Venom's back online. There! Now, show us your full strength! You stay down! Do you feel any regret for what you've done? Whatever I did to you in the past, it's never been personal. I'm sure to you it wasn't. What do you want? An apology? I want you to feel even half the pain you caused me! You are stronger than you fear, little one. But do not underestimate your enemy! Game. 
I'm not really here right now. None of this is real. What's more real than fear? What are you doing to me? Taking a look into your soul, I see a boy terrified of being alone, of failing his family. Keep talking! You're not getting away from me! is you, right? All you do is take. You put me in danger. You put Haley in danger. But for what? What do we get? I... I know I'm... Left behind. That's all we get. Oh, we end up like Finn. Yankee! Yankee! I know I said it wasn't your fault, but... I guess I just mostly felt bad for you. I didn't want you to feel responsible. Especially after... No! Especially after you... Shut up! This ends when you want it to, Miles. You're going to let me in eventually. And until then, struggle. never have let you try. All it's ever done is make me more alone. Put me in more danger. No! I want to protect you! I will! Heard that before. Mean it! Not from you. On the day he died, Mom. your father told me, just that morning, that everything he does... No! No, no, no! Miles, please! I love you! That's enough, Lee! Miles! I said that's enough! You're right. It's more than enough. I have everything I need. Hey, 
Hey there, big man. Man, it feels good to see you. Lots changed since I left. You became a whole hero. But I couldn't save you. Or Finn. If Spider-Man can't protect everyone, who will? No more now. You're more than just Spider-Man. You can try and hide behind that mask, but I know who you are. And what you stand for. I've been watching you. You have? And it hurts. What happened to the boy that I raised? A coward. Stain my family. You don't mean that! And I do. And we all do. You're a failure, Miles. Always will be. No! You'd never say that! None of you would! I'm not... It's time to give up. You give up, Miles. No. Give up! I won't. You give up. You give up. You give up. I'm not doing this anymore. You want to know who I am? I'm the kid whose dad you killed at City Hall. What? He died because you decided your problems were more important than all of those people's lives. Jefferson Davis was a hero who saved people from you. listening to you. Losing my dad? It's not what's holding me back. I was the one doing that. But not anymore. Let them escape! <laughs> that Mr. Negative's near Feast in Chinatown. There's nothing from Miles. What do you think? Miles is fine. We're out looking for him now. Find Lee. Miles has to be there too. Has to be. I'll go check it out. If he so much as laid a hand on Miles. Hello? It's Dr. Connors. Sorry, I asked Harry for your number. <clears throat> I just... Please, come back to the lab. We need to remove the symbiote. The hold that it's already taking on your mind, it's only going to get worse. I'm busy. No one listens.
the best parts of me here. I'm not looking for a fight. Craven, as the other Spider-Man, trapped in an old mansion east of the city. He saved me. Told me to find you. This was the only way I knew how. I owe him my life. And much more. If we hurry... No. You've done enough. You should be proud of him. He reminds me of you. Reminds him of me. He doesn't even know me. Or Miles. A little bit of help now, all of a sudden he's a good guy. As soon as Miles is safe, Lee's going back in a cell. Not now, MJ. Is Spider-Man doing more harm than good? How about now? Now who needs the old Spider-Man? What's so great about the new Spider-Man anyway? He can't even stop some hunters. They destroyed the EMF. Destroyed my life. I'm going to lose May's house because of them and... Craven. Spider will survive. Where is he? Where is Spider Man? Find him yourself. Stay focused. Don't fight. Tell me where he is. I'm assured that material is unbreakable. But I believe anything can be broken.
ending. You destroyed my city! Took the lives of so many people! That was their fate. Just as this is our end. <laughs> Am I too quick for you? Your followers treat you like some kind of god! But you're just a dying old man, looking for a way out! So you know then. Then you know I will not die in a sick bed! Only an equal may taste my last breath! Rip me apart and parade! Your achievement through the streets! Minds? Observe it! Come! Do not hold back! But I hope you're enjoying this. Tonight won't end well for you! I study all of my prey. You are agile, intelligent, vulnerable to emotion! So am I! Do not let the taste of power get to your head. My, my. Show me what you are capable of! Stop hiding! I'll show you what I can do. Let's go! 
down! I can't! Just me. You almost killed him, man. What are you doing? You're in the way, Miles. Always in the way. I could have fixed everything. How? By strangling him? That's not what we do. Don't try to mentor me. You're the one running away from your problems. I need this suit. It makes me a better Spider-Man. You just want it for yourself. All I want is to save you. I'm the hero. I don't get sick. Why are you doing this? I made you! You owe me! I know you don't mean that! All I wanted was to save everyone! MJ! May! All I wanted was to save everyone! MJ! May! Now the city thinks that I'm the problem! You think I'm the problem? But I'm not anymore! I can't let this go! I'm finally everything everyone needs me to be! Yeah! You don't even answer my calls anymore, man! And what about MJ? You could have killed her! I know you're hurting, Pete! But you're better than this! I know. I know. But... No. No! Keep dying. I blame myself for that. They needed a hero, and ah! if I thought some Sue could save him, maybe I'd be in your shoes now. But this kind of power is the reason they're gone. Not you, not me. Shut up! Be stronger than that. This time, you have to save yourself. You will. I'm not losing you, Pete. Yeah. 
me. Come on! I'm stronger than this! You hear me? These last few days. Miles, I'm sorry. Thank you for everything. That's what Spider Man do. <clears throat> Spider Man didn't save me back there, Miles did. <clears throat> what now? I have to talk to Dr. Connors. He said he knows how to destroy it. Wait, what about Harry? Doesn't he kind of need it? His dad is working on another cure. One that doesn't involve aliens. You know, if you need me, I'm just a call away. Well, once I let my mom know this, she still has a son. I know. It's glad to have you back, man. I got the suit off. It's contained, but what do I do now? You bring it to Oscorp Tower. There's a tank there that will subdue it. I have to prep a few things first, but I'll let you know when I'm on my way. One thing before we meet. Now that the symbiote is off of you, how are you feeling? Fine. I'm relieved that it's over. I'm ashamed at what I did. It's not your fault. There's still so much we don't know. Just tell me right away if you feel any changes in mood, behavior... But it's off me. I'm cured, right? Very likely. Yes. Just do your best to keep that thing contained. Copy that! Okay. I've been ignoring the city for too long. I haven't told MJ yet. Hello? MJ, I got the suit off. And I'm so sorry for... Go on. ...for treating you and everyone I care about like absolute crap. I'm heading to Oscorp to store the suit until Dr. Connors and I can figure out what to do. Does Harry know? No. But Norman's been working on an alternate cure that's showing real promise. We can still... We will save Harry. It's a relief to hear you sounding like yourself again. Go wrap things up. I'll see you at home. I've got a lot more apologies to make when this is all settled. One thing at a time. Huh. Please don't. 
don't look like happy plants. Peter, I'm so glad you could help. Clearly we've got a failure to thrive and we haven't yet been able to diagnose the reason. Can you sort it out for us? Thanks. These plants should be doing much better. Something's making them sick. Water quality is crucial. I should analyze that. All right, my little plant friends. What's got you feeling so sick? Looks like you've got some kind of pathogen. But what kind? Got it. Huh. Looks like this pathogen usually affects plants in the river. But fish are immune to it. I think I just found our cure. Let's splice some genes. With a little genetic engineering, I can make you guys immune to this pathogen just like these fish. Now I just need to get a cooperative sample. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Where are you? I promise you'll be back in the water in two shakes of a fin. Come on, guys. Your plant neighbors just need to borrow your jeans. This one won't work. Gotta catch another. Anyone wanna help cure some plants? Wrong species. Go fish. Perfect specimen. That's one slippery sample secured. Now to take it back and splice it with the plants. Huh. All right, my leafy greens. Let's get you feeling better. Need to insert this fish gene. If I splice this fish gene into your plant genes, I can give you guys immunity to this pathogen just like them. You can't understand me, but trust me, it's pretty cool. You're gonna make our community a whole lot healthier. Gotta get them all lined up. Okay, Feast should be able to work with these. Can't wait to see him thriving. You'll be feeling better in no time.
Okay. I'm heading over to Oscorp Tower now. Right. See you there. Listeners, you know, I don't fabricate information just because of my personal need. What I'm hearing, I take no pleasure in delivering. But it's my duty to report it nonetheless. It seems the newer Spider-Man has gone missing. Now, we can all agree these vigilantes need to be brought to justice. But it seems that may never come to pass. A trusted source claims they saw firsthand Spider-Man captured by the hunters. Now, their track record speaks for itself. Should the worst befall this young man, I will be the last person to say, I told you so. Even though I was the first person to say it. Despite my campaign against these dangers to society, I don't wish harm on any other human being. So let us all come together and hope for Spider-Man's sake that he survives this ordeal so he can face the courts and the punitive justice he deserves! Hey, little buddy. series just on New York's music. Its impact, the communities it built, its outright brilliance. It's hard to encapsulate in one photo, but this is bad. stash in the area. I got this down. Another layer of security. This door is reinforced and controlled by an electric overlay. That's one generator up and running. I think we need a little more power just to be safe. Like that's all the stashes. Wait, my suit's singing to another one? It's 
right by where I met up with Funk. Maybe it's Cold's buggy. Should go check with him. today so I can join him. Check my socials for the meetup deeds. We just... We gotta do something, folks. Come on. Let's be heroes. Cassava plants are alive and quite hardy, but grow too slowly for food production. We want to hybridize them with a more productive variety and would welcome your help. Cassava plants growing too slowly, huh? Better head to ESU. A professor there just discovered a new variety that grows impressively fast. They'd make a great hybrid. Their rare variety of the Asian cassava plant grows like crazy. And I'll only need a single leaf to splice with ours. The professor is always looking for practical applications. She'll be super into doing a collab. Oh no. No. Someone stole the cassava? I've got to track down the thieves before they get too far. Maybe there are some traces of pollen still in the air. Got it. Glad this plant is a wind pollinator. It releases so much pollen, I can see the path they took. Now let's see where these pilfering plants went. Huh. There it is. That's like a rock star plant with all that security. Something to plant my fist in your face. I need this plant for an experiment to help feed New York if that means anything to you. No, really. What kind of plant is this? I think it's called the back to jail plant. Now, where is that plant? You couldn't have walked far. All right, buddy. One quick stop at feast, and then we'll get you back home. Glad we nipped this nefarious plant in the bud. 
See what I did there? Yeah, I knew you would. Wait, your name's not Audrey, is it? Parker, stop talking to the plant! Okay, now to borrow a bit of your super special genetic material to help your cousins grow faster. Okay, so we want some extra growth genes from our guest plant. fit together. This should create a cassava that grows more quickly without sacrificing the yield. secure in this workbench until ESU can buff up their greenhouse security. Feast will really be able to improve their crop yield with these new hybrids. Go. He did have a stash here. What is this stash for? These are blueprints to my apartment building. He wouldn't plan a heist there, would he? Better get home quick. doing, Uncle Aaron? I really hope this isn't what it looks like.
pictures of Dad and Uncle Aaron when they were kids. Dad's record player is gone. Did he steal from us, too? That's one of Dad's records. Christmas Baby. I really hit the jackpot here. Uncle Aaron's still here? Can't let him take any more stuff. without breaking parole. You said you were retiring the Prowler. You lied to me. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slow down there. Mijo? Mom? We were going to surprise you, but... Okay, what's going on here? When you started helping out your uncle, I was inspired. Despite all the things he did, you forgave him. So I decided to do the same and help him out by co-signing the lease on this apartment. Thanks again, Rio. <laughs> It'll be nice to have family close by again. I meant what I said. Prowler's in the rearview mirror. I want us to have a future together. Be a family. I also said I'd find a way to thank you, didn't I? What is it? Some tech I was prototyping before I got caught up with Roxxon. Could come in handy. I guess Uncle Aaron really is making room for the future. One floor up. Can't wait to try this tech out.
finally got it off. My hero. Harry. We've got to destroy it. It's too dangerous. I don't want you to lose yourself. Like I did. Pete. Please. You don't understand. Connor said it was... I saved your life! And you won't save mine? Do you want me to die?
to shoot this game is when we found it. And I never should have brought it anywhere close to you. I'm sorry. This is all my fault, all right? Not yours. Not yours. Is there anything left of him? Yeah! <laughs> 
drenched of a perfect death. Drenched in fire and blood. Will you give it to me? You destroy our work. Hurt our friends. Then come. Let your vengeance feast upon my flesh. Yes! Make this my final hunt! The end of all things! Oh, you toy with me! The spider could not satisfy me, but you... Still. Don't be scared, honey. You finally have the power to do what we've always wanted. We're going to heal the world. How? Let me 
show you. find you out there. Our EMF badges were RF enabled. If Harry's still wearing his badge, I can use Oscorp satellite dishes to find him. Please be wearing that badge. Great. Getting a strong signal that way. Time to move. signal is moving around. It's got to still be on Harry. Jerk to Harry when I had that suit. I need to find him, apologize, and try to get through to him. Closing in on you, buddy. Help's on the way. Hang in there. We'll get this thing off you. And I'll work with your dad and Dr. Connors to get you fixed up. Somehow. The signal stopped moving. Stay there, buddy. Let's pinpoint his location a bit more. He's got to be under that overpass. What is all this stuff? Harry, you back here? Damn, just his badge. Maybe he's still around here somewhere. I know he'll listen to me if I can just get through to him. Yes, there you are. Harry? It's me. Hey, Harry. Can you hear me? Listen, we're gonna figure out a cure. Something better. Symbiote somehow? 
terrific! How do I stop them without hurting them? Looks like I freed one of them! Just stay calm! Don't move! You'll be okay! I hope... These things are brutal. I'm gonna need Miles' help. Miles, tell me something good. Miles, there's trouble with Harry. He got the suit back, and it changed him. He's turning people into symbiotes somehow. I'm holding my own, but it's like punching molasses. We've got to find a better way to get these things off of people. Call me. I gotta find Harry and stop him before this gets worse. Well, you sure you're okay? Miles, I need help with these things. Got your messages. Sorry, I've been looking for my mom. Assume you saw Craven's dead? What? No. You think it was Harry? Maybe. Probably. We've got to stop him. Okay, I've got an idea. When you were under the influence, a certain sounds made you weak. That bell. But we can't just carry it around. No, but I have this mixing app on my phone. I can recreate the bell sonic elements. Then we can use it against Harry and his army. That's genius. Glad you decided to study music tech. Feel free to share that opinion with the college acceptance board. What's up, Yankee? There you are. Your mom and we I were are... looking for you. And I was looking for you. I texted you I was okay. Well, I didn't get it because we've been on the subway looking for you. We're glad you're okay. I'll ride with your mom back home. Can you meet us? Gotta deal with something first, but I'll be there as soon as I can. Okay. Gotta recreate the sound of Craven's bell. What sounds can I use around here? Serious echo chamber. Could come in handy. Perfect. Same shape as Craven's bell. Even if it's a tenth the size. Maybe I can pilot the boat into that hangar. That container looks promising. If I drop it, I'll get some nice resonance. Recorded it. Whoa! Symbiotes! How'd they get uptown so fast? Sorry I punched you. Just stay down until I'm done here. Pete was right. These things are fierce. Gotta remember there are people in there.
Better finish off this mix before more of them show up. There's the engine, but no power. Now to ring the bell. Hmm. Almost. Need some echo. Rico! Plenty of echo in that hangar. Yes! Super echo recorded. Almost done. Just need a low frequency boost. With a pulse. Something like... A helicopter's blades. Gotta get up there. Here, what I miss? Very funny. Let me transfer these sounds. Hopefully, this will. Come on, come on! Go! <laughs> nice job, Miles. Now let's save these people. Nice one. <laughs> That's more like it. Drop the pin for EMTs. They'll take care of these people. Good thinking. Subway is messed up. The train is totally stuck. Like goo on the window. Yankee? For Douglas Circle. There's a bunch of us. Yankee, we're on our way. Great. Get here, mijo. I love you. I love you too. Why is Harry doing this? Creating all these things. I don't think Harry's the one doing it. At least not the Harry I know. Then who is? The symbiote? Yeah. I'm no expert, but it seems like it's trying to make itself a new home. Find him later. Right now, we need to save your mom and Ganky. Watch yourself! Harry looked a lot different than you did when you had to do. I think that would have been me eventually if you hadn't saved me. You gotta check in with mom and Ganky. They're not answering. We gotta get in there. We will! As soon as we clear the area! 
What if they turned into one of these things? Don't think about that. Let's just fight these things and get in there. That's it. Spider-Man, it's you. Yeah, the doors are stuck. We gotta move these tendrils somehow. You need to hurry. All these tendrils are alive and connected. There's got to be a central nerve somewhere. Bingo! Let's hit a nerve. He's pulling back, but not enough. They're still trying to get into the trains. There's got to be another nerve cluster around here. Ah! Too big for a single sonic burst. Think we can chain some together? Yeah, but they'll need time to sync up. How much time does it need? Bro, did you hear that? How much time? A minute? Maybe a little more? Keep your spidey sense sharp. This might get wild. These things really don't want us here. Get to your mom and Genki. Spider-Man. You're okay. What happened? I took your advice. I let go of some things that didn't serve me. Come on. Okay. That really sucks. I thought I was gonna die. My life was flashing before my eyes. You're good, man. That time when we went mini golfing for my birthday and I got that hole in one to win, I cheated. I could pick up the ball and dropped it in when you weren't looking, and I. You were eight. And honestly, I never liked the sandwiches you traded for at lunch, but I went along with it because I knew how much you loved my mom's banchan, and I'm seeing someone new, by the way. Her name's Andy, and she's great, and please don't kill me, but I just thought of a sequel for Sweet Nanagon, and I... Wait, wait, wait. Andy, from Kim? Oh, she's real cool. <laughs> Thanks for saving us. Look, I'm sorry I've been so busy. I'll do better. Make the time to hang out. Be careful. Genki, let's get uptown. I'll make you something good for dinner. Next step? Find Harry. I'll take downtown. I got uptown. While I'm looking for Harry, I should check in on some other things.
once the epicenter for New York tour. Now, the scene of a deadly bloodbath. Unless you've been living under a rock, you've seen the photos released from Times Square, where we've learned Sergei Kravenov, also known as Craven, leader of the hunt, has been brutally murdered by a monstrous unknown assailant. The most interesting piece of information to arise out of this catastrophe the horrendous behemoth behind the homicide was sporting the same damn spider logo of New York's own Spider-Man. The day I prophesized and rightly feared may have come to pass. Spider-Man has perhaps transformed into a merciless creature capable of apocalyptic levels of destruction. This is the result of unchecked power and unsupervised will. Sure that if this is indeed Spider-Man, he's most likely prepared a hit list of those he's perceived to have wronged him. Dear listeners, I can only assume I'm high on that list. If this animal decides to exact his vengeance upon me, may my story be a lesson to you all. Do not let my life be in vain. Band together, and we can stand up against these formidable powers once and for all. But until that day comes, I'll be fighting alongside you for the good of our people and the good of our nation. Yankee? What's up? Hey, Mr. Parker. Um, you've been dealing with those fire cult guys, right? The followers of the flame? Yeah. I'm seeing reports on social media say they spotted a few of them on a rooftop in Brooklyn. I'll send you the details. I'll check it out. Thanks, Genki. Is the Crimson Hour about to start? <gasps> Check it out. Can't let up. Gotta save these people. Maybe Harry's back at his place. Can't hurt to check.
Another nest. Okay, let's make some noise. Spider-Man. Whoa! That was messed up! Are you a doctor? No, an EMT. Spider-Man was hitting you pretty hard. Hey, if that's what he had to do to get it off me, I'm grateful. <laughs> Mr. Osborne, are you okay? I'm worried about Harry. I have no one else to talk to. He's, um, not himself right now. And it's all my fault. It's mine, too. Harry told me about his treatment. I knew something was off, but I was just happy he was back. I should have told him that more. You still can. I'll let you know if I hear from him, Mr. Osborne. Okay. I appreciate it, Peter. Another nest. Last one was rough. What are we supposed to do? I don't know. Just hold the perimeter. Two hearts on this nest? As if it wasn't horrifying enough.
let up. Gotta save these people! That's another nest. Stay in control, Pete. You can do this.
news, folks. Good news. OG Spider-Man looks to be finally back to his senses, free of that black suit. <sighs> Bad news. Same reports that whatever that black suit was may now be spreading through parts of the city. The two connected, maybe. But right now isn't the time for speculation. It's the time for action. We're getting scattered reports of folks going missing. Our favorite subway worker, Dennis, is running a database of missing persons. Check the description for details. Let's crowdsource this, everyone. Get as much data in there as we can. We can't leave the protection of New York just to the Spider-Man anymore. Let's be heroes. Again? Don't freak out, Pete. Let's clean this place up. <laughs> <laughs>
One's got a cute backpack. You're not going to believe this, but as always here, it is absolute truth. Gooey black monsters have begun popping up around the city. I repeat, monsters are in our city, propagating and disseminating to ends unknown. We've heard numerous accounts of missing persons, families torn apart, friends and loved ones mysteriously disappearing. But now believe we can shed some light on the culprits. These vile creatures appear to be abducting us. For what nefarious purpose, we don't know yet. Now, more than ever, we need to look out for each other. Don't go out alone, unless it's an emergency. You could- I've got this! Get clear! This is your fault, isn't it? Where'd those symbiotes come from? Don't worry. I'll get you to an ambulance in no time. Oh my god. Thank you. We're almost there. There. You're all set. And I hope the worst is over now. Bless you, Spider-Man. That's all of them. Keeping watch on that scrapyard nearby. And there's some burned up papers about Oscorp. I better get down there. Great, they're still setting up. But this doesn't look like an Oscorp property. What are they. The Crimson Hour won't be long now, my embers. Can you feel it? Soon enough. <laughs> All those innocent people. Gotta disable these bombs before they can hurt the civilians in those buildings. I can do this. So this is the Crimson Hour. Burning Brooklyn and everyone in it to the ground. Way too late to try to evacuate everyone. That rooftop bomb alone could take out the entire apartment building. We all knew this day would come. Or at least the worthy did. The unworthy? 
You'd think the unworthy in those buildings would have noticed us by now. As far as they're concerned, we're cleaning this place up. You should have seen it before that. I guess even if they did call someone, it's not like they'd be able to stop this now. No. No, it's not. <laughs> That sound. the rest of the neighborhood. It's 
gonna hit the tankers. You've stopped trains before, right? Yeah. No brakes. Great. Not working! Got any ideas? We derail it. How are we supposed to do that? Doing this? Really? Last shot. You're gonna have to make up a new prophecy. Before you and I met, one of my embers told me about his work at Oscorp and this treatment that they had discovered. Who cares, right? Fancy suit that can make you big and strong is just another case of the unworthy trying to cheat death and play God. That's what I thought, too. But... When devils attack the city... Like I prophesied! Oscorp sent out some of this treatment for safekeeping. I knew it was meant for me. That's what all this was for. And when the crimson hour rolls over this earth, it shall bring truth. Judgment. And carnage. underground just like last time but I'll find him you could have killed him but you saved me instead I told you I'm trying to save the most lives and you still do that pretty well you gonna turn me in now I'll let you know when I find him Stop them from taking innocent lives in the process. Hey, Yuri. Do you want help tracking down the flame? Thanks, but I need some time to myself. Besides, we've taken down a good chunk of his operation. So he'll be going back to the drawing board. I'll start checking his old aliases. 
Archie Abel, Walter Wackman, Cletus Cassidy. But this could take months, maybe even years. I'll be ready when you've got something. Thanks. I couldn't turn her in after she saved me. Maybe I... Ugh. We've got a prowler on our hands. to set the stage. A train line in Brooklyn. Presumably, precious containers carrying commodities that we rely on. Spider-Man and that new vigilante. Oh, did I just spoil the play? Can you see where this is going? I feel sorry for anyone awaiting a shipment today. It's not coming. You... Hey, need a dance partner? <laughs> Oh, you're done now. Thanks for the assist. Just trying to keep up with you. Think of this.
No sign of Harry. What's that? Happy birthday, Em. They say time heals all wounds. That's a lie. Every day without you is worse than the last. If I lose Harry, I... I don't know what I'll do. Norman's really hurting. I need to find Harry and save him. Haven't heard from MJ in a while. I should give her a call. You do? <laughs> You've hit the nail on the head. Finally! Top story. Everybody's talking about it. This is editor material. Editor? Congratulations. Your first assignment, write more juicy stuff by tomorrow morning. Drama, controversy, just like this. Like this. Get writing! <sighs> MJ. I, uh, didn't get fired from the Bugle. In fact, I think I, I got a promotion. Hey, that's what you wanted, right? Yeah, I, I thought it was. Then that's... Great. Hey, listen. Something's gone wrong with Harry. What... what happened? Well... Hang on, someone's at the door. It's kind of hard to explain. Just promise me you'll stay away from him, okay? MJ? Pick up! Hey, it's MJ. You can leave Damn a message, it. but why would you? If it's important, just, you know, text. Please be okay. Spider-Man, how are you feeling? Anxious? Panicked? I meant, uh, physical symptoms. Soreness? Fatigue? Yes. Wait, symptoms? I've been looking through years of research notes. The symbiote channels a... Uh, collective consciousness. That hive mind I was in. Was, is optimistic. It may still be inside you. What? Nothing to panic about, but perhaps you should come to the lab for some tests. Can't, Doc. Bigger problems. Gotta go. MJ! I should have been home! MJ! Where's... Harry. Pete? You look tense. Coffee? We need to talk. You must get tired making the world a better place every single day. But I can help. All you have to do is let me. This isn't you. Wrong. This is the real me. I finally have the power to realize our vision. Are you giving up on me? Harry, we need to get that thing off you. Do not. Call us a thing. Harry, we are not Harry. We are.
goodbye so you can be happy! I didn't realize! MJ, you can quit! I can figure something out! I can't trust you! I can only rely on us! No! I'm sorry, MJ! I was wrong! You don't have to trust me! But please, trust yourself! Let me do what I have to do! You're right! I've been selfish! I was so wrapped up in my own life, I never thought about yours! But let's handle this MJ's way! Let me help you fight this! you. I need you. Don't lie to me! Pete! I need you too! to the symbiote. For months I've been trying to be something I'm not. 
I'm glad you're back. Sorry. It wasn't you. And I wasn't me earlier. Pete, I... Pete, it... It was like some kind of hive mind in there. I saw you. And Harry, he, he was going after this rock. Miles is at City Hall. Go. I love you. I love you. I'm back. Where were we? Do you think this is Harry? It has to be. I just saw him in Queens. He turned MJ into one of those symbiotes. Worse. What? She's okay. She broke out of it. Luckily, faster than I did. Connors thinks I had the suit on too long, and now some of it is left inside of me. You really meant it when you said things were complicated. One thing at a time. See you soon, Miles. I hear that. See you. Reminds me, I owe someone else a call. Peter? Hey, Ms. Morales. You, uh, make it home safe? I was just, you know, I, I wanted to make sure... We're fine, we're fine. And Peter, we're fine, too. But next time, answer my calls. Trust me, I'll be on my best behavior. Hi, Ms. Morales. Me again. Anyway, like I was saying, trust me. I'll be on my best behavior. You'd better be. Now go help my son. Gotta get to City Hall and help Miles. research blog from a top Morningside professor. She's calling the creatures we're seeing throughout the city symbionts, because they live symbiotically with their host. Folks, this is scary. This is real. But keep courage. Check the description for a map of shelters throughout the city and evacuation plans for the elderly and high risk. The Spider-Men are out there fighting for us, but we gotta keep meeting them halfway. We'll get through this. Together. Yeah. <laughs> 
miles! We need to hurry! Not the pressure, you guys, but it's not sounding good in there. We're working on it! All clear. Let's get him out of there. Still some of this thing inside him. I see. I think I can clear it out of him. But only if I go to the source. I'm going in with you. What's the plan here, Lee? Find Spider-Man. All of this dark matter should lead us toward him. All right. On my way. Where are we, anyway? We are inside Spider-Man's mind. I've seen what those creatures do to people around the city. They get in your head. Twist your desires. Mad they stole your routine? I know you're joking, but you're making my point. This thing fears my power for some reason. And I, we, are the only ones who can find where it lives. So we clear this thing out at the root, and Spider-Man's free? That's the plan. All right, then. In the symbiote, take back control, use our powers to save Spider Man. Where do we start? We have to find the source of his pain. Follow me. I'll try and lead you to where it's darkest. But I can't promise what we'll find. Just for them to escape and cause more pain. Part of the 
job. He knows that. What is? Believing in second chances. That's enough. I get it. Did you do that? No. The symbiote. It killed them all. The problem is solved. That's not what Pete thinks. No. But it might be how he feels. All these villains. He really thought the suit could solve it all. Is that... You caused a lot of pain, man. The debt I will spend the rest of my life repaying. There's something up ahead. You're close. Hayes House. I haven't asked Pete about her in a long time. What's wrong with me? When you get caught up in one part of your life, it's easy for the rest to fall away. of you. I never meant for her to get hurt. This is your chance to make it up to her then. I feel something upstairs. does have the same effect in here. Yeah. I guess it does. <laughs> Looks like we're at feast. I built my life around this place. This will probably be the closest I'll ever get to seeing the inside of it again. Not that I deserve to. Lee, why did you do it? What did you want? Revenge. Norman Osborne's the reason my parents are dead. So I dedicated my life to making his hell. <sighs> I'm sorry, Miles. Up there. That's the source. If we clear this out, we just might be able to save him. transfer all of my power into the symbiote. I think I can neutralize it. And free Peter. What'll happen to you? I guess we'll find out. <clears throat> well, well, if this is my last chance to say anything to you, forgive you. It's just not in me. But I can't carry this hate for you anymore, man. So let's set things right. You and me.
like this. Why didn't you give me this power sooner? I could have used it. I didn't give you those. You didn't? Things my way sometime. I'm not sure I'd make a convincing hero. Won't know until you try. Miles, help! I'm coming. like it had an effect. Wait, you two work together? I wasn't about to let you die. Miles, that's... After so many times saying it, thank you seems soft. It's okay. I know. I don't deserve that, kid.
right, guy. Let's try this again. We lost you. Guess I should thank you. I spent years of my life consumed with vengeance. I lost everything for it. You two reminded me that that's not who I am. When you help someone, you help everyone. Where are you gonna go? To set things right. Your way. Wow. Reforming your greatest enemy. Can't say I've ever done that. Maybe MJ was right. Why would the city need me when it has you? I don't know. This city still looks like a two Spider-Man job to me. Let's get out of here. Any sign of Harry? Not yet! Ran into a speed bump. I think Miles just saved my life. What? What happened? There was symbiote left inside of me. It started taking over, but Morton Lee gave me his power. It feels different. Like the voices are gone, but the power is still there. That's incredible. And Pete, just wanted to let you know, I got my byline pulled off that article. And gave my landlord notice. Does that mean? It means if the world is going to get turned into an alien wasteland, there's no one I'd rather be gooed up with than you. Ah, the feeling's mutual! <laughs> Keep an eye out for Harry. I'll let you know if I hear anything. Okay, while I look for Harry, I should see what else needs some spidey help. Better check out that nest and get ready for some grim dark.
Trying to move the gallery passes when they attacked. Dr. Connors? Hello? He's here in my lab. Gotta call Miles and get over there quick. Miles, meet me at Connors' lab. I think Harry's there, and it doesn't sound good. On my way. Should be a shortcut to Connor's lab near Central Park. I've got to find a way to get through to Harry. He's in there. I know I can reach him. Just hope he doesn't hurt Connor's. of the most unprecedented time in modern history. A hero rises to change his costume. What award show is Spider-Man hosting that he feels the need to change his outfit so frequently instead of providing any kind of meaningful assistance to the authorities? I don't know what his game is, but he seems to be more pretty. If that's a nest, I better check it out. Where's the heart of the nest? Need to move that car. Okay, let's do this. Okay. Calming breath. I'm ready. Thanks, Spider-Man. Take care of yourselves, okay?
Spider-Man! Another oh, nest. Those things freak me out. Let's clean this place up. Thanks, Spidey. You got it. Find an indoor gym till it's safe out here. Another nest. Where'd it go? Ugh. As if these things weren't creepy enough already. Sonic Burst's ready. I'm... sort of...
focus, Pete! Ah! Moved again! You're safe now. Take a breather, and when you're ready, get inside. Looks like it's up on the roof!
Huh. This one's making me uncomfortable. Buddy. the bus. Gotta save those people from the symbiotes. <gasps> you may have just found the world's smallest thief. Like you have a dark past. Coincidence, but you're dressed just like my friend.
spider bot. Wherefore art thou? <laughs> Black is the new black. Rough. Hello? Anyone here? Stay in control, Pete. You can do this. Keep them away from the heart! It's the last nest. Time for the city to start healing.
I say it? Kind of cute. do with that thing I think we're about to find out you need to know Harry's gone host and symbiote are perfectly fused I'll find a way to save him you can't but you can still stop the symbiote how by killing the host Please, save my boy. seeing what I'm seeing right now. We've got a lot of New Yorkers being attacked by these things. I'm on it. Stay safe out there. All he needed was that meteorite. Now he can heal the world. This isn't what we meant. <laughs>
folks, listen up. If you can hear this podcast and you're still on the island of Manhattan, shelter in place. Seal the windows, bolt the doors, do not leave your homes. First responders are organizing emergency medical and focused evac. Feast is delivering food and survival supplies. Check my socials for up to the minute route info and sound off in the comments with any reports of folks in need of aid. People trapped inside that store! Civilians are in trouble. I'm coming! Save those people from the symbiotes! Stay calm, everyone! I can handle this! Can anyone help? Ah!
Miles, we have to talk. No kidding. There are nests popping up everywhere. Sending you coordinates now. Got it. Watch yourself out there, man. This is something else. I'm Harry. I'll find you, buddy. I'll find you. Somewhere. That suit's not an alien, is it? <laughs> it's time for a Miles Morales original, you know? One of one. <laughs> it looks good. What happened, man? Harry got the meteorite. I, uh... I couldn't stop him. Connor said we can't save him, so we have... To I can't lose him, Miles. I can't do this again. I saw May when I was... in your head. It's not your fault, Pete. She wanted to save you. To save all of us. She never thought about herself. Even when she was struggling to breathe. If May... my dad... If they were here, they would want us to stop thinking about them. They'd want us to help people. To fight. Harry's still in there. And we're gonna fight like hell to get him back. Call the play, coach. Let's split up. Cover more ground. You find the meteorite, I'll clear that nest out. You got it, Spider-Man. started. Spider-Man, you think I'm almost done clearing 
this net. But Pete, we're hearing these voices. Oh, I hear them too. Keep looking for that meteorite. Don't let him get in your head. That's not Harry talking. Right. You're right. Call me when you finish up. Stay focused, Pete. He's in trouble. Pete, I saw the meteorite. It's under the Harlem subway station, next to the bridge. Heading there now! Wait for me though, man. Harry, he's after you. I have to go help Haley, but just wait, all right? Whoa, whoa, back up! What happened? I got sucked into the hive mind. Saw this vision of the meteorite underground. But I've got a bad feeling. You think Harry's there? I'm serious, Pete. Just give me ten minutes. You cannot do this alone. Right. Call me when you're done. Sorry, Miles, but I can't waste any time. There's the subway entrance. Miles has to be right. That's where the meteorite is. Just have to clear out this bridge. Everyone stay in your cars. I won't let them hurt you. Harry! <laughs> Up! I know you're here! You found us. Yes! I'm here, buddy! Help. I know! Just hang on! I'm coming! Come on! 
They're coming out of the subway tunnel! The meteorite has to be underground! Venom! Please talk to me! I have to get underground! I can't leave these people behind! Subway tunnel. Hey, everything all good with Haley? Not yet, but you still owe me a few more minutes. Hang tight. Haley, no. What are you doing here? I was... I was trying to save... <gasps> You're incredible. I, I like you so much, and I think you like me. Do you want to go out? Hey, on a... Date? <laughs> Is that a yes? <laughs> well, it's a date then. After all this is over. I talked to Dr. Connors. He says you're too far gone, but I know that's not true. Harry, I messed up. I was terrible to you. Your dream, our dream, healing the world. I'm sorry. Meteorite! 
I'm so close! Seeing a rock. No. Hold on. I'm nearly to you. Thanks for coming, Pete. We want to show you something. Harry, what are you? We are healed. Finally free. <laughs> I need to meet up at May's house. What's going on out there, guys? It's the meteorite that the symbiote arrived in. He's using it to transform the city. I know where it is. And we're gonna steal it. Time to game plan. I'm in. See you guys at home.
listeners, I implore you. Stay inside your homes. Lock the doors. Board the windows. Trust no one. The city is overrun with a miasma of massive, oppressive tendrils emanating from the ground beneath our feet, spawning creatures from what feels like hell itself. They're capturing us, converting us, and will soon overtake us. Don't give them the chance. While the government sits on its hands, my loyal listeners have taken to the forums, looking for any signs of weakness these creatures show. We will defend ourselves. We know we can't count on the Spider-Men to save us. If this last week's events have proven anything beyond a shadow of a doubt, it's that the heroes make things worse, not better. In the meantime, stay safe. Remain vigilant. We will get through this. New York does not go down without a fight. And I will be there, right next to you, on the front lines. Godspeed. And may we all see tomorrow. Central Park Reservoir. The water system. Pumping goo everywhere. Adding more and more people to the hive mind. If all those symbiotes get out of Manhattan. Goodbye, Earth. Hello, planet goo. The meteorite is the source of all the power, right? Creating goo, creating symbiotes. But it was useless until Harry repaired it. Yeah. And that particle accelerator is what damaged it in the first place. Cut off a piece at low power. Right, so what if we crank the power up? Like way past 11. Might destroy it. And free everyone connected to the hive mind. Theoretically. But that reservoir's gotta be mobbed with symbiotes. And you know Harry's not gonna let that rock out of his sight. Unless he sees something he wants more. Me. Just, you know, for illustrative purposes. Harry's still Harry. He thinks he's healing the world. But the dream isn't complete without... His best friend beside him. I can lead Harry away from the meteorite. And I can handle all the symbiotes. Well, I... Grab the space rock for illustrative purposes. All right, fire up the accelerator. No more hive mind. World saved. We all get churros? <laughs> Theoretically. Pete, what Connor said about Harry being too far gone. If you can't save him, are it you won't ready? come to that. You two will be able to destroy the rock in time. Let's heal the world. For real this time. <laughs> so the meteorite is somewhere in that thing? So are Harry and his friends. Here. I figured you could use a sonic touch. They're just standing there. What are they waiting for? Look, I can't thank you both enough for everything. Come on, bro. We're the spider team. Don't anyone forget it? Gonna sit in there and play with your pet rock all night? It's you and me, Harry. Like we always wanted. Here's 
use the thing though. You're gonna have to catch me first. Meteorites connected to the rest of the hive. Just a normal rock. I can also end the world. alive. Looks like 
My exit's just past that chopper. Your plus one isn't invited to our high school reunion, Harry! Harry!
abandoned us while we were fighting for our lives. I was trying to save you! Did you feel like that to us? Dropping in. Get free Harry with more anti venom. Heal the world with you! Not like this! The meteorite. You took it from us!
with your stuff. Yeah, well, they started it. doesn't belong to you! Trust me! Don't want your future! We need to get up to him. I made a promise, Harry, that I'd fight for you! You don't care about us. You don't know us. I know you talk to your mom, just like I talked to my dad. Remember? I wouldn't be saying right now. That we are so close.
No, we don't. It'll kill them. And then it'll kill you. Let's heal the world, Pete. Together. Yeah! 
some room. I don't know if it's gonna work, but I gotta try. Pulse is weak. We gotta move. What have you done? What have you done to him? I'm so sorry. I'm coming with you. Wait. There are traces of brain activity, but his chances of coming back are very slim. Just keep him alive.
Get the G serum ready. ASAP. For the last few years, tragedy has tried to tear the city apart. But we somehow kept going. We battled sickness, evil, Cataclysm. We are tired, anxious, stressed, numb. But we have never lost hope. The city needs to heal. We're all ready to return to normal, but what is normal? What if it no longer exists? Over the last half hour, I've talked about how these events have changed me. But what about you? In this ongoing series, I will be talking with people throughout the city, exploring our new behaviors, new routines, new thoughts and feelings. I hope you'll join me on this journey. This has been Mary Jane Watson, and you're listening to The New Normal. Episode one, done. Nice. <laughs> I don't know. Ooh, are these good to go? In a minute, I want to show you something first. Okay. It has molasses in it. Yum, I'll take those. <laughs> Thanks again for the donation, Peter. Have you talked to Miles about? Not yet. You ready? Uh, Miles. I've been meaning to talk to you uh, about something. Uh, I mean, I have been talking to you all, all the time. It's, it's, it's great uh, to talk. So many good talks. I just haven't been talking to you about what I should have been talking to you about. Pete. Uh, wait, uh, let me start again. I got this. All of it. Go be Peter Parker for a while. Are you, are you sure it's, it's a big city? I can handle it. As long as I can still call you for advice. You don't need it. Maybe not now, but there'll come a time. I'm here for you, always. Big bro. 
see him.
What do you want? The Spider-Men. You know who they are, don't you? Why? They ruined my son. Good. We all have to experience loss. Even you, Norman. What are you writing? The final chapter. Hi. I hope you're hungry. Food's almost ready. Why don't you go show her your essay? He worked so hard on it. Some guy in Harlem, probably seen him volunteering in the city, helping out his city council mom, and trying to live up to his hero dad. Yeah. Haley, this is Albert. Uh, hi, nice to meet you. Oh, and uh, <laughs> this is my daughter, Cindy. What's up, New York? Welcome back, Dana Club. We did it. We survived the impossible. Drove back a friggin' alien invasion. And we did it together as heroes. Spider-Man led the way, and every day New Yorkers rose to the challenge. Today, I am so pleased to talk with one of those heroes. Author, journalist, and avid motorcyclist, 
Please welcome Mary Jane Watson. Thanks, Danica. Please call me MJ. MJ it is. So, I ate up your book about Simcaria in a single sitting. Thank you for giving this to the world. It's so important. I heard we're going to get even more of your words in the form of a new project. Can you tell us more about it? Happy to. I've been thinking a lot about what's really important. Nothing will make you rethink your life like a citywide alien invasion, right? Relatable. And I realized how important the truth is. I started a podcast called The New Normal. I don't know where New York is headed, but I'm looking forward to finding out. With all of you out there, I want to be honest and report what's really happening in the city. Straight up, no exaggerations, no clickbait, you know? I know exactly what you mean. When you let that junk creep in, it takes over the truth, warps it into something else, like a, a, like a symbiote. Mary Jane Watson, everybody. Any last notes you'd like to leave us with? Stay safe out there. Oh, and if you have motorcycle insurance, make sure it includes a villain damage clause. I could feel the pain in your voice there. I'm working through it. Danica Hart and Mary Jane Watson signing off. Been on the classic look, huh? I got it. The message was using some kind of qubit based algorithm, but I built a decoder table, which was actually kind of genius of me because. Cool, cool. What does the message say? It's an address. Looks like an old subway terminal. Been out of service since the 80s. Think it's a trap? Nah, doesn't have a trappy vibe. What kind of vibe then? I have no idea. And that's what scares me. Seeing this? Bro, what the hell is happening? <laughs> Look at this, a spider hero. We were all saved. Um, hi? Who are you? Me? I'm just a bartender who does favors for people every now and then. And I've learned that rogue spider bots are dangerous and bad for business. Let me take those off your hands. Whoa! Thank you, Spider-Man. We can always count on you to do the right thing. You're welcome. And if Miguel comes looking for these, tell him finders keepers. Wait, who's Miguel? <laughs> Whoa. 
What the hell was that? I, uh, wish I knew. Perfect for Robbie. You know, for a place where everyone's comfortable calling out when something's wrong, people here sure hate admitting when they're wrong. The writer in me does love the iron. Okay. I put it in the garage for you. It's from Norman Osborne. Oh, interesting. Thanks for letting me know. Time's over. Hey, Mr. Robertson. The photo went through? I tried to close my submissions out with the banger. You can call me Robbie Miles. And yeah, it's fantastic. But I'm a bit surprised you're stopping now since you left out two of the biggest parts of New York. The Spider-Man. You really think so? Everything I see in these photos. All the stories and history and life. None of it would still be here if it wasn't for the Spider-Man. I hope they know that. They probably forget it sometimes. But I think they do. Well, thanks for the photos, Miles. You're a natural at this. That means a lot. Thanks, Robbie. Symbiote's cocky to be dragging people off the street like that. Best Finn. Trying to make a city we both be proud of. Can you smell the change in the air? It's fresh and clean. A new day for this world. Staring down the face of the apocalypse offers a new perspective on life. Time to let go of old grievances. Rearrange priorities. 
while the world waited with bated breath to see if they would be next. New York stood tall and held the line. We did not acquiesce after we take a moment to celebrate the freedom we fought so hard to retain. We must then turn our sights to the people responsible for putting us in harm's way to begin with. I'm talking about Oscorp and, of course, the spider man. You're going to hear a lot of conflicting reports and lies surrounding the events of last week. But let me assure you, this is still just the facts here. So let's lay them out. Spider-Man was seen wearing a black suit. Then a monster appears wearing a similar suit. Then our proud city is overrun by similar monsters. Oscorp is claiming it's Spider-Man's fault for stealing Oscorp's research. That doesn't surprise me. But Oscorp needs to be held accountable for creating these damn creatures in the first place. This is what happens when corporations try to play God and individuals overreach. Of course, hoping for legal ramifications for wrongdoers is like hoping for an ice cream shop in the desert. We must not forget where the blame lies. We can't forgive either. But for now, enjoy life. We're lucky to have it. Hell of a son you raised, Jeff. Parker Lux back with a vengeance. this plants in a thumb drive they say you should never plug in a drive of unknown origin but I know Norman I think Peter <laughs> I put this together for you because I knew when we got through this crazy time Whenever we got through it, I wanted you to have these. And I wasn't positive I'd be here to give them to you myself. <sighs> Harry. After the Emily May Foundation was destroyed by Craven's hunters, I went to see what I could recover before it got boarded up. In the box, you'll find a piece of bark from my mom's tree and one of May's blossoms. And I thought, Gene splice them together. We might get a hardy enough plant to produce seeds. Wow. Well, okay.
I knew you could do it, Pete. Now, you know those little bee drones we salvaged from the field studies? We just leveraged their relocation data sets to plant those seeds around the city. You're some kind of genius, Harry Osborne. Let's get those bees working. I know, I know. It'll be years before we see the results. And who's to say where you and I will be a week from now, let alone years from now? Which is why I did this simulation to show you. So Emily and May will live on in the city, and of course, in us. I love you, Pete. I really do. And I know the Foundation didn't end up going the way I'd hoped, but there's still no one I'd rather have tried it with. I bet by the time you get this, we'll have already started a new Foundation. Just me and you. From scratch. Go us. Go us. Oh! One last thing. I... Got a little something for you. We're in good health. Love you.